Why, hello there. Hi, everybody. My name is Ojax. You're welcome. We're starting another new game today. Two of them this week, yeah? <laughs> Two new games this week. We're doing Band and Theater tonight. Yeah, good? Good. All right, so probably going to get this done on like one stream. It, it's not like a turbo long video game. It's like we can probably get the whole game like 100% in all in one setting tonight, hopefully. That's what I'm planning on doing. Yeah, it'll be good. Um, Now, I've already, I, I myself haven't played this game personally myself, but I've watched other people play it, so I kind of already know what kind of shit goes on in it. However, 
what I'm gonna do because of that is I'm gonna let chat pick shit. It, 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 this game, for in case you don't know, it's like a it's like a fucking like visual novel slash like puzzle game kind of, which I've never streamed a game even remotely like this. So uh, there's a whole lot of choices in it and stuff, and uh, I'm gonna just like let chat pick shit. I'm gonna look over, and when a choice pops up, I'm gonna like chat. What do you want to do? And, and sometimes I'll just pick the first fucking answer I see. Other times I'll wait and see if there's like a consensus with people. But yeah. It'll be good. We're gonna play this game. It's, it's it's a fun one. Hopefully you enjoy it. I liked it a lot. I liked watching it anyway. See if I enjoyed playing it. Yeah, hopefully I do. I should. <laughs> I enjoyed watching it. And that's pretty much all you do. You watch it. It's not, it's not a whole lot of gameplay, but yeah. Been, been doing some short game. We, we just did Star... Fucking what do you call it? We just did Star Fox Assault like two days ago. Yeah, I took us one stream as well. Trying to do like some shorter games. Because I don't do those very often. We've been playing so many goddamn long games that like fucking take like weeks to months to get done with. And it's like, you know, how about we do some shorter ones? Yeah? Good? Good, alright. Also, please scream at me if the game is too loud here in a moment when I swap over. Boom! Come on, come on, OBS, you can do it. Oh, but there you go. <laughs> there you go, I believe in you. Kill, yeah? You're just gonna pick the kill option every time? Is that what we're gonna do? Alright, good, is my controller working? It is good, alright, cool. Let's, uh, let's fucking hop in here, shall we? After I take a sip of my coffee, yeah? Y'all have a good Saturday? I'm having a grand old Saturday. I had a very, very productive morning today. Now we're gonna play some video games. In we go. Oh, hello? It's loud. Is it really loud? Yeah, it, it, it's loud. I'll turn it down a little bit. <laughs> Just making sure. It, it does got that chip tootie thing going on. It's got that chip tootie sound fucking thing going on, so it's gonna be like real goddamn loud. It's gonna pierce on through there. I will turn it down now. Anyway. Anyway, anyway. <clears throat> what the fuck are these buttons? Oh god, help me. <laughs> Welcome to Batman Theater. On this stage, we shall be toying. With fate. Uh-huh, yeah. How do I go forward? Is it A? <laughs> okay, good. Yeah, A. Hold on. No, please work. <laughs> Don't come into my chat and say, come. Stop it. <laughs> you will make many choices, unlocking darker and darker paths, all in order to witness a lovely variety of tragic events. But first, allow me to explain how it works. Yeah? <laughs> to begin the tutorial, select whichever doll you want. Yeah? Who, who are we picking? <laughs> who are we picking, chat? Welcome to the tutorial. Do you want to be the human doll, or do you want to be the demon doll? One's got horns and a tail and is slightly angry. One of them is a simple round friend. Who we be in? It d does it matter? It's a fucking tutorial. But I'll let you pick, yeah? This game's real fucking short, so I don't mind like wasting a bunch of time looking around at this shit. Mm. Let's be normal? Oh, you want to be normal? Sure, we'll be fucking normal. <laughs> Let's be normal. To control the human doll. Wait, oh sorry, you control the human doll. You're a friendly little guy, just minding your own business. How will you interact with the demon doll? Do you want to be hostile? <laughs> do you want to murder the demon doll? Or do you want to play nice with the chat? <laughs> Don't say horny. We're not, no, we're not, uh, the demon has horns, they're not horny, for God's sake. Fucking Christ. But yeah, we can be hostile, or we can be friends with it. Which one do you want to be, chat? Hi, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, we just started. <laughs> Welcome, play nice, be nice. You want to be nice? Okay, cool. <laughs> we'll be nice. You try to make friends with the demon doll, but it kills you in cold blood. How ruthless. You found your very first bad ending. Don't worry, though. The story need not end here. <laughs> Let's reset the stage and try again, shall we? Cool. This time, try controlling the other doll. Okay, yeah, sure. We'll, we'll, we'll be the demon doll this time, if the game wants us to be. You control the demon doll. You're a fierce-looking guy, just minding your own business. How we interact with the human doll? Okay, well, now what do we do, chat? Because we just saw earlier, if we try to, you know, if we try to play nice with the... Demon to murder us, but but now we're in charge of the demon. <laughs> so what do we do? Do we attack the human? Like do, do we do with the you know what the demon did to us or, or a, a moment ago and attack the human, or do we try to be nice with the human? Because now we're in control of the demon, yeah. Make out with it. You want me to make out with the human? That's not an option. How about we just be is be nice? It close the thing that you we'll, we'll, we'll be nice. Sure, yeah, we'll be nice. Wicked. Sorry, you're outnumbered there, chat member. <laughs> yeah, you're outnumbered. <laughs> You and the human doll are able to set aside your differences, and you become friends. Wait, wait, huh? This isn't a bad ending at all. I, I, I should have written, I should have written out this possibility. It's just not suited to my theater whatsoever. Now that you know how the story goes, you can set the doll's behavior in advance. As you just saw, these behaviors will automatically be set to what you chose during your last playthrough. Pay attention to that chat, all right? This is a puzzle game. <laughs> like it is a visual novel, but it's also a fucking puzzle game. So pay attention to this shit. But now you can turn each one on or off without having to replay from that doll's perspective. Yes, my theater actually doubles as a puzzle game. Now try turning the doll's behaviors on and off to see what the different outcomes. Yeah, good? Alright. 
So now you can pick. You see here, we have like human. We can we can we can make them hostile, or we can make them not hostile. We can make them wicked or not wicked. We can do whatever we want to. Yeah. How about how about for the sake of doing this, we just make them both turbo angry? <laughs> yeah, sure, cool. <laughs> Let's be the human and just make everybody want to kill each other. Uh huh. You're a friendly little guy. Yada yada. How am I gonna interact with the demon doll? I'm gonna fucking attack it. You both attack each other at once. And you die together. How fucking romantic. <laughs> End tutorial. There you go. Tutorial is now over. <laughs> Good. Now I'm done. No, wait, do, wait. Do I reset this? No, I, I'm done with the tutorial, yeah? We're done? We're done. Do you understand how to play? Do you, chat? Did you get it? I hope so. You better be taking fucking notes. Yeah! <laughs> I get it! This game saves your progress automatically, so just relax and collect all the bad endings at your own pace. Now, without further ado, let's start the show good 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 all right so here's what we got yeah we got the hero we got the maiden we got the little underling fella and we got the overlord who we be in <laughs> who do you want to be hmm who, who should we be first chat we got four people here we can pick from as you can see we can't set any of our behaviors right now all of our behaviors are currently locked so we can't do none of that shit how do you play Sh shut up <laughs> shut up <laughs> oh, wait hold on what's the menu do oh here oh wait shit uh what is all this? Oh, I can turn the speed up and shit, yeah? Okay, I'll just leave all this the same way it is, right? What's accessibility? Should I change any of this? Music cues? What? Music cues? Self voicing? No, 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 I'm gonna voice everything. No, we're, no, we're good, sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, we're good, shit. <laughs> maiden? Play the maiden and kiss the underling, excuse me. Play the maiden and kiss every- You wanna be the maiden- You wanna be the maiden first? Sure. You, you should, yeah, yeah, this is what we're looking at? Okay, we're gonna be the maiden first then, yeah? Sure, we're gonna pick maiden. You? Are a maiden. You live in a peaceful village. Sorry, you live. Well, yeah, you live in a peaceful village next to a spooky demon overlord's castle. Neat. You're told that you are fated to be captured by the overlord one day because you were a beautiful young girl. Demon overlords apparently love capturing those. You think of how you haven't heard of that actually happening to anybody, <laughs> but, <laughs> but maybe the demon just haven't given the opportunity. Who knows? You are in church. You pray to your god, asking why have you been born into the role of the maiden. You respect the divine plan and all, but you're really just curious as to what the point of it is. You're real impatient about it. <laughs> you're real fucking impatient about the whole thing. Meeting a demon actually kind of sounds pretty gosh darn exciting. M maybe you'd understand your role better if you were just- If you hurried up and got captured already, eh? You leave a note and venture forth to find a demon. Just to, you know, see what happens. <laughs> just, just see what happens. Uh, not long into your little adventure, a demon underling appears before you. Looks pretty scary. Yeah, this is the little fella we just saw on the, on the character selection screen there. Yeah, remember this guy? We just saw them, yeah? You want me to kiss him, chat? <laughs> is that what you want me to do? <laughs> yeah, fuck around and find out. Th that's what this entire game is, is fuck around and find out. Uh, oh, oh, here we go. Here's our choice. What do we do, chat? Do we shout for a hero to come save us? Or do we introduce- or do, we be, do we be polite to introduce ourselves? <laughs> what do we do? <laughs> what do we do, chat? Kiss? There's no kiss option! <laughs> we can't- we can't kiss the demon. Stop! <laughs> we can't kiss the fucking underling. <laughs> What do we do? Yeah? Shout for a hero? Introduce ourselves? What, what do you want? It, it, that's a friend? Yeah, I want to be friends with them? We can be friends, if you'd prefer. Kiss everything. It's fine to be polite. <laughs> Introduce yourself. Okay, cool. We're going to be polite then. Okay, chat. You tell the demon your name and explain that you're a maiden from the village. The demon suddenly jumps on you and starts biting. A lot. How painful. <laughs> this plan of yours was completely stupid, you think. Why couldn't you have just been more patient? Why did you go looking for trouble? You weren't angry or anything, of course. This was all your fault for trusting a demon not to devour you on sight. This is your punishment for questing fate, I guess. <laughs> bit by bit, you're swallowed by the demon until you are no more. <laughs> there you go, Chad. <laughs> there you go, you happy? Are you fucking happy? The end, game over. Roll credits, consumed maiden ending. Good. Now let's get, let's get back on there. Reset the stage, get back on there. All right, cool, well, there you go. So now, <laughs> there, there's the maiden. So now what do we do? Do we pick the maiden again and try something different, or do we pick somebody else? Also, as you can see here, we can now set uh, the maiden to be polite or not polite. We can do whatever we want to. Are there any good endings at all? It's called Bad End Theater, chat member. <laughs> the game is called Bad End Theater. Oh, we can check this out. Though. Peep this shit. See this? How in, the top, in the top right there, it says 1 out of 41. Here's all the different endings you can get with each character. It's neat. Yeah, trying to reach all the true endings. You see that right there? Try to find the true end next. Good. <laughs> he gave me very intense kisses. No. The, the underling did not. Those were not they, 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 they fucking ate me. Cum bucket? There's no cum bucket character. 
Who we be? You want to be maiden again? Underling? I mean, we could be the underling and not eat the maiden. <laughs> or we could do something up maiden again. <laughs> you want to be maiden again? Kabu? There's Kabu bug fables, everybody. Thank you for redeeming. There he is. There's Ka He's here now. He's in the audience. <laughs> Kabu Bug Fables is here to watch a performance for a bit. Yeah, he's not gonna be very happy. I I'm gonna I'm gonna take a wild guess and assume Kabu Bug Fables will not be very happy about what's gonna go on. Anyway, Vor is extreme kissing. That wasn't even Vor. They, 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 there's a difference between eating somebody alive and killing them. And Vor, you stop it. You fucking stop. You be nice, underling. Yeah, be overlord. And what do you want, Chad? See, this is what I mean. I'm either, I, I, I'm for, for right now, I'm gonna wait, and I'm gonna let people come to a consensus, and if, otherwise, I'm just gonna pick the first fucking thing I see. Yeah? Overlord? Wait, I, I got two for Overlord, yeah? Did two of them? Anymore? Yeah, we, we do Maiden again? No? <laughs> we can be polite? We're doing Overlord, fuck it. We're hopping in here. Uh-huh. You are the Overlord. You live in a castle surrounded by your demon servants. It's a pretty cushy life, you think? Except for those pesky humans who keep killing members of your army. There's even this role called a hero whose whole purpose in life is to just dethrone you? What's their deal anyway? You've actively avoided pissing off the humans in hopes that they'll leave you and your army alone. But they never do. You're still new to the whole overlord thing, and if you're being quite honest with yourself, you don't really understand the politics of it. But you remind yourself everyone's just doing their best to fulfill their roles, and you won't let them bait you into being an evil overlord they expect. You think you're pretty cool and mature to hold yourself at a higher standard like that. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, look, the underlings back. <laughs> there they are. Yeah? One of your underlings walks into the room, totally interrupting your thoughts about how awesome you are. They're saying something about how boring it is to stand in one place guarding the castle all the time, especially since no one ever comes here anyway. You see their point, but why are they whining about it? Wait, wait what? Oh, but the way they're whining about it kind of bothers you? <laughs> what to do with this underling? Hmm. What do we do, chat? Do we be a tyrant and tell him to get back to work, or just say, fuck it? <laughs> have your, have your day. I mean, it's the weekend, yeah? It's Saturday. <laughs> should, we, should we give him the day off? We'll see. Now, remember, chat. Remember. We just saw the underling over in the fucking field. The, the, the underling was out in the field and they ate the maiden. So, like, maybe, maybe, given the, maybe giving the underling the day off causes them to go outside and eat the maiden. What if we tell them to stay inside? Maybe they won't go eat the maiden. <laughs> you know? We gotta, you gotta make sure we, we think about what's going on here. It's all interconnected bullshit. You want you want to grant the day off, yeah? Do you? Do you want? Should we give him a day off? You want to give him a day off, yeah? We could. I'll give you a moment to decide. Day, day off. Day, okay, we're, we're doing day off then. Fuck it. Grant, you give him the day off. <laughs> you tell him to take a break from the stifling castle atmosphere and refresh their dark soul. A day off should be every. Sorry, should be fine every once in a while. They thank you and happily scurry off to do who knows what. You've got nothing to better do today, so you decide to nap for a little while. Being an overlord sure is great. Good. Well, that worked out, I suppose. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Yeah. You awake to a huge commotion outside. A hero has shown up and started totally murdering your soldiers. What the hell, guy? You rush out onto the battlefield to confront this jerkwad. You curse him and very rudely in inquire? That's how you say inquire? I thought it was- wait, whatever, fuck it. <laughs> really inquire his reasons for doing all of this. The hero yells at you, demanding you return the maiden that you're holding captive. You don't know what he's talking about, but you can't forgive his action. You do battle with the hero, but he has grown strong from cutting down your army. You're unable to defeat him. With the, with the sights of swings, he stabs you and cuts you into pieces. You fall. You have failed. Your subjects. You spit curses weakly. You wish you'd become stronger. Maybe you were never suited to be the overlord in the first place. The truth was, you were never that much more powerful than the demons who served you. It was the title, the, 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 the control, that gave you strength. These are your thoughts as you were swallowed by darkness. Congratulations, chat. <laughs> Congrat yeah, you feel good about yourself? Congratulations. Conquered over the overlord's fucking dead. Good job. Look what you did. Look what you fucking did, everybody. All right. <laughs> now what do we do? Now what do we do? We so we can go back into the Overlord again and do something differently. We could do we could do the Underling. We haven't done that with the hero. The hero just fucking murdered. Just came in there and murdered the Overlord. Hmm. Oh wait, hold on. Apparently, inquire with an I means to seek information in a formal way, whereas inquire with an E means to ask in a general way. What the fuck? <laughs> I, I've never heard that before. I thought I would just inquire. Like, I thought it was always spelled with an I. That's news to me. 
Thank you, chat member. Underling? But yeah, under okay, we'll do underling. Care we're doing underling. Thank you. Yeah, I'm a demon underling. In service of the overlord. Yeah, I'm particularly strong, but you know, not particularly weak either. That's what your friends tell you anyway. Your job is to guard the castle. Keep the humans away. It is unbearably boring. Heroes really come all the way here to challenge the overlord anyway. It's a lot of standing in one place, staring at nothing. I feel like you're gonna go crazy if you don't get a break, so you, uh, you decide to ask the Overlord for a day off. She's surprisingly cool with it? <laughs> nice! See? Now look. Because we did that with the Overlord and we, we, we didn't set her to be a tyrant, she's gonna give us a day off. Ain't that neat? Yeah? Good. Good. She's giving us a day off. Thank you. It's that honor your adventure outside the castle. The change in amnesty excites you. You spend some time rolling around the grass, wild and free. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. As you make your way along the path to the nearby human village, you encounter a maiden. She seems real frightened and screams for a hero to come save her. Uh-oh. We didn't make her polite. We, we, didn't, we didn't make the maiden polite. She's screaming for help. What do we do? You consider your options. All right. <laughs> what do we do? I mean, we already... I mean, hey. We could eat her. We already saw what happens there. We, we, we could eat her. But see, now here's the thing, though. See, we, we, we could not eat her and try to be friends with her, but also we could eat her and then see, because that's the end of the Maiden story, but like, the Underling gets to keep going to do shit. The Underling keeps going to do shit, right? So like, you know, the Maiden story will end, but hey, <laughs> gobble her ass, kiss her, be cool, <laughs> tell her to stop. You, you, you want to tell her to stop? We can tell her to stop, yeah, sure. But want me to be cool and tell her to stop? Eat? You can't just keep saying eat over and over, chat member. What do we do? Do we, do we murder her? Not eat? You, oh, you want to? Okay, fine. We're gonna, we're gonna not eat then. Yeah. Hey, fuck, fuck, shh, quit, quit yelling. Shush. <laughs> oh, look at him. <laughs> look at him. When the maiden realizes you're not gonna hurt her, she regains her composure. Now she started talking to you like your friends or something. You don't understand humans at all. You speak the same language, of course, which always confused you because why is there conveniently only one language in the world? If demons and humans are independent societies, wouldn't that make sense when they have their own language? Wait, wait, who gives a shit, whatever the fuck? <laughs> the maid's going on and on about some kind of destiny she's trying to fulfill? I, it, the bottom line, from what you gather, is that she wants you to, to take her to the Overlord. Sounds like it could be interesting. Besides, you got nothing better to do. Okay, look at that. See, look, it all worked out. <laughs> now we're gonna head back to the castle. <laughs> See, no one had to get murdered. Satisfied with your day out, you take the maiden back to the castle and present her to the Overlord. You seem to be getting along just fine, so you decide it's about time for a nap. Good. We'll see, isn't the hero gonna still show up though and fucking try to. Because now the maiden's actually here. Hmm. Hmm. After a few hours of sleep, you're rudely awakened by the sounds of battle. You emerge from your room to find that a hero has slaughtered many of your friends and work associates. What a jerk! Oh, okay, what do we do, chat? <laughs> do, do we avenge our fallen comrades? Or do we save ourselves? What, what do we do? Do we go try to fight the hero? Hmm? There's a skull next to that one. What does that mean? Is it, there's a spooky skull next to that choice. <laughs> do, do we kill him? Do we go try to fight the hero? Or do we fucking get the hell out of here? What do we do? Hmm? We already know this guy's real tough. He's, he's just cutting through everybody. Yeah? Save myself, fight him. We got, we got one for save yourself and one for fight him. He's gonna kick your ass if you fight. <laughs> yeah? Well, okay. Y yeah, that is true. Maybe he, he probably will kick our ass. Kiss the hero. There's no kiss option. <laughs> we can't just kiss everybody. This isn't- no. Stop it. For fuck's sake. We can't just kiss every person we run into. Yeah? Kiss? You can't keep saying kiss. Y yeah? Y how about we run away? Because we know this guy's real fucking tough. Yeah, this, this guy's real tough. Let's get the hell out of here, shall we? Y y you look around at the lifeless forms of those you know and as far back as you can remember. Y you feel glad not to be in their shoes. You also feel guilty to be thinking that as you flee the castle, until you remember your role, not as an underling, but as a demon. This kind of thing's expected of you. Maybe you'll start a new life, far away from humans and demons, where you'll live peacefully, alone, in some deep, dark forest somewhere. I mean, <laughs> is that one necessarily a bad one? I mean, <laughs> we got the- I mean, hey, we didn't die, at the least, yeah? Like, yeah, the castle got fucked up, but I mean, hey, we, we didn't die. <laughs> deserter. <laughs> We're now a deserter. Good. Alright, reset that fucking thing. Cool, cool. And now the only person we haven't been yet is a hero, but also remember, we have- Do, 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 do you want to change any of these things right now, chat? Would you like to turn on tyrant or hungry or polite for any of these current things we're doing? Hmm? Or pick a certain character? What we doing? What is we doing? Oh, my neck. I'm gonna take a sip of my coffee while we wait. 
Is it hero time? Yeah, you want to do hero? We can do hero. <sighs> Pardon me. I'm chugging my coffee. You want to do hero? Yeah. Do you want to change any of these things, though? Do you, do you want to enable any of these or just go in there just without any of that shit turned on? Yeah, just default settings. Could do that. Is it hero time? Let's do hero time. You are a hero. You like to think of yourself as a pretty reliable and swell guy. Your life has been rather ordinary, aside from the occasional heroic adventures fighting evil monsters and whatnot. You were told a maiden from your village has been kidnapped and is likely being held captive at a nearby demon overlord's castle. Who even puts a village right next to where an entire demon army hangs out? You, you don't really get that. You happily protect the townspeople, though. You were born to play this role. Look at this dumb... Why does he have a belt on his head? <laughs> what motherfucker? You, you got a goddamn belt on your head. Stop it. You head off on your adventure to rescue the maiden. But a demon... Sorry, but demon soldiers block your path. You could kill them and gain experience. Oh? Okay, now what do we do? <laughs> do we be dutiful? Do we murder these demons or do we run away like a fucking coward? Do, do we be a little bitch and scurry around them? Da, da, da. Do, 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 look at them. Look at those fellas. They got like little pointy tails and shit. Pull out wiener. There isn't a pull out wiener option. Fuck them up. Okay, we're gonna fuck them up. <laughs> you make quick work of the vile creatures that stood in your way. You feel much stronger now. After a long trek, you make it to the castle's front gates. You're faced with an army of demons and all look very intimidating. There's no way to sneak past these monsters if you want to reach the Overlord. Okay, what do we do now? Now what do we do? <laughs> do we also fight these guys? Do we continue to be dutiful? Hi there, by the way. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Yeah, you missed the beginning of it. I'm sorry. We're not, we're not very far into it so far. Don't worry. Anyway. Do we continue to be dutiful and keep fucking murdering people? Or, do we, or maybe we just had to be nice. Three, quit saying that. What do you mean threesome? I'm, I'm gonna count that as diplomatic. Yeah, you also, somebody else is diplomatic, yeah? Good. Cut through the asses. Well, that's one for fucking cut through the asses and two for diplomatic, as far as I'm concerned. Hmm. Be nice? Okay, we're gonna be nice then, yeah? Even though we just murdered two of them, we'll be nice now. <laughs> sure. Ask if they'll let us in. You attempt to explain what you've come, but uh, the monster before you is eyeing you with suspicion. They can't help but notice the demon blood <laughs> from earlier that you haven't had a chance to wash off yet. Uh... Oops. <laughs> you have no choice but to fight the army in self-defense. Oh well, more experience points for you. See, chat, what, what do you think was gonna happen? What did you, what did you think was gonna happen, chat? <laughs> what did you think was gonna fucking happen? <laughs> you make your way through the castle, fending off all the demons that stand in your way. You make it to the Overlord's chamber and hope that there's still time to save the maiden. Oh? <laughs> You find the maiden being held captive by the Overlord, just as you expected. Suspected, rather. But for some reason, you can't sense anything... sinister? Happening? Uh-oh. <laughs> you all look at each other in surprise and confusion. There's no time to hesitate. What do we do? Do we go for the Overlord? <laughs> or do we ask what the fuck is happening? Do, do, do we go for the Overlord? Quit saying threesome! <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> for Christ's sake. Uh... Do we, do, I mean, we, now we already know how this turns out, yeah? Because we don't, we know the hero's gonna beat the Overlord. Well, is, is he though? Because like now the Maiden's here. The Maiden's here now. Ask what's up, yeah? Y y you wanna ask? We're, okay, well, we'll ask what's going on then, yeah? <laughs> maybe it's a... <laughs> maybe it's all a big misunderstanding, yeah? Let's ask what's going on. She explains that she came on her own and was never in any danger. She hesitantly asked you why you're covered in blood. <laughs> you... Don't know how to respond. <laughs> oh. Oops. The Overlord moves past you and out the door to see her army in lifeless, bloody piles. She's wailing. It's... It's horrible. This is your chance, hero! <laughs> oh, oh, do we stab her in the back now? <laughs> oh. Well, now we have a second chance to murder her. <laughs> uh, do we kill her while she's fucking distracted or do we go, wait, hold on now, wait a minute. Wait, hold on, this was an accident? I didn't mean to? Uh, Ababa? Uh, uh, it's just, it's just a big misunderstanding. Yeah, I, I murdered all your, all of your troops. It was an accident. Oops. Ha ha. Oopsie. Kiss. Cool. She's sad now, so kill her. <laughs> no. More people seem to be saying it's a big misunderstanding, so we're gonna do that one first. Yeah, sure. This is all just like a, it, 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 it's just a real big misunderstanding. You hope that she'll let this whole thing slide if you could just explain to yourself. You, you really try, but the Overlord is inconsolable, also she has a giant fucking eyeball, apparently. <laughs> she tears you apart, and the Maiden watches in silence. 
As you die, you cannot help but think you probably deserve this. <laughs> Tragic hero ending. Good. Chat. So, we just played as every character now, and the only- the, the, the only person that you didn't- They're all of- you got three out of four of them killed. You got three out of four of them killed, Chad. The only one that lived was the underling. <laughs> all- everybody else died. Good. Good. Well, see, now we gotta- now we gotta start dicking around with these, though. What do we do now? Because we've already played as all the characters now, and we've seen their default endings. So, what do you- what, so now we have to, now we have to dick around. We gotta dick around with these, like, settings here now. What you wanna do? What you want to do? Let's go, let's go for four for four. You want to do, you want to do the underling again and, and try to get the underling killed? <laughs> or do you want to do something else? Hmm? Isn't that an absolute win? I mean, do you want that guy to die? Yeah. Make the maiden be polite. You got it. Maiden's polite now. What else? <laughs> what else are we doing? What else do we do to change things up a little bit? Hmm? Do, do, kill the gremlin? You want, you want to kill the little underling? Yeah. You want to get them killed somehow? We can try to. Make the maiden polite and go with the underling. Oh, yeah? Sure? <laughs> Let's kill the underling, goddammit. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> Fine. Okay, now we're gonna skip through all this because we already saw this shit. We already, we already read this stuff, so we'll just, we'll just skip on through here, yeah? Come on through, yada yada, yada guard the castle. Mm -hmm. She gives us a day off because we, we made her not a tyrant. We're out here now. Mm -hmm. And now she's gonna be polite. She greets you and asks you that she has a favor to ask. Or sorry, says she has a favor to ask, rather. You can study your options. All right, now, again, <laughs> now she's being polite this time. She's not screaming for help. <laughs> do, we, do, we, do we just do what we normally do and take her back to the castle, or do we eat her anyway like an asshole? Because we, we can still eat her. Even though she's being polite, we can still eat her. <laughs> like, what do you... Hmm? What do you want to do, chat? Hear her out? Yeah? I read that as eat her out, chat member, and I was very disappointed in you, but then I realized you actually said something normal. Gobble? Go gobble? Everyone's saying gobble. <laughs> oh, okay, well. <laughs> I regret to inform you. Everyone's saying gobble. <laughs> Two people said hear her out. Sorry, champ. Maidens aren't the best meal, but I think you should live up to your demon name and strike back against the humans. You start devouring the maiden without so much as a second thought, and you feel pretty proud about that. Other humans would surely praise you with the curses. Wait, what? Sorry, we would praise you with curses if you were around to see him. Oh, man. If only somebody could have been watching. Yeah, if only. <laughs> if, if only somebody could have been watching, chat. Time to find an audience for your evil deeds. You wander into a nearby village. The people are screaming and running away, throwing rocks at you and whatnot. You think it's pretty rude of them. You haven't even done nothing yet. What do we do? <laughs> do, do we put on a show or do we change our mind and leave? Hmm? Do we, just, do we just go ape shit and fuck everybody up in town? Or should we head back? Have we had enough murder for today? Hmm? I was gonna skull next to it, Chad. We, we've seen a couple of those now where skulls are next to it. I don't know what those do yet. Put on a show? You wanna put on a show? Yeah? Hmm. Take a sippy again, pardon me. Good, good, good. Show, leave. <laughs> Flash your teeth, you nerd. Show. What does the skull mean? It usually typically means someone's gonna die. You sure, put on it. Okay, we're doing a show, we're doing a show, then fuck it. He attacked the nearest human. He's old and weak, and his bones crunch delightfully. Mmm, cr crunchy, mmm. <laughs> the audience screams grow louder. Applause. You think, hey, this is actually pretty fun. I should have taken revenge like this a lot sooner. As you continue your bloodthirsty dance, striking the villagers down, you fail to notice a sword-wielded hero running towards you. He takes you out with one swift blow. I mean, you're just a demon underling after all. As you die, you think, <laughs> that was totally worth it. The curtain closes. Performer underling, yeah? Well, there you go, Chad. You killed everybody now. Everyone's dead. <laughs> Every single one of the characters has died now. And in that ending, not only did the fucking underling die, but also the maiden died. Yeah? And also a bunch of random townspeople. So congratulations. Congratulations. Good. And we unlock no new options out of that. Do 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 do. 100% completion, but yeah, we, 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 we do have to, that is true, we do have to get every single ending for 100%, we are gonna 100% this game tonight, so we do have to get literally every ending, so it is indeed worth it. Dun, dun, dun. Boom, boom, boom. Slaughters all the demons, tries to kill the overlord, does not scream at the sight of the underling, eats the maiden immediately, <laughs> and does not allow the underling a day off. Good. You wanna do polite, dutiful, and overlord? Yeah, is that what you wanna do? You wanna make them passive. Yeah, well if you make the if you make the hero dutiful, he's gonna start killing people. 
But we can play as the Overlord? Yeah, you want to make the Maiden polite and then play as the Overlord? Sure, we'll do that. Sure, why not? Dutiful, polite, and then an Overlord. Good, good, good. We'll do that. We'll do that one. We already read all this dialogue, so we're not. We're just gonna skip over it again until we get to something new. Mm hmm. Humans, blah, blah, blah. Little hero. What's the deal anyway? Blah, blah, blah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm, mm hmm. The underling is back. What do we do? Do we. <laughs> do we. Do we let the underling go this time, or do we or do we tell him to say, you know, like, do, what do we do, yeah? Hmm? Do we give him the day off like we usually do, or do we say, fuck you? Well, here's the thing, though, because if we granted the... Because will the, will the maiden come here? Like, is the maiden going to come here if we, like, tell him to get back to work? Because, again, remember, he goes outside and finds the maiden, right? <laughs> get get back to work? <laughs> you want to you you tell him to get back to work and say, fuck him? Because <laughs> what if the maiden doesn't come here? What, what if we tell him to get back to work and the maiden never shows up? We can see what happens, I suppose, yeah? Go to work? I, I, everyone's saying go to work. Go, go to work, then. Go, go to work, asshole. You give them a lecture about responsibility and unquestioning obedience. Your servants ought to do what they're told, whether they like it or not. They look really unhappy with you, but... You're sure they'll thank you for this later. Venturing too far from the castle tends to uh, spell death. You dismiss the underling and lie down in your nice and comfy bed. All that lecturing made you want to take a nap. <laughs> You fall asleep pretty quick. Just another one of your amazing talents as the Overlord. You awake to a knock at your door. <laughs> the underling from earlier brought something back. Sorry, brought some back some company. Oh, did he? Or did, did they rather? Sorry, they. You thought you told the underling to do their job. Not drag strangers into your room. Looks like they took an unauthorized break away from the castle. You scold them, but ultimately you're a little interested in this guest, so you let them off easy. The underling's not so bad. Oh, hi. <laughs> it's a maiden from the nearby human village. She says her role is to be captured by you? Hmm. The maiden then goes on to say that she's been getting very impatient thinking about her impending capture, so she came here to speed things along. You appreciate her honesty, but regret to inform her that you never had any plans to capture any humans. She seems very disappointed by this. <laughs> Good. Perhaps I'm not performing my role well enough? How, how can I become more maiden-like? You don't really understand the question. You think this world puts way too much focus on destiny and junk? J just go home and stop worrying about it, you tell her. The maiden seems to be having a hard time wrapping her head around this. She insists that she stay and talk to you some more. You feel warm inside as she looks into your eyes. This this is the first time a human's looked at you without contempt. You you wonder what to say. We, kiss, we can't kiss her, Chen. Stop it. Quit saying kiss. Yeah, happy pride, everybody. Happy fucking pride. I mean, should we tell? Should we be antisocial and tell her to go home? Or should we let her stay for a bit? What should we do? I mean, no one's dead yet, at least, yeah? Kiss? <laughs> Quit saying kiss. Kiss is not an option. Stay. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna assume kiss means stay. We're, we're, stay over. Sure, stay for a while. <sighs> did, did you just cheer? For fuck's sake. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, NVZ, for the 69 gay bits. I pretty <laughs> Fucking Christ, good, good lord. Thank you. Don't give me money, but also thank you. Happy fucking pride, everybody. You can't bring yourself to send this maiden away. She just got here. You enjoy a nice long chat with her, sharing stories about your kind. She expresses a surprise that demons are not at all what she expected them to be. Y you're glad that she seems to have an open mind about these kind of things. You also bring up how you've always instructed your army to avoid humans, as to not agitate them and get heroes sent after you. That explains why people in my village haven't have been left unharmed. It's because of your orders, isn't it? We're very grateful. You're surprised to hear her thank you. You've always thought of humans to be violent and unreasonable. That's why your servants are always getting killed, despite your efforts to leave them alone. But this made it is different. You joked that maybe you've been lying to her this whole time and that you were actually super evil all along. <laughs> the maiden laughs at that, saying she wouldn't mind being held captive here. Oh, the people in her village are a little exhausting at times, she says. You can't tell if she's into you or not. <laughs> you notice the sounds of battle are starting to ring through your castle's halls. Uh-oh. The maid is getting a little bit nervous, but you, you reassure her it's only your underling's roughhousing. No, 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 no big deal. You know it's probably a hero, but you don't want to upset the maiden by telling her that. Y y your army's gonna take care of it. Oh, uh oh, <laughs> uh. It isn't too long before the hero bursts into your room. He 
But, but what? He, he, he shouldn't have made it here. Why, why didn't they stop him? The hero just stands there, unsure of himself. He's covered in demon blood. <laughs> As the maiden speaks to him, trying to explain the situation, you move past the hero and out the door. You, you're, you're, not, you're not thinking clearly. See, seeing your servants' bodies and pieces all strewn about your castles, really, really, really taking it out of you. Th that hero did this. There's, there's, there's so much, there's so much blood. Why? Why? Why did he come here for the maiden? Did he think? Did, did he think she she needed rescuing? There was no one for this hero to save here. There was never any harm meant to anyone. You were just t talking to her. Why has it turned out like this? The hero starts babbling insincere apologies and excuses, realizing his wrongdoing, but you are beyond hearing that kind of bullshit. You have had it with these humans always murdering your servants for no reason. You can no longer hold yourself back, and you lash out at the hero. Oh. Oh? <laughs> Alright. When you regain control, there's nothing left of the hero. The maiden has fled in terror. You are alone. Oh. <laughs> there you go. We got the Wrathful Overlord ending, everybody. Yeah? I mean, the hero's dead. I, I don't know where the underling went. <laughs> the maiden's okay, Overlord's okay. Her whole fucking castle's empty now. She's all alone. Good, let's reset the stage, shall we? Good. I don't think we have the antisocial trait we can do now. <laughs> we, can, we can just make the Overlord antisocial. <laughs> we can make her a tyrant. The maiden can be polite, you know, so we, we're just keep, we're gonna keep unlocking shit. No, not the tutorial, no, no, no. No, no, no. I meant to press B. Yeah, yeah, just looking at this stuff. Also, here's the routes, by the way. You can check this shit out, too. In case you want more, like, help on trying to how to, like, how to figure out how to do certain things, you can check every character's routes. Like that. Ain't that neat? In case you want to see what kind of interactions give you what, you can you can consult that little map there. Good, good, good. Anyway, who, what are we doing now, chat? What are we checking out? Yeah? I mean, what if we be the hero and we don't murder everybody? <laughs> like, what if we just don't kill everybody? Hmm? What if we be the underling and we, like, don't eat the maiden and bring her back? What if we be the tyrant and we... I mean, do nothing different? I mean, we could change what the hero does, I suppose. Yeah, no, yeah, no girlfriend. Sorry, everybody. No girlfriend. Dun, 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 dun. There has to be a way to get the maiden and the overlord to kiss. Yeah, yeah do you think so? <laughs> that wouldn't be a very bad end, though, now, would it? Hmm? This game's full of bad endings, chat. You want to be the hero? Yeah, wait, hold on. Antisocial tyrant overlord and play maiden, yeah? Hero no murder. You, okay, well, we got two going for that one. Yeah, we, we, what are we doing? <laughs> you, want to do, you want to do the overlord thing or the hero thing without killing anybody? Because <laughs> it seems to be the main issue at the moment is that the, the fucking hero keeps murdering everybody, causing a bunch of problems. We could fix that. Yeah? We could do that. Hmm? Mm hmm? Mm. Taking a sippy. You continue drinking sick. You're drinking shit. <laughs> it's full of bad endings, yeah? It's just it's just full of bad endings. <laughs> no murder. You wanna be the maiden, yeah? No murder. Okay, okay, so we'll make it so the hero does not is not dutiful or heroic. So that way he won't kill anybody, yeah? And then we wanna play as the maiden? And you wanna make the tyrant antisocial and an overlord, yeah? Okay, sure, we'll do that. We'll make her an we'll make her an antisocial tyrant. <laughs> and we'll play as the maiden. And the underling won't be hungry, so they won't eat us immediately. And then the hero won't kill everybody. Cool? Cool. All right. Maiden time. Uh -huh. Ready about all this stuff. Yada yada. She's, she's, she's from the peaceful village. Mm -hmm. She wants to go get captured. For some reason. <laughs> she, she wants to be captured. Uh-huh. Here's Yeah. Now, okay. Now, what do we do? Do we, do we continue to be polite? Or do we shout for the hero to come help us this time? Last time we introduced ourselves and the demon just fucking devoured us immediately. <laughs> so, you know. Could do the same thing as last time. This time they're not going to eat us, though, because remember, we, did, we didn't make them hungry. The gremlin is no longer hungry, so they won't eat us. No, the hero's going to murder him, you think? Yeah, well, we didn't make the hero dutiful. Maybe? Ask for a hero? You want to you shout for a hero? <laughs> give back rub. There isn't a fucking give back rub option. <laughs> I, wait, when I said I was playing a visual novel, I think you, mis yeah, I think you misunderstood what I meant. This, this isn't one of the fuck games. You don't fuck people in this game, chat member. You want to introduce ourselves? Yeah. No hero? Okay, what do you want to do? Introduce then. Okay, more people are saying introduce? Okay, good. <laughs> introduce ourselves. Uh-huh. You tell the demon your name and explain that you're a maiden from the village. You tell him you were thinking that maybe you could understand your role better if you were to hurry up and be taken away by a demon already. The demon doesn't seem to really have been listening to you, which is a little irritating. <laughs> they agreed to take you to their master nonetheless. 
After a long walk to the castle, you introduce yourself to the Overlord. She lectures the underling that brought you here, who was apparently not told to leave their post. Or sorry, told not to leave their post, rather. You wonder what cruel punishment awaits them. But to your surprise, she lets them off easy. The underling is dismissed, and the Overlord turns to you, looking very interested. You explain why you've come, and she squints at you. <laughs> Got a look at her face. <laughs> It turns out she never had any plans to capture maidens or to do anything that would agitate the humans. You wonder for a moment if she might be lying, but it doesn't really seem like it. Still, this doesn't make any sense to you. You've always been told that demons would one day seek you out and something awful would happen, that then a hero would come to your rescue. You don't believe that you've been lied to all along. Not part of me got shit in my throat. <laughs> yeah, you've been lied to all along. M maybe it's just that you haven't been maiden-like enough. You asked the Overlord, but what you should do to be more a suitable maiden, but she doesn't seem to understand. Just go home and stop worrying about destiny so much. She makes it sound so simple. This, this, this overlord seems like the complete opposite of you. You want to learn more about her and how, how, how she thinks. You insist on staying to talk to her some more. The overlord tells you again that you should get lost. How rude, you just got here. <laughs> All right, I mean, do, do we obey her and leave? Do we, be, do we be an obedient maiden and get the fuck out of here? Or do we leave? Like, she, or do we refuse to leave? Rather, yeah. Because remember, we made we made her antisocial. Remember, we made that we made the Overlord antisocial. So she's telling us to leave. <laughs> why, why did we make her antisocial? I mean, hey, we can tell her no. <laughs> like, she's trying to make us leave, but we could just tell her to refuse. You want to refuse? Yeah. But you know, fuck it. We're gonna refuse. To obey. Oh, no, hold on. Now someone's saying obey. Yeah, refuse. Oh, hold on. We're tipping the scales here. <laughs> yeah. We're doing refuse. Oboe. No, not oboe. Obey, not oboe. We're, do, we're, we're doing fucking, yeah. We're, 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 gonna, we're gonna refuse. You put your foot down and tell her that you're not going anywhere. You still want to fulfill your destiny, even if you have to make it happen on your own. She's a little frustrated by your stubbornness, but doesn't kick you out or anything. Hooray! <laughs> the Overlord shares many stories about demons with you, and little by little, you realize that they might not be the ruthless monsters you were raised to believe. As it turns out, she commanded her demons to avoid towns and villages. She didn't want to risk giving the humans any excuse to send a hero after them. You realize that you that must be why you never heard of any demons attacking your town. You express your gratitude to the Overlord on behalf of your village. She says you can thank her by telling the humans to stop raising the heroes. She's tired of sending servants, sorry, tired of her servants getting killed off by them. You've always thought demons were violent and unreasonable creatures, but it seems the Overlord could say the same of humans. You may be different, but really, they're just trying to live their lives the same as you. You feel like you're starting to understand things a little bit better. But maybe everything I've said to you was to deceive you and the other humans. What would you do if it turned out to be super evil all along? Even if she were to capture you, you think this is, place is way more interesting than, than the way things are back home. You kind of like not being told to expect demons to come after you all the time, you feel? Free. Honestly, you've always kept to yourself, but spending time with this overlord has been very nice. You feel butterflies in your stomach. As you think that a hero enters the room. Oh, he's not covered in blood though. <laughs> Look, hey. He's not fucking covered in blood this time. You're surprised to see him at first, until you realize that he must have been sent to retrieve you. Confused, the hero asks you what's going on. You <laughs> Stop saying kiss with tongue. <laughs> Stop it. There's no kissing happening right now. Stop. You explain the situation, reassuring him that you were never in any danger. The hero expresses his relief that this whole misunderstanding hadn't led to any horrible consequences. You apologize for causing trouble, but really, didn't anyone read that note you left? Ah, jeez. <laughs> the hero asks if you return to the village with him to give everyone the news of your safety. The overlord allows the two of you to leave, and you give her a little wave as you exit the room. You'll be back soon! You're about halfway to the village when you feel that something is... off. Unable to shake your concern, you look back over your shoulder. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> um, hmm. <laughs> You stop in your tracks. The castle's engulfed in flames! Is the Overlord alright? You, you can't return to the village like this. You have to know. You have to be sure everybody's safe. You've already taken off before the hero can even think of stopping you. You scan the fleeing demons, but the Overlord is not among them. Against your better judgment, you rush into the burning castle to find her. You quickly reach the Overlord's room, but the door is shut tight. The, the handle's too hot to touch. You're too weak to force it open. You pound your fist against the door helplessly. What were you thinking? This is all because you've forgotten your role. Only a hero could pull this kind of thing off. You start to cough. 
Kuv, Kuv. The smoke is too thick. You... You can hardly breathe. You realize you haven't got much time left now. You desperately head towards the stairs to save yourself. But this fire has spread faster than you expected. You... You won't be able to make it outside. You can't help but laugh. <laughs> what, what a joke. A maiden? Saving the overlord? If you just stayed true to your role, things... Things wouldn't have ended like this. This is exactly the kind of punishment you deserve. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Good lord. You let the demon fire cleanse your rotten soul. I, and, and, then, and, then they were, and then they die anyway. Selfless maiden and B. Pay attention to that. And B. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're, getting, we're getting B versions of endings now. Yeah, not, not just the regular ending. We're getting B versions. Good. Okay. Now, we did unlock, however, we unlocked the obedient thing now. Yeah, we can make the maiden obedient if we want to. Got to toggle these on or off. So what, what, what do we do now, chat? What do we do now? <laughs> how did, how, like, what even happened? We left and then the fucking overlord got, like, the, the building got lit on fire? Who lit it on fire? I mean, it wasn't the hero. And it wasn't the maiden. And it probably wasn't the overlord that lit the place on fire. Think it was this fucker? <laughs> you think this fucker did it? <laughs> Who lit the house on fire? Hmm. You want to check out the underling? Okay, we can do underling, but now what do we do, though? Do we, do we change any other settings on anybody, or do we keep them, do we keep them default? Or, like, keep them, like, passive, whatever the fuck, yeah? We'll do underling. But, but do we change any other settings? Do we make the hero, like, murder? Do we make the maiden polite? Do we make the tyrant antisocial or, like, you know, like, rude? I called her a tyrant, the overlord, rather. Oh, pardon me, I pop my bones. Me bones, they'd be hurting. Make the overlord a tyrant? Yeah, you got it. We'll make the overlord a tyrant. And we'll play as the underling. Anything else? <laughs> Anything else we should change or not? Nah? I think we're good there, yeah? Because we already know that even if we tell the underling to get back to work, that the little fucker just scampers off anyway and finds the maiden, so like... I'm not sure if the tyrant thing causes anything different, right? I don't think it affects anything. So yeah, we'll just do that then, yeah? Cool? Cool. We've already run all this shit, yeah? Same old stuff here. Mm -hmm. your, your, your job is boring. Yeah, so you go to ask for a day off. She gives you an info about responsibility, unquestioning obedience, and all that bullshit. Yeah, we already read this part. Oh, so you return to your post. But what does she know about anything? Who made her the boss to everybody? You complain about the overload of your friends. They agree that she's kind of a snob and totally deserved to be kicked off a throne. Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you only wanted to vent your frustrations, but the conversation is about turned into an assassination plot. You should probably steal this in a responsible direction. What do we do? <laughs> do we be disloyal? <laughs> do we be a disloyal piece of shit and overthrow her? Or, or maybe, we, or maybe we chill the fuck out. What do we do, Chad? Do we chill the fuck out? Do, 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 do we do, do we say fuck the boss? Do we, you know, we, we overthrow that bitch? She was rude. She wouldn't give us a day off. <laughs> yeah, we could be disloyal. Do you want to be a disloyal? You want to overthrow her? Hmm. You want to go overthrow the overlord? Could do that. Or we could just not. Let's not. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're doing. Let's not. I see more people saying let's not. Let's not. <laughs> Good. You, you tell your friends that you, you totally weren't serious about the whole thing. You, you actually, you kind of, you know, you kind of cool to status quo. After all, life would be pretty dang good if only the wait what? Life must be pretty dang good if the only thing you have to complain about is that you live so comfortably and there's nothing to do. Ah uh, yeah, the others nod, but uh, don't seem convinced. Y you say a coup d'état would be more effort than it's worth, but you're still gonna rebel and sneak out of the castle. <laughs> your friends praise your mischievous ways. Uh-huh, here's the, we already saw this dialogue. Mm-hmm. You bump into the maiden, yeah? She seems very frightened and screams for a hero to come save her. You can study your options. Now, do we, do we eat her again? <laughs> Are we gonna eat the maiden again? <laughs> or should we tell her to fucking chill out this time? <laughs> what do we do? Cause she's screaming. We've already we've already seen her get eaten twice, Chad. Do we gotta eat her for a fucking third time? Do we do we eat the maiden again, but for a third time? Tell her to shut the fuck up, yeah? <laughs> sure, we'll tell her to shut the fuck up. When the maiden realized he ain't gonna hurt her, she regains her composure. Now she started talking to you like your friends, yada yada. We already read this part of this dialogue, saying little stuff. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Yeah, she wants to go see the Overlord. Sounds like it'll be interesting. Besides, you got nothing better to do. Satisfied with your day, you take the maiden back to the castle and present it to the Overlord. She asks you where you found this maiden, knowing full well that you left the castle when you weren't supposed to. You apologize for disobeying her, but. I hope that the maiden's interested enough present that you 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 you, 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 you might be forgiven. 
The Overlord nods and says everything's cool as long as you always listen to her from now on. You're impressed with what, what an easygoing boss she is. You mentioned how you can't believe you and your friends even considered overthrowing her. She gives you a look as if to say, oh, sorry, and, and you say, that, that, that was a joke. That, that was, I was just giving you a goof. It was a funny, it was a prank. It was a joke. <laughs> she smiles and dismisses you. You, you. you decided it's about time for a nap. Yeah, good. You don't get to sleep for long, though, and your friends wake you up. Rude. One of them is stepping on you pretty hard. You, you ask them what the deal is. They say they're planning a whole revolution. They're gonna get rid of the current overlord and put a new ruler in place. They want to hear if you're in or not. And being a pretty lazy underling, you of course reply with... That sounds like a lot of trouble. How about we just did skip it instead? Your friends question your loyalty to the cause. What do we do, chat? <laughs> what, do, what do we do? Do we do we do we be disloyal and go kill the do we go ki fucking kill the overlord? Or do we or do we you know or maybe we, I mean she's not so bad. She, she's cool, right? <laughs> you know, do, maybe we don't go kill her? Maybe we don't go fucking murder the overlord? Hmm. You'd rather not die, yeah? I mean well, I mean which one what, what do you think's gonna happen? <laughs> what do you <laughs> you think, I mean, who's to say we're not gonna die if you pick this one? What if the Overlord just kills all of us? Hmm? Yeah? Hmm? Hmm? What are we doing? Yeah, do you want to be disloyal? Or do you want to say, hold on now, everybody? <laughs> yeah? Oh, fucking it. Time to be a bad, you want to be a bad boy? Yeah, we're gonna be disloyal? Okay, fine, then we'll be disloyal, everybody. <laughs> we're gonna be disloyal. Let's go kill the Overlord. You tell them that you were just joking and clarify that you're totally in with it. You're in it to win it. They say you were always terrible with jokes. Whether or not you actually feel like killing the Overlord, you, you know how bad it'll end up if on the wrong, to be on the wrong side of things. And if this assassination deal doesn't pan out, you can always just pretend you're running this all along. But beneath your shield of faux confidence, you worry about getting yourself what you got yourself dragged into. You follow your friends outside the castle to talk more about the plan. You're curious if they have any idea how they want to go about this. They figured they'd just lock her in the room and set the place on fire. What a stupid plan. That could go wrong in so many ways. You realize your friends are just a bunch of directionless thugs. Usually without somebody's guidance. Your guidance? They'd probably be casualties if you fought her head on. And while a, showy death make, while a showy death makes a revolution a heck of a lot more fun, it's probably the wrong way to go. Your friends agree and suggest that you play the, you play the assassin. You really didn't want it to come down to this. Uh, but, but, but you can't back down now. You, you, you'll you have to be the one to assassinate the Overlord. But besides, no one's got any other better ideas. You sneak into the Overlord's room. She's taking a nap, like usual. This is almost too easy. You silently approach your master. She looks so peaceful. <laughs> Time to die! <laughs> Do we kill her? Do we kill her? Or do we check it out? Do we be a coward and say, wait, hold on now. It was just, it was a prank. It was a joke. What do we do? I mean, she's right that we could just kill her. <laughs> should we just kill her? <laughs> or should we get the fuck out of here before she wakes up? Hmm? Does she deserve to die, chat? Pussy. What do you mean, pussy? <laughs> do you want a pussy out? Chicken, chicken? Ch okay, fine. We're gonna check it out. Yeah, it was just a prank. You, you, you don't want to kill her. You you can't go through with it. You turn to leave the room, but you, you find your friends blocking the exit. In a panic whisper, you, 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 you tell them to let him out. Come on, let me out. This seems to have been their way of testing your loyalty. You, you tell them that this is pretty fucked up. <laughs> and ask him to be let out. The Overlord stares into bed. Well, while your head is turned, the demon shut the door. You scramble into the Overlord's closet to hide before she wakes up and sees you. There's, there's nothing you could possibly say to explain this and survive. You're trembling. You can't believe those assholes would bully you like this. You you feel like crying. Light flickers at your feet. It doesn't take long to realize that they set the room on fire. You hear the overlord trying to get the door opened, but to no avail. You, you, you're both trapped. Too afraid to move you. You resign yourself to your fate. You and the overlord burn together. Cowardly underling ending. <laughs> Good. Good. Once again, they're both dead. Mm-hmm. But hey, we did unlock coward now. We can make the underling a coward if you want to, yeah? Good? Three deaths in the fire? Yeah, three of them. <laughs> well, no, maybe there wasn't three deaths that time, yeah? Because... Well, no, the maiden was there. Yeah, never mind. Yeah, we brought the maiden back. So yeah, all three, did three of them die? The only one that lived was a hero that time? Isn't that great? Well, now what do we do? Hmm? 
Because now it seems to be the case if the hero doesn't murder everybody, the fucking, the, the demons do. The demons have like a rebellion thing that they do, yeah? So what do we do? <laughs> How do we make that not happen? <laughs> hmm? Or maybe we continue to allow it to happen. Gotta use your brain. Antisocial, obedient, and plays the hero? Yeah, is that what you want to do? You want to be antisocial and obedient so she leaves and then we play as the hero? Yeah, we'll do that. Sure, we'll play as the hero. Why not? You're the hero, uh huh? We already, we already read all this shit. Mm hmm, yep. Blah, blah, blah. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Yep, mm -hmm. run off. Now, what do we do? <laughs> do we fight these guys or we run away? Because <laughs> last time we fought them and we killed them. And then when we got to the next group of enemies, we uh, tried to, you know, talk our way past them, but we were covered in blood, so we weren't able to do that. So, do we run away this time? Or do we just kill them again? We've already seen how that fucking turns out. So should we run? Hmm? Wanna run? Yeah, we're gonna run. Okay, we're gonna run then. Fuck it, we're gonna run away. Forgetting your pride, you escape with your life. But you can't return home now. Your reputation will be ruined. You wonder how you'll ever be able to rescue that maiden all, the all on your own if you can't even fight some lousy demon underlings. You'll take your chances at the castle. You're a hero after all. This is your job. On your way to the Overlord's castle, you spot a maiden heading back toward the village. <laughs> she couldn't have come from the Overlord's castle, could she? This... Maybe the exact maiden you're currently seeking to rescue. You approach her with curiosity. You ask the maiden what she's doing. Doesn't she know the Overlord's castle is, like, right there? It's dangerous! The maiden explains that she spoke with the Overlord, and it turns out that the demons never had any diabolical plans to harm the village or anyone in it. Oh? I mean, do we believe her? <laughs> do we believe her? Do, are we trusting? Do we, do we believe her story? Or do we say, fuck that shit, and we go in there anyway? Let me, we head there anyway. There's, 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 I mean, demons are bad, right? The demons are bad, right? Of course they're bad. You wanna believe her? Yeah, you wanna believe her? Okay, fine, we'll fucking believe her, yeah? We'll, we'll believe her story, sure. We'll believe her. You have no reason to assume she's lying to you. Even though her story's kind of hard to believe, you feel you should trust her. You tell her you're pretty surprised that everyone has been wrong about demons all along. <laughs> Weird, that. <laughs> the townspeople must be informed of this immediately. The two of you return to the village. They had all been so worried, they praised you for your bravery. But the maiden quickly sets the record straight. There was nothing she needed to be rescued from in the first place. The villagers look to you for an explanation. You politely inform them that it isn't your story to tell. You merely ran into her on the way to the castle. She explains that the Overlord isn't interested in capturing maidens or anything of the sort. The villagers turn to you again in disbelief. <laughs> they aren't being subtle about how little they trust the maiden's story. <laughs> cool. <laughs> you totally believe her though. But to placate these fair citizens, you volunteer to speak to the demons personally. Just in case. The crowd breaks into hushed whispers. You're too busy thinking what a great and reliable hero you are to hear what they're saying, however. The town elder's voice breaks you out of your thoughts. He implores you to meet with the Overlord immediately and tells you all to keep an eye on the maiden. Sorry, says they will keep an eye on the maiden until you return. You figured that sounds alright, but the mood's kind of intense for some reason. Did... Did, did you miss something? <laughs> you aren't sure what's going on, but you get the feeling that it might be bad to leave the maiden on her own. But she suddenly takes off running! Oh, you thought the two of you were in this together. Her actions have, have convinced the crowd that she's obviously a liar and a witch. People are shouting at you for the hunter down, and, and her demon friend's down already, but that doesn't sound like a very heroic task. You can't help but feel these people are wrong. It's up to you to catch up to her and talk to demons in, a talk to demons in order to clear this up this misunderstanding. I can't read. <laughs> you valiantly dash off after the maiden, toward the Overlord's castle. The air becomes dark and thick as you enter deep into the demon territory. An evil miasma? No, you you realize it's just normal smoke. You see the maiden ahead, but she's stopped in her tracks. The Overlord's castle is engulfed in flames. You had only taken an eye off the maiden for a second, but she's already disappeared. You get closer to the castle and the smoke is so thick now, you, you think of turning back. The maiden might need your help, but you can barely see. She could be impossible to find. She... she could have been lying to you all along. Was this a trap? Would it be worth risking your life on that chance? Your... your legs feel heavy. No. Going in there... <laughs> Shut the fuck up, chat member. Don't go saying kiss. G going in there would be suicide. You return to the villagers and tell them that there was nothing you could do. You were too late. The maiden was claimed by the demons. Cool, asshole. <laughs> cool, ass... yeah? Bystander hero ending A. Yeah? What a cool fucking hero he is. Did a great job there, penis. Good. Well, now we have the trusting trait for the hero. We can do that. Yeah. Good, good, good.
I like how we got back to the we we we, we managed to get the maiden back to the village, and, and then the, the villagers were just like, "No, you're lying." <laughs> Isn't that great? Isn't that cool and awesome? Oh fucking Christ! Well, now what do we do, chat? Hmm? Who do we play as now? Do 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 do. Boop, boop, boop. Check out my little routes over here. Yeah, we have nine out of forty-one. The underling only has nine endings, the overlord has ten, and then the maiden and the hero both have eleven. Taint that neat. Hmm. <laughs> Let's unlock all the traits and then do a run with all of them turned on, yeah? <laughs> Good. What does trusting affect? Uh, it affects when the maiden is coming back from the castle, and she tells you that the overlord was an evil. So the hero's like, oh, okay, I yeah, totally, I trust you. Da, da, da. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Maybe it's helpful for having the overlord get kissed by the ma- Yeah, you want to make the hero trusting? Sure. <laughs> you also want the tyrant to be- Wait, what? Oh, you want a tyrant? Overlord with a disloyal underling? Yeah? And then, a, and then a trusting hero and then we play as the maiden? Is that what you guys want? Yeah? We can do that. Fuck it, let's do that one. You're a maiden, yada yada, etc, etc. Uh-huh, you leave the note behind saying you want to get captured. Mm-hmm. You come up to the little gremlin fucker. Should we shout? I mean, this doesn't seem to really affect anything, as we've learned by now. <laughs> Whenever we come to this choice, we it doesn't really do anything. It, it just depends on whether or not the fucking grumbling is the grumbling, the underling is hungry or not. So let's just uh, let, let, let's just let's just fucking introduce ourselves. Yeah, let's just do that. Uh huh. Hi. Excuse me. Mm hmm. They're ignoring us, but they take us back to the castle. Mm hmm. After a long walk, you were introduced to the Overlord. She lectures the underling that brought you here, who was apparently told not to leave their post. Yada yada, blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. We read this shit already. You explain why you've come, and she squints at you. Turns out she never had any plans to capture maidens. Mm hmm. We already read this shit. Mm hmm. Yeah? You've always been told the demons want to capture you, etc., etc. You ask the overlord what you should do to be more suitable as a maiden. She doesn't understand. Tells you to go home. You want to learn more about her now? She thinks so, however. You insist on saying to talk to her more. The Overlord shares many stories about demons with you, and little by little you realize that you might not be the ruthless monster you were raised to believe. Turns out, blah blah blah, we already read this dialogue. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. What does the new shit happen? Uh, what, what if she's lying, but she's not? Mm hmm. And then the hero comes in the room, yeah? Hi, hit the heroes here. You're surprised to see him at first, but you realize he must have been sent to retrieve you. Confused, the hero asks what's going on. You explain the situation, blah blah blah. Mm hmm. You apologize for causing trouble. You decide to leave and you head back to the village. Okay, cool. Cool, you'll be back soon. Oh, hold on, here's something new now, finally. <laughs> Near the castle's entrance, you spy a group of suspicious demons congregating. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, it got all colorful all of a sudden. Uh, it's not It's not just blue anymore. They're talking about assassinating the Overlord. You, you have to warn her. But the hero shakes his head. He says that if this is the true nature of demons, the world is better off with less of them. This isn't right, you think. What kind of hero passes up the chance to save a life? The demons have taken notice of you. It's now or never. Y you take off to the castle and the unreliable hero follows shortly after. You burst into the Overlord's room. Although your words spilling out at once, you, you you should probably slow down, but there's no time. The Overlord seems to have followed your frantic explanation, but clearly doesn't understand the urgency of the situation. <laughs> the underling you recognized from before barges in calling you a liar. You're surprised that they were part of this evil plot. They seem nice. The other demons coming right after them, saying the whole thing was the first underling's idea. Everyone's shouting at each other now, it's really stressing you out. You're relieved when the Overlord demands silence. She threatens them with violence, and you think that she's very Overlord-like at this moment. <laughs> the group of demons hiss to each other before shutting the door, leaving the little one behind. You watch as it pounds on the door in, 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 in distress. Have they locked you all in? You have a bad feeling about this. Oh, uh-oh. And thinking that must have jinxed it, because now the room is engulfed in flames. If only, you hadn't ignored, if, you, only if you had ignored the demons before, you and the hero would have stumbled into the situation. If you would just pretend not to hear them, if, if you just left as you were told, only the Overlord would have been killed. But you couldn't have done that. That, that. that option isn't for you. You think that no matter what, you'll always strive for the path where everybody survives. It, it must exist. It simply must. The Overlord seizes her underling. You, you beg for their- sorry, they beg for their life. You pray. You don't know what else to do, so you just- you just pray. The Overlord's claws pierce the underling's chest. They scream an awful scream. She digs and twists her claws into the poor thing while you continue to pray. But there's no saving any of you now. You, the Overlord, the hero, 
and the underlinked corpse are all consumed by flames. The end! <laughs> Devout made an ending. Good. And then they all died. All of them died horribly in that room. Lovely. We make, are we making progress yet, Chad? <laughs> are we making any progress towards having any of these people not fucking die? Uh, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we sure did try, didn't we? Do, 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 you want to do the same thing? You, you want? What do you mean the same thing? We had to do the same thing. We just did that. Oh, do the same thing but play as a hero? Y yeah. You sure it's not gonna just be the exact same ending though? Like, are you, you, you want to do that? Y yeah. I may, may, y maybe. We do have to get all the endings. I mean, we do technically have to do that. If we want 100% of this game, we do have to do the same thing again. But from the hero's perspective, and then the underling perspective, and then the fucking overlord's perspective, yeah. Should we do that right now? Should we, should we just, like, knock all those out of the way? Get them all out of the way and done? <sighs> we seem to only be missing, like, one trait for the maiden and one trait for the overlord as well. I mean, maybe, well, no, maybe there's more. I guess the menu expands, yeah, as that was happening earlier. The menu gets, like, longer the more traits you unlock, so never mind. We're just gonna do that? Cool. Okay, we'll just do that. We'll, we'll do the same thing, but as a hero then. Yeah, cool? Cool. You are a hero. You have some stupid belt buckle on your fucking head for some reason. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we don't want to fight these guys, right? Yeah? We, we want to be friends? We don't, we don't want to fight them? You want to just head in there? Or should we kill them? Come, well, I mean, if we kill them, they're not gonna be... <laughs> we're gonna get in trouble, right? Let's just, let's just, let's just, let's just go. Let's do what we usually do, yeah? Let's just, let's just head up there. Mm-hmm. After a long trek, you make it to the castle's front gates, where you're faced with an army of demons that all look very intimidating. There's no way to sneak past these monsters if you want to reach the Overlord. So, did we just ask him to let us in? Because, like, I mean, we're not covered in blood this time, yeah? So we should be able to just go well, we walk right in, yeah? We're not covered in blood? So, yeah, let's see if they'll let us in. You go up to the nearest demon and explain why you've come here. They stare you down, and you feel very uncomfortable. <laughs> but they seem to trust you and escort you directly to the Overlord's chambers. That was easy. The Overlord and the Maiden seem to be in the middle of some casual conversation when you barge in. You all look at each other in surprise and confusion. There's no time to hesitate. Yeah? I mean, do we, do we kill her? <laughs> I mean, we, we could get this ending instead. <laughs> we could go try to murder the Overlord. Or we can continue down the path that we're doing and we all end up in the big fire together. Yeah? Hmm? Hmm? Let's just, let's just, let's just see what's going on. And we'll, just, we'll, just, we'll, just do the, we'll just continue on the same path we're doing, yeah? The Maiden explains that she was never actually captured and that she came here on her own volition. That was pretty dangerous of her. Sorry, that was a pretty dangerous thing of her to do. But no one got hurt, so at least there's that. You ask her to return to the village with you to assure everyone of her safety. The Overlord allows the two of you to leave, and you casually exit the castle. You pause when you see a group of suspicious demons standing near the entrance, though. Okay, now we're back in weird color zone. <laughs> we're back in the world of multiple colors again. Uh-huh. They're talking about assassinating the Overlord. This proves to you that demons really are foul creatures. We... Hi, I got something in my throat. We have to tell her about this. You don't understand what the maiden is thinking. The world is better off with less demons. They're all cold, ruthless creatures that should be destroyed. <laughs> Am I okay? No. <laughs> I'm choking on my own spit, trying to swap between these dumb voices. And those same creatures have just noticed you eavesdropping. The Maiden takes off into the castle, but you have no choice but to follow. You burst into the Overlord's room. The Maiden frantically tries to communicate what you just overheard. A demon underling barges in next, calling you liars. It's followed by a group from the entrance who shift the blade black on... But not black onto the little one. Back onto the little one. These demons only care about themselves. How low can they be? You begin shouting at them, and the whole room dissolves into sorry, yeah, dissolves into noise until the Overlord yells for everybody to shut their traps. She threatens them with violence. This Overlord is no better than his subjects. You grip your sword tightly. If you have to cut through everyone here to get this maiden to safety, you certainly will. The group of demons hiss at each other before shutting the door, leaving the runt of the litter behind. You glance around for another exit, but there isn't one. You have a terrible feeling about this. In an instant, the whole room is in flames. What kind of demonic magic is this? The underling pounds on the door, upset that it's been betrayed. You join in, vowing to slay the cowardly demons on the other side. The next moment, the overlord has taken hold of the underling. It's crying for mercy. She thrusts her claws into the underling's chest, and it screams out a horrible scream. You back away. You, you won't be the next target of her rage. She continues to dig and twist her claws into its limp body. You can no longer watch. You look to the maiden. She's crying. 
hands clasped together for prayer. To have faith at a time like this, you, you envy her. The two of you, the Overlord and the Underling's corpse, are all consumed by flames. Yay! <laughs> the resigned hero ending. Good. Good, and then they all died. Also, I should save my game, yeah? Okay. No, no, no. Oh, oh it auto saves, right? I forgot. Never mind, auto saves. Forgot about that. Anyway, yeah, so we do the same thing again, but now with the different characters. Yeah, we do, we do as the underling the, oh, and the overlord. <laughs> it's the same fucking thing. Well, yeah, that's what we're doing right now. <laughs> we're trying to get the same ending, but with every character. Do, 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 do. She thought she could break the door? Who? Who thought she could break the door? Nobody could break the door. Beep boop. Here, just go do that as the underling, yeah? We'll, we'll do the exact same thing, but as the underling. And we'll just go in like, uh, fucking... We'll go and get murdered. <laughs> we'll go and get murdered by the overlord real quick. <laughs> and she twists our guts out, yeah? Yada yada. So now we have to overthrow her though, right? Because we're part of that whole thing, yeah? Oh, you thought the hero could break it? Yeah, is that what you thought was gonna happen? No, the, I mean, the hero was already in there, remember? The, the, the hero also died in the previous pathway, so why would the hero be able to break it now? Maybe? I don't know. But yeah, sure, let, let, yeah, let's, let's, let's do the same path as last time, yeah? No, you're sick of the overlord holding you and your friends back. You agree that it's time for a change of management. Your friend suggested maybe you should be the next overlord. You like the sound of that? You announced your first act of rebellion is to take the day off like you wanted. <laughs> your friends aren't really impressed, though. You would show them that you'll talk more about the assassination thing when you get back, which satisfies them. You sneak out of the castle and have some fun. Blah, 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 same old stuff here. Mm -hmm. Now, we don't eat her. <laughs> we don't eat the maiden. We talk to her, we bring her back to the castle. Mm -hmm. We gotta get everybody in that room so we can all burn to death, right? Mm -hmm. It's all cool that we fucking blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. Yo, what up? Yeah, now, now we do the assassination thing, yes. Mm -hmm. Our loyalty? Of course we're fucking disloyal. We're gonna be able to kill the overlord, of course, yeah? Of course, dude. Now, we do have to come back and get this at some point. Don't remember, we have to get all these. <laughs> we do have to come back and do all these things, yeah, at some point. But for now, we're gonna ignore that one. You, you, you left? Did we get a kiss yet? No, nobody fucking kissed yet. <laughs> we just seen more people burn to death. <laughs> is all we've seen so far. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, you follow your friends inside the castle, yada yada. Mm-hmm. Stupid plan, yeah, good. It's the same shit. Are the hero and the maiden gonna walk out? They should, right? While we're out here talking? Yeah, there they are. You and your friends turn to notice a pair of humans have overheard the entire conversation. They take off into the castle. Are they, are they headed to the Overlord's room? Fuck! <laughs> the Overlord's gonna hear you for sure. I'm oh, sorry, she's gonna hear for sure that she, if she... Wait, what the fuck? The Overlord will kill you for sure if she found that you were conspiring to take her out. You dash into the castle after the humans. Sure enough, the maiden's already frantically telling the Overlord everything. Y y you shout that the humans are liars. Your friends soon arrive to back you up. Except they don't. Instead, they blame the whole thing on you. They cried that it was all they, your idea, and that they were just gonna go with the flow. Too scared to refuse your crazy plan. You can't believe they tell the Overlord such a blatant lie. Oh, you always knew that. You always knew better than to trust them. The other one didn't have a choice here. You all shout at each other till the Overlord demands silence. Regardless of who led this conspiracy, I have no choice but to punish everyone to keep you all in your place, crushed beneath my heel. She sounds tough, but lately all she does is sleep. You kind of doubt her strength. <laughs> you hear your traitor as friends might have something about going back to plan A, and suddenly, the door slams shut. You're trapped in here with the Overlord and two humans. And then the room bursts into flames. You, you, you pound on the door, screaming curses at those who betrayed you. The hero joins you, vowing to slay a lot of them. You wish you'd get that chance. The Overlord grabs you by the throat. Oh, you, you cry for mercy. You, you were forced into this mess. You, you, you're sure now that they would have killed you if, if you sided with her. But the Overlord doesn't hear you, please. She drives her claws into your chest. At least she made it quick. Good. We don't, we don't even get to burn to death. We die before we burn to death in that one. Traitor underling ending. Good. Let's reset the stage now. Now we do the exact same thing, but as the Overlord. To get that out of the way. Cool? Cool. Also, hi there, welcome to the stream, how you doing, yeah? Just mash on through here, nothing new. Yeah, we gotta be we gotta be rude to him and tell him no, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Comes back with the maiden. And we go, yeah, hi, how you doing, maiden, yeah? But we gotta tell her to leave, though, right? We gotta tell her to leave? Yeah, go away, shush. You, you gotta go home. 
You, you, got, you gotta go home. Shoo. Wait, no, wait, wait, no, do we tell her to go? Wait, no. Ha wait, hold on. No, we don't tell her to leave, right? Because if I tell her to leave, she'll leave before they start the plot. Yeah, no, so we have to, we have to keep it, yeah, we have to let her stay, right? Yeah, yeah, we gotta let her stay first. And then the hero comes in, and then the hero and the maiden walk out together, and then they see the- Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The hero comes in, yada yada. What? Oh, hold on, same shit, yeah? It's <laughs> his new dialogue. C captured? N not at all, I only wanted to meet the Overlord. Didn't anybody read the note that I left? After everything is explained, the hero expresses his relief that this whole misunderstanding hadn't led to any horrible consequences. The maiden apologizes for causing trouble, and the hero asks her to return to the village with him. <sighs> Confusing feelings well up inside your heart. You're surprised that, you're sorry, you're surprised that you had one of those to begin with. <laughs> you don't want the hero to take this maiden away from you. Uh-oh. <laughs> well, I mean... I mean, hold on now. <laughs> now, if we want to continue with the ending we're trying to get, where we all burn to death, we gotta, we gotta let him go. But we can also keep her here. <laughs> we can also force her to stay here. Here, let's just keep on track for now with the one that we're trying to get, and we'll let him go. And then we'll come back here and check that one out later, yeah? Cool? Cool, we'll, we'll let him go. <sighs> You're certain that she... She'll return to spend more time with you. You just have to trust in that, you decide. With the hero and the maiden gone, you plop down under the comfort of your luxurious overlord bed. Your room feels so... empty now. Is... is this loneliness? You hope your new friend will be back soon. You... close your eyes for a while. Oh, colors! <laughs> Suddenly colors! You've almost fallen asleep when the maiden and the hero burst into your room, frantically trying to communicate something to you. You're told that a group of demons are plotting to assassinate you. You're not surprised. How nice are the humans to care, though? One of your underlings barges in next, shouting that the humans are liars. They are followed by another group of demons, crying that everyone... Sorry, crying that everything was the first underlings' plan. Everyone's shouting at each other now, and, and it's very annoying. You yell at all of them to shut their traps. You have no doubt that your servants would let their ambition cloud their judgment and lead them to try to take your throne. Regardless of who led this conspiracy, I have no choice but to punish everyone and keep all of you in your place, crushed beneath my heel. But again, saying that made you feel very overlord-like. <laughs> you aren't sure if you have the strength to back it up, though. Lately, all you do is sleep. The group of demons start muttering something about going back to plan A and suddenly slam the door shut. You, the maiden, the hero, and one of your underlings are trapped inside. In an instant, the whole room is in flames. The underling pounds on the door, cursing their friends for betraying them. The hero pounds on the door as well, vowing to slay the cowardly demons on the other side. Huh. So this is how you'll die. Burned alive in your own room by those you thought you could trust. You should have expected this from a bunch of idiot demons, though. You notice the maiden crying. Why does she have to die over something that has nothing to do with her? Perhaps she was cursed from the moment she spoke to you. You wonder if you're cursed as well. You're so filled with anger and frustration, you don't even notice you grab the underling those traitors blamed everything on. They cry for mercy, saying that they were dragged into this plot, knowing they'd be killed if they took your side. They cry that they didn't want to have to kill you. You almost feel sorry for them. Yeah, and we can forgive them. <laughs> That's not what we're here for. We're not here to forgive them. We're here to do the exact same thing we did with every other character. We're gonna fucking kill them. We're gonna fucking kill them. You pierce their chest with your claws. They scream. The hero backs away. He's wise not to interfere. They stop moving, but you keep digging and twisting your claws into them. It doesn't make you feel any better. The underling's corpse burns along with you and two humans. There. <laughs> Spiteful overlord. Cool, there. Now we got the ending with every single character, yeah? Cool? Cool, now we can do some other shit. Now that that's out, so now what do we do, chat? Now that we've done all that, what do we do? We 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 have the we have the possessive trait now. We didn't get the merciful one though, because we didn't choose that option. Weirdly enough, I thought you didn't have to choose the option to get it. Weird, whatever, it's fine though. So what should we do now, chat? Yeah, murder. <laughs> you wanted me to murder him, yeah. <laughs> you want the everybody burns alive together ending, yeah? You saw the same thing we just did, but the underling stays alive. You want that? Is that what you fucking want? 
do 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 do. You want to do the exact same thing, but with a different option as the overlord? Okay, sure, we'll do that. Yeah, sure. We'll do the exact same thing we just did, but instead we won't murder the underling. Cool? Cool. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I guess I can just press RB to skip. So if I press this button, it goes boop. It just takes you straight to each of the choices, yeah? So just, just yeah, you take the time off. Or sorry, no, get back to work, rather. Yeah, yeah. Uh, fucking, you should stay. Yes. Mm hmm I... Wait, is this new? It's not skipping it for some reason. Is this new? It, it didn't skip it. Usually when you press the skip button, it skips any dialogue you've already seen before. Have we not seen this? Whatever. You enjoy a nice long chat with her, sharing stories about your kind. She expresses her surprise that demons are not at all what she expected them to be. You are glad that she seems to have an open mind about these kind of things. No, we already read this. <laughs> we already read all this. This is not new. <laughs> yeah? Let's just skip this. There we go. Yeah? Now again, we're not going to keep her here because we're trying to get the, we're trying to do the exact same thing we just did, but now we're not going to kill the underling at the end. So we got to let him go. And then we head to bed and we wake up and then boop, suddenly colors. Yeah? Good. Uh-huh. Same old shit. Yada yada. Everybody comes in. We scream a little bit. We do our whole overlord bullshit, they lock the door, room is lit on fire, and now, and now we do the same thing, yeah? You almost feel sorry for the little fucker. Almost, being the key word. And now, now, now we forgive him, yeah? Is that what we do? We do the same thing, we forgive him? Sure. <laughs> we're, we're gonna be merciful. You release the underling. Killing them wouldn't make you feel any better. Besides, they've already gotten their punishment. You'll all burn together oh look at that <laughs> the overlord's true ending oh <laughs> that's the true ending chat that's something different yeah hmm hmm good oh before you're taken back to reset the story once again you pause for a moment true end you say to yourself what, what was the point of all my effort if the true ending is this terrible <laughs> you you mustn't forget where you were. This is bad end theater. <laughs> is the pain setting in? Oh, but you should have been, you should have been aware of that. That you'd be shown. What, what the fuck? You should have been aware of what you've been shown when you entered this place. It's a problem I've seen quite often. At some point, you grew attached to my little cast. You started to relate to their flaws, their plights. You started wishing for their happiness. But you're not going to find any of that in my theater. My lovingly crafted labyrinth of suffering. Anyway, hope you're part of the interruption. You're making great progress. The choice to continue on to the next ending is always yours. I'll leave you to it, dear guest. All right, cool. Yeah, let's reset the stage then. Yeah, go away, shit. <laughs> okay, good. And now if we go here really quick, peep this shit. If we go check out the overlord here. Yeah? We got that one at the very... That's a true ending. You see how some of them say bad ending and the, and the one with the skull at the very end is a true one. Yeah? Good? You following along? So we, we, got the, oh, we, got the, we got their true ending now, yeah? Oh, hold on. Don't give up. Surely there's a good ending somewhere. <laughs> yeah? Where's it at? Where is it, though, huh? Where's the good ending? Yeah, you can't fucking tease me with that shit. You can't just tease me with that shit. You hate this game? Well, you gotta figure it out. You're, it's, it's called Bad End Theater. <laughs> it's called Bad End Theater, chat, remember? Well, now what do we do? Because we could do the exact same thing with all the other characters now, but again, they'd all just burn up. You know, they would all just burn up and die. <laughs> That's all that would happen. They'd all just burn up and die in that room, and they get their true endings as well, I'm assuming. So do we try something different? Do we do, do, do we do some other bullshit for a little bit? What, what do we do, chat? You want to go Maiden? Yeah? You want Okay, you want to do Maiden, but then what do we do? Which, what changes do we make as we play as the Maiden? Do, do, do. Ba, boo, boo. Ah, let me take a sip of, take a sip of my coffee. Do, 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 do. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> You're gonna commission your Maiden X Overlord art if the game won't let you have it. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Uh, possessive? Possessive tyrant. Pure evil underling, yeah? <laughs> just die, I guess. <laughs> yeah, sure, we'll just die. <laughs> no, we can do possessive. Yeah, hold on. We'll do possessive tyrant. Yeah, overlord. And then we'll, we'll, we'll play as a maiden so she'll keep us there. She'll, like, force us to stay, yeah? Is that what we want to do? We'll do that. She's going to force us to stay there now. Sure. And the underling can stay disloyal, yada yada, etc, etc. Diplomatic, yeah, cool. Cool, all right, we'll do that. The hero's not gonna have- the hero's not gonna fight anybody on the way in there. Etc, etc. Skip ahead, uh-huh. 
we introduce ourselves, yeah? Well, here, let's just shout really quick so we get the new dialogue, because, like, <laughs> just, this, this doesn't affect anything. Like, this doesn't fucking affect anything, as we've come to learn. Whether we shout for the hero or introduce ourselves, all that matters here is whether or not the fucking underling is hungry. So let's just, let's just shout for some new dialogue, shall we, yeah? You yell, but the hero does not come. <laughs> The demon's put off by your sudden shouting and asked you to keep it down. You apologize. They seem more confused than hostile, which totally catches you off guard. You tell the demon your name and explain that you're a maiden from the village. You tell them that you were thinking that maybe you could undertake your role better, yada yada, we're to read this shit, uh-huh. Oh, okay. <laughs> and, oh shit, that skipped ahead way farther than I thought it was going to fucking A. So, we're up here now, we had our nice little chat. The, the, the fucking hero just barged into the room and is like, hey, I'm taking the maiden back. And as you're leaving... The Overlord objects to the hero's suggestion. You, you tell her you, you plan on returning soon, but she isn't having it. You, you feel nervous. The hero puts on a brave face for you. If you won't let her go, maybe you demons are evil after all. And if you are, I'll be forced to vanquish you. <laughs> you leave me no choice. The, the Overlord suddenly jumps the hero. She tears into him with her claws. You, you want to cry out, but the scream catches in your throat. You, you watch because you can't look away. Has she really been lying all along? You, you, you wonder, is, is this your punishment for questioning the divine plan? The overload approaches you now. You back yourself into a corner. Her expression is complicated. She has like a million eyeballs. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Being captured by the overlord in a horrible way like this was your destiny after all. But the Overlord stops. Or rather, someone has stopped her. Uh oh, what, what happened? Uh oh. Whatever held back your screen before doesn't stop you this time. <gasps> uh oh. The Overlord is being ripped to shreds by one of her demon underlings. You, you think you recognize them, but it's hard to tell with all the blood. Everyone stop moving now. The room is silent, save for the underlings' heavy breathing. You thank them for what they've done, even though it was awful. You feel you've been rescued from a terrible fate. They look at you, confused for a moment, but then they puff out their chest. You should probably go home! This place is dangerous! <laughs> you follow their advice and make your way out of the castle. You decide never to leave home again for the rest of your life. Escaped Maiden ending B! Good. Good. Yeah? Lovely. Reset the stage, shall we? Now, did that happen because the underling was disloyal? Is that why that happened? Because <laughs> remember, the underling was disloyal. So what if we didn't make the underling disloyal? Would, would, would they have not came in there and killed the overlord? Who knows? Who knows now? What do we do, chat? It's a puzzle game, remember? We gotta figure this shit out. Do, 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 do. You keep asking for a kiss option. <laughs> you keep asking for the kiss option. It's like, listen. There, you can't just say kiss option every two seconds. Replace this loyal with coward and add trusting. Yeah, you want to try that? So it will make him a coward? So he doesn't go through with the assassination plot? You got it. And then add trusting. Where's trusting at? Oh, there's trusting? Yeah, I mean, trusting won't really affect anything in that situation. Yeah, sure, we'll do that. Sure, we'll try that one. Good, good, good. <laughs> Fucking kiss. <laughs> no. God. Okay, just, let's just head in here. Yeah, maiden. Yeah, same shit. Uh-huh, introduce ourselves. Uh-huh. Hello? Wait, what? Oh, God, that went really quick. Oh, Jesus, hold on. Oh, yeah, we're, okay, so this is what happened. Okay, so same thing, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She kills the hero. Mm-hmm. She approached you. Her expression is complicated. It was your destiny, after all. There we go. She vows to keep you very safe from now on. You're afraid to find out what that means, but... There's... There's no one left to save you. You belong to the Overlord now. Captured Maiden ending A. Good. That was a quick one, yeah? Because <laughs> that time the underling wasn't there to, uh... To, to, to stop her from taking us. Well, now what do we do? Hmm? Now what do we do? Beep. Don't say anything. <laughs> why, why are you saying nice? She fucking kidnapped us. Is, oh, is that your ooh, ooh wholesome bullshit you wanted? She fucking kidnapped us. She's forcing us to- she murdered the hero and she's forcing us to stay there. <laughs> That's kind of together. No. You wanna do heroic? You try- you wanna, you wanna make her try to kill the overlord? Yeah, same thing? 
Could do that. Could make this fella heroic. We're missing two traits for the maiden? Yeah. Maybe more. We might be missing even more traits, because remember, it does expand. It, like the little thing, it's a bit bigger. Sex dungeon ending. <laughs> it's no fucking sex dungeon ending. Oh, good lord. Do, 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 do. Ba, 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 ba. There's at least two, yeah. There's at least two traits we don't have for the maiden. And there's one, at least one that we don't have for the underling. Oh. We have to play as a maiden more? Yeah, well, do you, you want a hint? We can check out the whole hint thing. You want to go look at her map, yeah? We only have three endings as a hero. Like, we, we have four as the underling, four as the overlord, five as the maiden, and only three as the hero. And then here's the route. In case this gives you any indication of what we can do as her. In case, you, in case you want some hints on what we what we can do with these people. Welcome back! Are you pleased with your progress so far? Hmm? Maybe? Am I pleased? Okay, we got a bunch of endings we can do. There's plenty of them. You don't want any hints? Okay, pardon me, no hints then. Just don't look at that map. Okay, so hold on. You want heroic and disloyal. You want that? Yeah, heroic, disloyal. So do we, do we make the underling a coward then too or not? Wait, do you want the underling to like... Because if, if they're disloyal, you want the underling to kill the overlord then, yeah? So we don't want coward? And then you want a heroic hero? Do you want the, do you want the hero to be dutiful too while we're at it? <laughs> you can make him dutiful. That way they'll kill all the fucking demons on the way in. And then who do we play as? Oh, the maiden? Play as the maiden again? Do do you want to make him dutiful? Okay, I'll make him dutiful. Let's go the whole shebang with the hero. And hungry? <laughs> you want the? <laughs> if we make the underling hungry, you're just gonna the, the, the fucking the, they're just gonna eat the maiden. We've already seen how that turns out. And then if he plays the maiden, she's just gonna die. Like we we could we could make we could make them hungry and then play as somebody else and see how that turns out if you wanted. But who the fuck is texting me? <laughs> who the fuck is texting me? Okay, there we go. Sorry. Eats the maiden immediately. Yeah. Should we should we just do what we have right here, but then play as the uh, play as the maiden? Should we do that? Let's just do the same thing. We play as the maiden. Sure, why not? Cool. Cool. With the traits that we have currently set up. Yeah, let's, let's go. Get moving. Get moving. No, shit, fucking sk skip all this shit, yeah? Sk skip it. There we go, yeah. Uh, introduce ourselves, yeah? Yeah, hi, hello, how you doing? It's me, I'm Maiden from Village. Alright, cool. And now they're sitting there having this nice little chat, uh huh. They're sitting there having their good, their good little chat. You got butterflies in your stomach, ooh. <laughs> but then a hero barges into the room. His clothes are stained with a dark liquid. It's dripping from his weapon, too. You realize it must be demon blood. Something horrible has happened. The hero suddenly dashes toward the overlord, sword drawn. Uh-oh. Oh, no. What do we do? <laughs> Uh-oh. What do we do, Chad? <laughs> do we be a martyr? <laughs> do we do we try to protect the overlord? Or do we just stand by and do nothing and watch her get fucking attacked and have the fight unfold in front of us? Hmm? Hmm? You want to protect? Yeah, you want to protect? We'll pr okay, well, everyone's saying protect. <laughs> We're going to fucking protect her. You selflessly throw yourself in front of the hero's blade, acting as a shield. It's funny, you think. You never could have imagined this would be the way that you died. The roles are all switched around, but it... It... It feels right to you somehow. You're glad that your destiny turned out to be saving someone rather than being saved yourself. As your vision fades, you hope that everything turns out alright for your new friend. Sacrificial maiden ending! <laughs> Yay, she's dead. <laughs> Again. <laughs> but hey, we have the martyr ability now. Yeah. Oh, fucking Christ. Do, do, do. Bum, bum, bum. Maybe if the hero was dutiful, he will hear the maiden yell for help? I don't believe he does. Maybe, though. I could try. But from what I remember, I don't think that actually changes anything. I'm, I'm pretty sure that choice is literally just like only affected by whether or not the underling is hungry. Well, now what do we do? <laughs> now what do we do? We could do the same thing. Oh, wait, oh, same thing, but as a hero? Okay, you got it. We'll do the same thing, but as the hero. I was gonna say we could do the same thing, but as the overlord, but yeah, we'll do it as a hero. Sure. We'll do that. You're a hero, boy! You have a belt buckle on your head. So, we have to kill these fuckers. Yeah, we, we, we have to bravely slaughter the evil creatures. Good. 
You make quick work of those fuckers. Yep, you move forward. And now we gotta cut through these pieces of shit too while we're at it. You gather your courage. This is what it must be done in order to rescue the maiden. These are all evil demons anyway. The world is much safer with them gone. That's what you tell yourself while you kill one after another on the way to the Overlord's chambers. You find the maiden being held captive by the Overlord, just as you expected. But for some reason you can't sense anything sinister happening? You all look at each other in surprise and confusion. This is no time to hesitate. Okay, now now we have to attack her, yeah? Because we, we've already done the ending where we ask what's going on. Now we, now we have to try to get the going for the kill, yeah? We gotta go in there? We have to destroy the Overlord. You lunge forward to put an end to the evil Overlord. <gasps> But your blade pierces the maiden instead. She has sacrificed herself to protect this demon. It makes it takes you a moment to recover from the shock. The overlord wails. Why did you do that? You're not sure if the question was directed at you. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> oh. Oh. The overlord strikes at you in a vengeful rage. You parry. And she is slain. Your sword feels heavy. You look at your hands. Your, your clothes. Blood. So much blood. You look to the fallen maiden, wondering what to tell the townspeople. Why? Why would she protect the Overlord? She must have been brainwashed by demonic magic. You pick up the Overlord's head, wrapping it in your cape, and begin the long journey back to town. You will say that you were too late, that nothing could have been done for the girl, but the Overlord was slain. There will be a celebration. Loyal hero ending. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Well, I guess the under- was the underling dead? I don't know. <laughs> the underling probably ran away, eh? Good, let's reset the stage. Good, 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 good. Ah, oh, well now what do we do? Do do the same thing, but now- let's see. Now, what happened there? We, we, what do you call it? What happened there? We were able to beat the Overlord, right? Because we had the training. Like we, we fought all the demons on the way up there. What if we don't fight the demons on the way up there? And then we try to kill her. <laughs> yeah, we can see what happens then. Or we can do the same thing, but from the Overlord's perspective. Or we can do the same thing, but from the Underling perspective. Hmm? Hmm? The under like, where the fuck is the Underling at right now? All this shit's going on. Like, what do we do? Let's see the hero just kill her. Yeah, you want, you want you want to see the hero just fucking kill the overlord? You got it. So we have to make the maiden not be a martyr, right? Yeah, just to not be a martyr. That way she won't like jump in front of the thing. Yeah, cool. Cool. All right, let's go in there and do the exact same thing. We'll, we'll fucking murder. <laughs> we'll, we'll fucking murder everybody. <laughs> Except not the maiden this time. Fuck you. Fuck you. All right, cool. Yeah. Now we have to destroy the overlord. Yeah. You lunge forward, driving your blade through the evil Overlord. She screams, then falls silent. The Overlord has been slain. You smile, offering the maiden your hand. She takes it. After slight hesitation, she must be surprised at how strong you are. You escort the maiden home. She is oddly quiet on the trek back to the village. She must be too shy to speak. The villagers are very pleased with what a good job you've done! Slaying the Overlord and saving a hostage, they throw a huge celebration in your name! You will remember for generations as the greatest hero the village has ever seen! <laughs> Triumphant hero! <laughs> Congratulations, asshole! Ah, uh, fuck. Good, good, good. Reset the state. Oh, okay. You wanna do coward underling? Yeah? What would that affect, though? Cause that just means he doesn't, he doesn't go through with the assassination plot, right? Yeah, we tried that one. Like, we did that as the underling, and we were, when, when we were a coward, they just got killed by their friends. Oh, no, no, yeah, 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 they tried to, yeah, they tried to hide inside the closet, and then they got burnt to death as the room got lit on fire with the coward ending. Now what do we do? <laughs> now what do we do, chat? Hmm? We got 19 out of 41, we're almost halfway there. We got, we, we almost got, we almost got half of the endings. Boop, boop, boop. Mm. Ah, pardon me. What about that ending from way back where the hero kills the underling? Yeah? Ah, uh, how do we get that one? So we have to make the underling... Yeah, the underling has to eat the maiden at the start, and then the underling has to go to the town? Oh yeah, like, if, so we just play as a hero, but the underling eats the maiden, yeah? That should be easy. 
Make them not disloyal or cowardly? You got it. Okay, so we'll play as a hero, and the main is gonna get eaten by the underling. Cool? <laughs> cool. Let's head in there. Let's go in there, sure. You're a hero! Holy shit! Wow! Mm-hmm. You head off on an adventure to rescue the maiden. But it... Dude, wait, what? Wait, what is this? But the demon soldiers block your path. You could kill them to gain experience? Question mark? Wait, where's the maiden? I thought we were gonna run into the... I thought we were gonna bump into the fucking... The... The... The, the underling. Uh... Well, oh, so, so the maiden's dead. Right now. Right? Like, she's been eaten by the underling at this moment? So what the fuck are we doing? <laughs> what do we do now? <laughs> should we run away? Or should we fight him? You wanna flee? Yeah? I guess we can flee. Sure, we'll run away. Forgetting your pride, you escape with your life. But you can't return home now, your reputation will be ruined! You wonder how you're going to be able to rescue that maiden all on your own if you can't even fight some lousy demon underlings. You'll take your chances at the castle. You're a hero, after all. This is your job. After a long trek, you make it to the front gate, blah blah blah, there's no way to sneak past these fuckers. Do we just sneak past them? <laughs> I mean... Because the maiden's dead now, yeah? Like, the, 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 the maiden's... What the... So how do you get the... How do you get the ending where the hero kills the underling? At the very beginning? Hmm. I, sure, let's just, let's just sneak on past them really quick. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll be nice to see what happens. You go for the nearest demon, yada yada, they trust you, they let you in. The Overlord is alone. You ask about the Maiden, but the Overlord doesn't seem to know what you're talking about. Was she really never here? You wonder what could have happened to her? <laughs> she said, I don't fucking know. <laughs> the Overlord says that she wishes she could help you, but you're the first human that's ever come here in forever. At least that she knows of. You think of how you probably shouldn't trust her, saying that she's a demon and all, but you really can't prove she's lying either. You apologize for the intrusion and return home to your village. The Maiden was never found. Well, what about the <laughs> useless hero ending? Good. Well, what happened? What the fuck? What happened with... Yeah, sure, we'll reset the... So, how do you get the thing when you killed the underling as the... As the hero? Hmm. Hmm. Play as the underling? Yeah, you want to do that? Hmm. The hero killed the demons in that ending, did he? I don't think that he did. Why is my... Hello? Controller? <laughs> Controller? <laughs> what happened? Why can't they move? Uh-oh. Are we okay, game? Are we, are we okay? He hello? <laughs> uh... Hello? Hello? What's, what's going on? How come, I, <laughs> how come my controller quit working? Hey. Hey, how come my controller quit working? What do we do though, chat? Oh, oh, oh god! What? <laughs> Guys, I crashed the game. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Hmm. 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 Okay, well, the game was just for. Oh! Can I leave? Yes, please let me leave. Okay, okay, it's fine. Everything's everything's fucking chill. Don't worry about it. <laughs> everything's fine. <laughs> don't worry about it. I don't know what the hell. I don't know what that was, but it's fine. Oh god. <sighs> so you want to do you want to do the same thing we just did, but as the underling? Yeah. So we, so you want to eat the maiden? And then what do we do? Because if we eat the maiden, our only options are to either continue our rampage and go to the village where the hero then kills us. Or we can head back to the castle? Like, what do you want to do? I guess we can do the underling. Yeah, fuck it. We'll, we'll, we'll do that. Yeah? Let's head back. Sure. We'll, we'll, we'll do the underling really quick and we'll eat the maid and then we'll head back. See if, see if that does anything. Do Add dutiful? Fuck. God. <laughs> you want to add dutiful? Okay, hold on. Fucking, yes. You want, you want me to make the hero dutiful? You got it. And then, and then we play as the... Or wait. What do you want me to do? Because you want me to make him hungry. We're, we're going to be playing as them, though. So, like, again, when you're playing as a character, their traits don't matter because you pick all their stuff for them. The traits are only there for when you're not playing as them. <laughs> make the Overlord kill them all. <laughs> I mean, we could do that. Maybe. We, we already killed the Underling as the Overlord. We know the, we know the Overlord can kill the hero. 
Can the overlord kill the maiden? Oh, pardon me. What part of no hungry do I not get? What do you mean? <laughs> what, what, do you, what do you mean? <laughs> like, the trait doesn't matter. Like, if we're gonna be playing- Because, if we're gonna play as a hero, then the underling eating people doesn't fucking- It doesn't matter nothing. Like, because we're just gonna do the same fucking route we just did. In that, in that case, if he plays the maiden... What, what are we doing, chat? What, what, do you, what do you want from me? <laughs> what do you want from me, chat? What are we doing? Come, come now. Come now. What do we do? Ba ba boo. Boo boo boo. Because the hero is dutiful and diplomatic. For whatever reason. Do we make them non diplomatic? Let the hero go on a rampage while playing as the underling. Gotcha. Okay. You you got it. So we gotta make. We, we can't make a diplomatic then. And we gotta make them heroic, so they just kill everybody. You, you like you want the you want the hero to kill the overlord too, or just the uh? Sure. Yeah. Sure. All right. Dun, dun, dun. You want to see underling where you eat the maiden, but then you leave the city. We can do that too. Yeah. We can play as the underling and just eat the maiden, and then have the hero go on their rampage. <clears throat> cool. All right, we'll do that. Anything about the overlord you want specific that we can mess around with and change? Is it gonna matter? Like. Because, yeah, they, 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 we're gonna eat the maiden. Pardon me while I adjust my chair. We're gonna eat the fucking maiden, and the hero is gonna kill everybody. And we're gonna be playing as the underling. We'll do that. Let's just get in there. Yada yada, blah blah blah. Same bullshit. We're gonna eat her. Mm hmm. Oh god. Yeah, now we're here again. Yeah, right? Yeah, so we, we, we so we don't go and attack the village, right? We, we just change our mind and leave. Yeah, we, we head back to the castle. You figure the people, are, uh, sorry, you figure if people are this upset at just the sight of you, you know, they won't fully appreciate any terrible acts you commit. Also, you, they might fight back. That probably wouldn't end well. So you, you're just one little underling after all. This little day out's been adequately refreshing. You return to the castle thinking you'll take a nap. After a few hours of sleep, though, you're rudely awakened by the sounds of battle. You emerge to find your room. Sorry, you emerge from your room to find the hero was slaughtered many of your friends. Blah blah blah. Okay, now we do this. Yeah, instead of saving ourselves, we attack them. <laughs> we attack the hero. We avenge our fallen comrades. Yeah, is that what you want? We'll do that one, sure. Because we, we already saw save yourself. So l l let's go fucking avenge our fallen comrades, shall we? Who does this guy think he is? Coming in here and killing everybody like some maniac? What did we ever do to him? You lunge at him while he's busy driving a sword into the god, who sometimes brought you food whenever, you, whenever you, they noticed you were feeling kind of down. <laughs> you like that god. You, you wish with all your demon heart for this hero to suffer for his deeds. You bite into him, tearing flesh from bone. Tastes like iron. <laughs> the hero struggles. You feel his sword go through you. But there's no pain. Only retribution. More of your karma is pile onto him as your consciousness fades. The hero is overtaken. Your army has won. You earned a little rest. Victorious underling ending. Good. Good, good, good. And now the hero and the underling both die. The end. <laughs> the maiden died, the hero died, and the underling died, and the overlord's probably gonna die on account of, you know, the, the, the other demons want to get rid of her. Good. But maybe there's not enough demons now? Like, maybe there's not enough demons? Like, what if we do that from the fucking overlord's perspective? What happens? Was it, what, what, what is she do, doing during all of that? Hmm? Also, we only have 20 more enemies to go now, you see that? We're, we're like over halfway done now. Only got 20 more to go. <laughs> she just slept through all of that? Yeah, is that what happened? You want to see it from her? You sure? We'll, we'll, we'll fucking we'll, we'll do it from her perspective, yeah. Was it was it because she's gonna sleep through all of it, right? She's gonna take a nap and sleep through all that bullshit. Fucking. Uh, yeah, you go have the day off, sure. Go, go have fun, buddy. Go on, go out there and eat that maiden. Yeah. You awake to a huge commotion outside. The hero showed up and started totally murdering your soldiers. What the hell, guy? You rush out onto the battlefield to confront this jerk one. You curse him and very rudely inquire his reason for doing all of this. This is this. How come this is different? <laughs> this is the same shit we've already seen. Wait, what? Oh, hold on. Wait, what? Wait, what the? Why though? Wait, but fucking why though? What? 
Yeah. The hero yells at you, demanding you to return the maiden you're holding captive. Wait. Oh no, shit, stop it, no, stop. There we go. Well, where the fuck is the... Where... <laughs> where where's the... Where's the underling? <laughs> Shouldn't the underling be here? I don't know, whatever. Apparently he's mad about the whole maiden thing, yeah? You don't know what he's talking about, but you can't forgive his actions. Hmm. You do battle with the hero, but... He has grown strong from cutting down your army, unable to defeat him. With decisive swings, he stabs you and cuts you to pieces. You fall, failed your subjects, blah blah blah, we've already seen this. And she's dead. Good. Well then, what happened to the fucking... Does he... Does the underling kill the hero after that then, or what? Hmm. Did we do something? He should be dead. Yeah, that's what I thought, right? Like, he should be dead? Because doesn't the underling kill him while he's doing the rampage? Maybe, maybe the underling kills him after the queen's already... Or the overlord's already dead? Maybe that's what happens? Like, maybe, maybe the underling killing the hero happens after the overlord's already dead. Maybe? Who knows? That wasn't a trait-based choice, so maybe that only happens if you play as the underling? Maybe. Maybe the underling killing the hero, like, literally only does happen, yeah, if, if you're the one playing as them. That could be it. <laughs> also, have we found any good endings yet? No. <laughs> We've not found any. No, we did not find the lesbian sex dungeon ending. That didn't happen. Do, 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 boo, boo, boo. The, the, the fucking overlord kidnapped the maiden <laughs> and locked her away. Uh, the broom closet ending is your favorite. Yeah, you like that one? Good. Have we seen that from the hero's perspective? What, the underling killing him? Like killing the overlord and then... Maybe? Yeah, sure, we'll do the exact same thing, but we'll do it as a hero really quick. Sure, why not? Here. We'll head in there. Let's go chop everybody down. Fuck you. Fuck you. The overlord appears to ban the know while you're murdering all of her soldiers. Yada yada, you get to the point, and you ask her what the maiden is. She feigns ignorance. A convincing act. But you won't be fooled. If the maiden isn't here, then what happened to her? You can only see one answer. The overlord definitely captured her. In fact, it's possible she's already been devoured. I mean, that is true. <laughs> that, that is technically true. Thinking about that poor maiden's life fills you with a hatred. You fight the overlord with everything you've got. You become strong from the hordes of demons you took down before the final battle. The Overlord is almost no match for you. You cut to the pieces. The Overlord has fallen. You breathe a sigh of relief, but your job is not yet finished. You search the castle. Unfortunately, you find no sign of the Maiden within its walls. It is just as you suspected. She must have already been devoured. You feel... hollow. A great evil has been banished from the world, but... What does it matter if you were too weak to save someone? You stand alone amidst the carnage and ponder what it means to be a hero. You return to the Overlord's remains and wrap her head in a cape to bring back to the village. Surely your great victory will be celebrated. Failed hero ending. <laughs> well, that one's new, I suppose, but... <laughs> yeah? So... The, the, the fucking... The underling's a weird one, then, yeah? Because, like... Th there's, there's been a couple of things now where the underling like, just doesn't show up. Cause like, by everything that happened there, like we, 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 like with the way everything happened there, the underling should have showed up and killed the fucking the buddy, right? Killed the hero. Same thing with the other ending where the the hero should have found the underling attack in the village. Like, very weird. Is the underling a fucking wild card? <laughs> is, is the underling some sort of weirdo that like just outside of time and space and shit? I don't know. Yeah, you missed the sex dungeon. Sorry, chat member, you missed that part. You want to play as a maiden again? Yeah? I read that as play Madden, by the way. <laughs> you, want to, you want to go play Madden? FOOTBALL! Uh, what would we do with the maiden, though, then? Like, what should we do with the maiden? Hmm? Hmm, <laughs> We're coming up on the two-hour mark, chat. <laughs> we're, we're at the two-hour two mark. FOOTBALL! <laughs> yeah, you like football? Oh, God. Maybe I gotta be diplomat and heroic for the for the underling to kill me, or like for the hmm, because we could see what happens if the underling eats the maiden, but then we don't kill all the demons on the way to the castle. So like, should we should we try that? Like, should we be the hero and then go to the castle without killing any demons, and then the maiden will already be gone? We could try that out. 
Yeah? Mayhaps? Maybe? Mm-hmm. Let's do that. You want to do that one? Sure, we'll do that one. We'll do the exact same thing, but the maiden's gonna be dead. <laughs> and we're not gonna have any EXP for killing demons. We're gonna run away from them. We're gonna ask if they'll let us in. Uh-huh. And now, now we're here. The Overlord is alone. You ask about the maiden, but the Overlord does not seem to know what you're talking about. Was she really never here? Blah, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Why oh, don't we just leave? Oh. <laughs> okay, never mind then. <laughs> That's just a useless ending again. Okay. I thought we were gonna, like, get the opportunity to, like, attack the Overlord with no EXP, but... Turns out we can't do that. Diplomatic and hungry, but as the Overlord? Yeah, you want that one? Sure, I'll make him diplomatic. And hungry, but we'll play the Overlord now. Sure? Sure, we'll do that one. You're the Overlord. Blah, 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 blah. Um, fucking... I uh, go have a fun day off. Yeah? Oh? You awaken to find one of your underlings. A hero wishes to speak with you. He inquires about a maiden who is rumored to be here, but you've never seen her. Humans don't visit often, or really, ever. As the hero makes his leave, you wonder why he totally trusted you there. <laughs> Heroes traditionally kill demons. This guy seemed like he was bad at his job, in your opinion. Whatever. You're still feeling sleepy, so you go right back to your nap. You hear voices in the hall. You aren't sure how long you slept. The sound of a shutting door forces you awake. Before you know it, everything around you is being engulfed in flames. What is going on? You try to escape, but something's blocking the door. You're having trouble forcing it open. What, what is this? Someone did not want you getting out. Are you being usurped? <laughs> they, they have zero foresight. What castle will they rule from if this one burns? You don't want to believe your underlings have betrayed you, but this is no accident. Those ungrateful bastards. You choke on the thick black smoke from the fire. You can't believe you're being done in by a bunch of cowards. You'll see them in hell. Burn overlord ending. <laughs> cool. So the hero went home. The overlord burned to death and the maiden got eaten. And the, and the underling just had a good day, I guess? Sure. Reset the stage. Well, now what? We got 23 endings. We're still making progress, technically. We're getting endings done, but... So, like... What if we... Hmm. How would that be different if the underling does not eat the- I mean, if the underling doesn't eat the maiden, we just get the fucking die in a fire ending, right? Where all of us die in that room? <laughs> that's, all that, that's all that happens, right? We all just die in that room? If everything goes according to the plan, I believe? <laughs> you want a good ending? You gotta fucking get one. How does that ending change if the underling is a coward? Hungry and a coward? I don't think it'll be any different. Because, like, the underling isn't the one lighting the room on fire. That's the other demons doing that. The underling only, like... The coward only affects if you personally go in there and, like, try to kill the... We, I guess we haven't done that yet. Should we just go kill the fucking overlord? As the under... We haven't done that yet. <laughs> Should we just go murder the fucking overlord real quick? We could do that. Fuck it. We'll do, we'll do the... Whatever the fuck. We'll, we'll, we'll do the usurper thing. Nyam, come here. Nom, nom, nom. Uh, fucking go back. Yeah, head back home. Yada yada. Yeah, let's go kill the overlord. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You follow your friends outside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then they make us want to go in there and assassinate her, right? Yeah. Yeah, we sneak into the room. She's taking a nap. She looks so peaceful. And now we just kill her? Because last time we chickened out, remember? We chickened out and then we had to go hide in the closet and then they burnt the room down. So let's just kill her ass, yeah? <laughs> time to die! You figure the cleanest way to do this would be to dig your claws into her throat. So you do just that. She wakes, but not in time to stop you. You watch as she chokes on her blood, cursing you, before finally expiring. That felt terrible. Uh, you remind yourself it was either her or you. And you weren't, about to let you, you weren't allowed to let yourself get killed by anyone. You leave the room to find your friends waiting just outside. They look pleased. Uh, ho only now do you realize that they must have planned to use it like this from the beginning. Whatever, you're the new ruler of this castle. Your subjects bow before you. You live in fear that they'll one day betray you, as you betray your overlord. <laughs> and that's it. Lord Underling, ending B. Good. 
And then, the, and then we, and then we became fucking the ruler of Shit Mountain. So how do we? Is there an ending now where we, we can wake up as the Overlord? Like, can we wake up to being murdered by the Underling then? Is, is that a thing we can do? From their perspective, or like what? Yeah, the mage is dead as hell on that. <laughs> the same thing, but as the Overlord, yeah? Okay. Well, we'll do the same thing as the Overlord, sure. No run button. Skip all this. Uh, fucking... We gotta be rude to him, so that way he'll fucking be disloyal and shit. Yeah, go away. Fuck off. Yeah, the hero comes in. Yeah, huh? There's never any humans here. Wait, what? Yeah, we read this already. Yeah, he goes home. You figure you were trying to fight you. No, you go back to bed. Uh-huh. Until you wake up to something completely unexpected. Oh, <laughs> hello. One of your underlings is tearing your throat out. You tried to struggle, but you can tell you're already mortally wounded. What have you done to deserve this kind of ending? You cursed at them, choking on your own blood. You die wondering what the fuck. <laughs> if you could have done anything to prevent this. Assassinated Overlord ending. There you go. That's a new one at least, but like, it doesn't help us in any way, shape, or form. She's just dead. Now what do we do? Now, now what do we fucking do, chat? We got 25, we're getting there. We're still missing traits for the Underling and the Maiden. And I haven't really, like, I haven't a clue what we're doing. <laughs> no more endings where the Overlord dies. <laughs> uh, what do you mean plus coward? What are you talking about? Oh, the same thing plus coward? It's gonna be the... We're just gonna burn to death. Do the same as last time, but with coward. We're just gonna burn to death, aren't we? Like, nothing's gonna happen. We're just gonna... Yeah, go back to work, penis. Oh. What just happened? Yeah, we just burned to death. <laughs> that's, all, that's all that happens. You wake up, but instead of having your throat torn out, you wake up to your room being on fire. We already got that one. Because, like, the Overlord's room is lit on fire in the majority of the endings. Because, the, the, you know, the demons are doing that. Like, the other demon. Like, that has, no, that has, like, no part of the underling here. Make them all good? What do you mean, make them all good? <laughs> like... Make, I mean, we tried that, remember? When, when they're all good guys and they don't want to fight each other, uh, we just all burned to death in the room. That's what ends up happening. Trusting and diplomatic and polite. And fucking... Yeah, what do we do? Merciful? Play as a maiden and return to the town without the hero killing anybody? You got it, we can try that one, sure. So we just do antisocial? So that way she tells us to leave, right? So when we get there, she tells us to leave and we leave? Yeah? Sure, let's do that. Okay, we'll play the maiden, and we'll get told to leave without the hero killing anybody. You're a maiden, neat! Uh, introduce ourselves. Hello, hi. I am girl. You are demon. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. She tells us to leave, go home. You want to learn more about her? She tells you again you should get lost. How rude, you just got here! <laughs> And then we have to we have to obey her. Yeah, we gotta leave, so we gotta leave. <sighs> you don't want to cause any trouble, so you, you figure it's time to go home. Along the way, you encounter a hero. He asks you what you're doing, but don't you know the Overlord's castle is like right there? <laughs> you explain everything that happened. He's very surprised that the demons don't seem to be as malicious as you as you were raised to believe. The two of you return to the village, hoping to communicate this to everybody. They had all been so worried that are very glad that the hero brought you back. You quickly set the record straight. You weren't rescued because there was nothing to be rescued from in the first place. The villagers seemed quite confused and looked at the hero for an explanation. He tells them he only ran into you on his way to the castle and that it isn't really his story to tell. You explain to them how you met the Overlord and that she's not actually interested in capturing maidens or any mean things like that. The villagers look again to the hero for confirmation. You feel a little miffed that they seem to prefer his word over yours, but you don't say anything about it. <laughs> The hero proclaims that he believes your story, but the volunteers to go and talk to the demons himself. Just to make absolutely sure. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. The crowd breaks into hushed whispers. You hear words like trickery and demon sympathizer being thrown around, which makes you frown. You're pretty sure that everybody's still hesitant to believe you. Hi, by the way. <laughs> Hi. How you doing, everybody? Thank you, thank you Prismaya, for the raid. Hi, you, yeah, you're coming in here? Welcome. 
We're, we're, we're playing a fucking visual novel. It's also a puzzle game, and it's full of choices. And I'm having chat pick all the choices for us currently. Is what we're doing. We're ha we're, ha we're having the fucking chat pick all the choices at the moment. We're, we're doing we're, we're doing a little thing here as a maiden fella. Hi, thank you for the raid. How you doing? Anyway, yeah, no one, no one, nobody fucking believes you. Does this hero even trust you? You aren't sure anymore. The old man implores the hero to go speak with the overlord immediately. He says you should be held prisoner and considered dangerous till the hero returns. Much to your disbelief, the crowd agrees with him. Because, of course, if you were conspiring with the demons, they can't afford to let, your guard, let their guard down. The whole village would be slaughtered by... monsters, quote-unquote. The hero isn't saying anything. You, you'll be tied up and tossed into a cell at this rate. If you're gonna be held captive by anyone, it's gonna be the overlord, not your fellow countrymen. What do we do then, chat? Do we, <laughs> do we grab the hero and run? What do we do? My controller quit working again. Why does this keep happening? Why does my controller keep stopping working in the middle of this every now and then? It's pissing me off. Now I can't pick a choice. I can't pick a choice. Oh, God damn it. Yeah, I know the controller died again. Yeah, isn't that fun? What do we do though, chat? Do we grab the hero and run? That's, that's a new trait. This resolute. You see that? We got resolute. It's a new trait. We haven't had that one yet. Or we can leave on our own. Also, I still can't fucking... Why does this keep happening? What? Can't we just use the... Maybe... Oh, 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 God. There we go. Okay, it worked. No, no, don't return. Sometimes the controller just shits itself. I don't really know why. There we go. Okay, we're good. We're good. I could just use a mouse, but we'll, we'll keep using the controller. Yeah, we we'll, want to do resolute? We'll do resolute. Sure, we'll grab the hero and run. You boldly announce that you'll accompany the hero to prove yourself. You'd rather risk what's out there instead of staying in a village that doesn't trust you. <laughs> God. No one seems to know how to react. You grab the hero by the wrist and take him off before anybody stops you. But as you approach the castle, you notice something's gone terribly wrong. It, it appears to be on fire. Is the Overlord all right? You, you have to be sure everyone's safe. You've already taken off before the hero can even stop. think of stopping you. You scan the fleeing demons, but the Overlord isn't among them. Is this going to be the same ending as the last time? <laughs> Did we get the same ending? <laughs> Just in a different way? Yeah? Against your better judgment, you rush into the burning castle to find her. You quickly reach the Overlord's room, but the door's shut tight. The handle's too hot to touch. You're too weak to force it open. You pound your fist helplessly against the door. Yeah. This is the same ending again, isn't it? It's the same one. <laughs> She's gonna burn to death. What were you thinking? This is all because you'd forgotten your role. Only a hero could pull this kind of thing off. You start to cough. The smoke is too thick. You can hardly breathe. You realize you haven't got much time left now. You desperately head towards the stairs to save yourself. But the fire is spread faster. Wow. Yeah, yeah this is the same one. <laughs> it's the exact same ending as last time. Huh? <sighs> you, you can't help but laugh. What a joke. A maiden saving an overlord. If you just stayed true to your role, things... They wouldn't have ended like this. This is exactly the kind of punishment you deserve. You let the demon fire cleanse your rotten soul. Good. But now we got end A. <laughs> so it's the same as the last one. We, Cause remember, we got B last time. <laughs> so we got the same ending, but in a different way. And that was still worth it because we got a new trait for the maiden. We got the resolute trait. Yeah? We got, we got the resolute trait? So that was, that was something at least. Try it again, but make the underling kill the overlord? Yeah, will that be the same thing? Are, are you sure? So make him disloyal and fucking make him disloyal. Yeah. And then is that it? To just to just disloyal? Tyrant. Yeah. That way she'll give him a reason to be angry. And the castle shouldn't be on fire that way. That's true. But again, the underlings a fucking weirdo and sometimes like doesn't play by the rules. <laughs> it seems like. Well, yeah. Sure. We'll try that. We'll do the same thing. Hmm. How are there 41 endings? There's a lot. There's a whole lot of endings. But yeah, so so we'll do the same thing. Well, yeah, we'll do the same thing and the castle shouldn't be on fire then, right? So by, by that logic, yeah, the, 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 the castle should not be on fire because the underling will have killed the, the queen. Sorry, the overlord by then, yeah? Let, let's see. Skip through here. Introduce myself, yada yada. Uh, we gotta leave? Yeah, I gotta, yeah, I, I gotta, yeah, we gotta leave. Head back to the village. Uh huh. We grab the hero and we run. Yada yada. Oh, here we go. Okay, this is new. Nice. Near the castle's entrance, you spy a group of suspicious demons congregating. They're talking about assassinating the Overlord. You have to warn her. But the hero shakes his head. He says that if this is the true nature of demons, the world is better off with less of them. This isn't right. You think? What kind of hero passes up a chance to save a life? 
Are we gonna burn to death again? <laughs> is, is this the everyone burns to death again ending? The demons have taken notice of you. It's now or never. You take off into the castle, but the unreliable hero follows shortly after. You burst into the Overlord's room, all of your words spilling out at once. You, sh you should probably slow down, but there's no time. The Overlord seems to have followed your frantic explanation, but clearly doesn't understand the urgency of the situation. The underling you recognized from before barges and calling you a liar. You're surprised they were part of this evil plot. They seem so nice. The other demons come right in after them, saying the whole thing was the first underling's idea. Everyone's shouting at each other now. It's really stressing you out. You're relieved when she screams, yada yada, blah blah blah, same shit we saw last time. They shut the door. <laughs> uh huh. Have they locked you all in? You have a bad feeling about this. And thinking that must have jinxed it because now everything's on fire. Uh huh. We read this last time, yeah. If only you had ignored those demons before, you you and the hero would have not stumbled into the situation. If you just pretended not to hear them, if if you left as you were told, only the Overlord would have been killed. But he couldn't have done that. That that isn't an option for you. You think that no matter what, you'll always strive for a path where everyone survives. It must exist. It simply must. Blah blah blah. You pray. She she kills them. Oh no. She's oh she oh, oh she's spared them this time. <laughs> Hold on. Yeah. Because she's merciful this time around, right? So she spared him? Yeah? Nothing to fucking matter. We're gonna burn to death anyway. The Overlord spares the Underling. You feel relieved, but... Does it make any difference? Will you... All burn together? The maid is true ending. <laughs> uh-huh. Well, now we have two true endings. <laughs> is that everyone's true ending? We all just burn to death in that room? Is that the true ending? Yeah? Oh, hold on. It can't end like this? Y yeah? Or should we keep collecting bad endings for the time being, yeah? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Uh-oh. Chat, what do we do? Chat, what do we do? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what do we do, chat? It can't end like this, right? Or maybe we should keep going for other ones? Maybe maybe we should keep looking for the other bad endings first? Hmm, maybe? Hmm? <laughs> you don't think there's a happy ending in this game? I mean, I, mean, I don't know. I don't know, maybe. Keep collecting endings for now? Yeah, I kind of want to keep getting endings for the time being as well, but... Hmm? I don't know, chat. What do we do? Come, yeah? <laughs> hmm? What do we do? Hmm? Hmm? You gotta pick. Flip a coin? Should I fucking flip a coin? Yeah. <laughs> should, I, should I flip a coin? <laughs> it can't end like this. You want to do it can't end like this? What do you mean? Why? Why do you want to do that one? Hmm? Huh? I'm going to flip a fucking coin. I'm going to go... No, hold on. I'm going to go grab my fucking Lugia coin. Where's it at? Where's my goddamn Lugia coin? Uh-huh. Where is it? Where is it? Here it is. Get coming, piece of shit. Eh. I got my big, giant, fat fucking... You hear this shit? That's my big-ass fucking Lugia coin. It's huge. You want to keep getting bad endings? Yeah, I kind of want to keep getting bad endings, too. Personally, I do. But hey, let, let's flip a coin, yeah? Let's flip a coin, shall we? Heads? <laughs> if it's heads... We'll do what can't end like this. If it's tails, we'll keep collecting bad endings for the time being, yeah? I know you can't see the coin, and I could totally just lie and make up a, you know, make up a result. <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna flip a coin, yeah? Cool? Let's see what it is. Oh! Fuck, where'd it go? Uh-oh. Wait, shit. Chat? It landed on tails. <laughs> I know you can't see it, but it landed on tails, chat. So we're going to keep getting bad endings for the time being. Good? Good. All right. Oh, let, me get my, let me fucking readjust my shit again now. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's get back in there, shall we? Good, 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 good. Yeah, keep on collecting them. <laughs> did we decide what tails meant? Yeah, I did. I said if it's heads, it can't end like this. And if it's tails, we keep collecting bad endings. So we're going to keep collecting bad endings. Boop. Good, good, good. At least we know where to go now. Yeah, we do, we do know where to go now if we want to get to that same section. And we have to we have to do the maiden's true ending. I mean, should we get everybody else's true ending while we're at it? We could do that. But sh should we just get everybody's true ending? Because we already have the overlord and the maidens. Like, we could try to get the underling and the heroes true ending. Hmm. What happens if the maiden runs off on her own instead of with the hero? We could try that. Yeah, you want to? So how do we get? How do we go about doing that then? The same thing we just did, but we, we yeah we just do the exact same thing. We may have a run off on our own. Yeah, is that, is that it? I believe, right? Yeah. So we'll do the same thing here. Hold on. Yeah, we'll do this. 
we'll leave. Oh, uh -huh. met up with the hero, and, and now we leave on our own. Yeah, yeah, we're, we're gonna leave on our own. Sure, let's do that, shall we? Let's do that. You can prove yourself without anyone's help. You make a run for the Overlord's castle, leaving the hero behind. A suspicious group of demons stand just outside the entrance. They're talking about assassinating the Overlord. They immediately notice you overheard them. The unknown that you recognized from before is the first to do something about it. This is just the way it has to be! They suddenly attack you. In that moment, you regret ever having trusted the demons. You die instantly. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, cool. She just, she just gets fucking murdered. Just immediately murdered. Slaughtered made an ending. Good. Good, good, good. Yeah? Now, what if we do the same exact thing, but now from the, uh... <laughs> From the underlings' perspective, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like we can murder that we we can murder the maiden. Should we do that? Mayhaps I don't know. Hmm. So how would I go about doing that? It's just all this shit, yeah. Or no, wait. Yeah, resolute means she'll lead the village with the hero. Yeah, but if we don't do resolute, she'll go by herself. I'm gonna- I'm gonna try that really quick with the underling, hold on. Let, let's do that really quick, yeah? Let, let's see if the maiden shows up, we can like choose to kill her or not. Yeah, let's overthrow her, yada yada. Hear her out. Uh-huh. Let's go kill the overlord? Oh god, shit, fuck. Okay, now, now we're outside talking, yeah. Okay, we're outside talking now, sorry. When it, when, it's, when it fucking skips ahead like that, it's like very jarring, I don't know where the hell we're at. You can just press the skip button and it brings you to the new dialogue if you haven't seen it yet. Anyway. You and your friends turn and notice the maiden from early has overheard your entire conversation. I'd be bad if you had the Overlord. Sorry, if the Overlord found out about that. Yeah? Well, now what do we do? Yeah? Capped her. Oh, hold on. <laughs> do we kill her? Like we just saw? Or do we throw her in the dungeon? Ah? Huh? We could be a captor. <laughs> we can toss her in the fucking dungeon. Or we can kill her. <laughs> what do we do, chat? What do we do, chat? <laughs> Don't say lesbian sex dungeon again, stop! <laughs> the, the, the Overlord doesn't even know she exists in this fucking timeline. Oh no, she does. Oh no, she doesn't. She does, yeah, she holds it to go away though. You want dungeon? Y you all want dungeon? Okay, fine, we'll do fucking dungeon. You and your friend seize the maiden and bring her to the dungeon under the castle. It's empty, save for some decorative skulls. They're only there to make you feel more spooky. The maiden is real upset. You leave her in a cell to continue scheming with your friends. But now a hero has arrived at the front gates? He's asking about a maiden. Perhaps the very one you just locked up. The gatekeeper, who must have seen everything, tells the hero exactly what happened. What an idiot you think. Why would you give the hero an excuse to start slaughtering us? The hero yells, prepare to face justice! And other cliche hero lines before driving a sword into the gatekeeper's torso. <laughs> you're small compared to a lot of your friends, so you're able to slip away without getting cut up by that sword. You get to thinking, if this hero took down the Overlord for you, everything might actually work out in your favor. You wait for things to die down outside before poking your head out. You spot the Overlord and the hero locked in battle. They, they've worn each other down, making this very easy for you. Once an opening presents itself, you hit the back of the hero's head, knocking him out. What are you doing? Couldn't you tell this was a duel? You don't respond. You gotta carry out the assassination. You tackle her, and her rip it to shreds with your claws until she stops moving. You finish off the hero next. You can't let him revive and come after you later. Kind of a cheap victory, but it doesn't make any difference. Anyone who manages to survive comes crawling out of their hiding places. You're the new ruler of the castle. Your subjects bow before you. You live in fear that one day they'll betray you as you will betray your overlord. Yeah, so, so we got the same ending. <laughs> we, got the, we got the Lord Underling ending again, but now we got A instead of B. So that is another route to get to the same ending. Good? Good. Boop. Good, good, good. Oh, I got an achievement for some reason? The hell did I get an achievement for? Well, now what do we do, chat? <laughs> I fulfilled the prophecy? Yeah, apparently. Yeah. Well, what happens to the maiden in that ending then? Is she just locked up in the basement? Because, like, the hero dies, the underling becomes the ruler, and then the overlord dies. What happens to the maiden? Is she just locked in the basement? Yeah? Also, yeah, we do have all the traits now. Yeah, we have every single trait unlocked now. So we, so we, we, can, we can fuck around with those now. How about we do the same thing, but with the maiden? 
And we see what happens to her when she gets locked up. Yeah, should we do that? Let's do that, yeah. Let, let's, do, let's do the same thing from the maiden's perspective. You're a maiden, blah, 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 blah. Uh-huh. Introduce yourself. Hello. You gotta leave. Uh-huh. We gotta grab the hero and run? Oh, no, wait. Yeah, I gotta leave on my own. Yeah, we leave on our own. And then the underling won't kill us? Because I, yeah, the underling won't kill us now, right? I think. Should, that should be how it goes, yeah? You run off. There's a bunch of demons. They're talking about assassinating the overlord, yeah? Uh-huh. Oh, they immediately notice you overheard them and decide to lock you in a dungeon before we can cause any trouble. You cry out, but the demons ignore your protests. You can't believe you escaped possibly being thrown into a cell back in your village only being tossed into this awful place. This is terrible! Who, who's gonna keep these demons from harming the overlord? You hope she can fend for herself. You sure can. not You heard the sounds of battle echoing through the halls outside. Did the hero follow you? If he's out there, your cries can't reach him. After a while, the violence seems to die down. It's impossible to tell what happened. You continue to wait, but nobody comes for you. Unable to escape, you rot in that cell. Imprisoned maiden. <laughs> Good. Cool. Yay, she's dead again. <laughs> for fuck's sake. Uh. Well, now we can see that exact same ending, but from the Overlord's perspective. <laughs> I mean, if you want to. I don't know. <laughs> Should we do the same thing but from the Overlord's perspective of that now? Yeah? Good. Maiden die. Ma maiden locked away in cage and die. Sure. Yeah, we'll, we'll do the Overlord version. Why not? They didn't burn it down. Yeah, she didn't. They didn't burn it down. So like we we can see from what we can see what happens in this timeline where the where the castle doesn't get burned down. Be, I, I guess we're gonna die to the underling in this one as well, just in like a different way. Uh, fucking yeah. Go go back to work, penis. We have to tell her to go home. Yeah, she leaves. Uh huh. We go to bed. We don't get the rest very long. Yada yada. The hero's out there killing everybody because the maiden got captured in the, in the dungeon. H Hello, what's happening? What? <laughs> Vile demons, I shouldn't believe for a second that you were anything but pure evil. I will exterminate all of you. You don't really get what he's going on about, but you've been gay regardless. A girl's gotta defend her people. You clash again and again, but the hero isn't going to down very easily. You're both dangerously low on health, waiting for the other to make a move. When one of your underlings appears behind him, they knock the hero unconscious. What well, you kind of appreciate it, but can't they see this is a duel? They don't respond. You sense murderous intent. Your servant tackles you, tearing you apart with their claws. You struggle to retaliate. They've done too much damage. You can barely move now. Your blood is everywhere. You... You can't believe this has happened to you. Why has this happened to you? You've been slain by your own underling. Betrayed Overlord ending A. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Great, cool. Reset the stage, baby. Take it from the top. All right, we have 29. Yeah, only got 12 more. No, because now what do we do though, Chad? Now, now we're running out of options here. We got, we got to figure something out. What are we doing? What are some endings we haven't seen yet? Hmm. What are, what are some? What are, I mean, there's still the true ending of the. Uh, I mean, I guess we could do that same thing from the hero's perspective, I suppose. Yeah, too. Like, right? We we could do the same thing from the hero's pers fucking perspective. If you really want to. I guess that would count as an ending. Let's, sure, we'll do that really quick. Fuck it, why not? God, we gotta run away, right? Yeah, we don't, we don't fight anybody. Oh, here's a new one we haven't done yet. That we, She can't be trusted, but how about we just... We, we'll, we'll just believe her for the time being. We'll just believe her for the time being, yada yada. When you reach the gates, you ask the demons if they've seen the maiden. They have. They inform you she's being held in a dungeon at this very moment. She trusts them, and in return, they lock her up? So demons truly are evil beings after all. You demand they take you to her, but they do not let you pass. You should have expected this from these unreasonable creatures. You know what you must do. You thrust your blades with a demon before you and rush to the castle alone. You're the only one who can save the maiden now. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing to all of my soldiers? Why are you killing them? The Overlord is angry. You vow to exterminate her and all of demon kind. You clash again and again, but the Overlord isn't getting isn't going down easily. You're both dangerously low on health. When? 
Everything goes black. Your quest has come to an abrupt end. <laughs> Unlucky hero. Oh, okay. <laughs> cool. Cool, awesome. Well, there, now we saw that ending from everybody's perspective now, yeah? Good? Good. Only 11 more. Only 11 more endings, everybody. Da, da, da. We could do the exact same thing we just did, but now... Don't believe the maiden? <laughs> should we Should we just not believe the maiden? I don't know. What, what would that accomplish? Would that be anything new? Like, if we don't believe the maiden, what even happens? Hmm. We did get bonked. Yeah, the fucker came up behind me and just went bonk. <laughs> you want to not trust the maiden? You got it. Okay. We'll do the same thing, but we're not going to trust the maiden. Uh, run away. Yeah, now here's the maiden. Yeah, no, she can't be trusted. She's, 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 she's fucking crazy, obviously. You aren't sure you should listen to this maiden. You've been taught your whole life that demons are evil. You ask if she's sure about all this, but she gets very upset that you think she would lie to you. She storms off before you can say anything else. You decide to return to the village. Certain that she must have been kidnapped. Sorry. Wait, yeah, she must have been kidnapped. Wait, what? Certain that she must have been kidnapped. Oh, she must have been... I, I, I didn't see the word the. <laughs> I didn't see the word the right there, and I was so... I was like, what the fuck is this sentence? Okay. You return to the village. Certain that she must be the maiden that was kidnapped. You were sent to rescue. Glad that took care of itself. You take your time walking home. Job well done today, you think to yourself. As you walk past the town square, you notice that the whole village is crowded around... It... Is that the maiden you saw earlier? She's bound to a wooden stake. The, the crowd is in a frenzy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. <laughs> Jesus. Smoke begins to rise, and you stand idly by as the flames consume the maiden. She must have done something horrible to deserve that. She seemed nice, though, you thought. But evil comes in all forms, you reassure yourself. You decide to call it a day and return to your house. But you can't escape this sinking feeling. Maybe you aren't cut out for this role. Uh-oh. <laughs> Spectator here. What the fuck happened? Why, why do they fucking burn her to death? What happened? They just fucking but yeah, Should we do that, but now be the maiden? <laughs> should, we be, should we do that from the maiden's perspective? What the fuck? Uh... Maybe I can take a sip. Hold on, I can take a drink of my water and get some coffee and shit, yeah? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, with the fucking maiden effigy. What happens if the hero comes back with the underling killing the maiden? Oh, that can't- we tried that one already. Like, that, that can't happen for whatever- I don't know why, it just can't happen. I have no goddamn idea- I have no idea why. Mm. She didn't have the hero vouching for her that time. That's true! She went back there and told everybody in town that the demons weren't actually bad, and they just didn't believe her, and the hero wasn't there to back up her, her words. Yes, yeah, so let's try that. Introduce myself, yada yada. Obey her. You tell the hero all that bullshit, and he just doesn't believe you! The hero seems to think you're lying to him. He asks if you've been- he, sorry, he asks if you've been brainwashed by the demons. What nerve! You're very upset that this so-called hero would treat you this way. You leave it a huff. You return to the village alone. Everybody was very worried about you. They surround you with a thousand questions and you tell them your story. As you explain that the Overlord never had any intentions to harm anybody, you notice the looks of the uncertain crowd. People are whispering things to each other while you speak to them. You're loudly interrupted by an older man. He rudely calls you a demon sympathizer. Okay, okay, boomer. <laughs> the crowd is growing unruly. You don't understand. You've only told them the truth. Why do they not believe you? Everyone begins speculating that what must have actually happened. They weave elaborate lies and ask you to prove your innocence. How could you have returned without the aid of a hero, they ask? You, you could not have possibly escaped the overlord of your, on your own without harm. You must be conspiring with the demons, trying to trick everybody into believing they aren't the horrible creatures we know them to be, they say. Have the people of your village always been this blinded by their fears and hatred of things that they've never cared to know? You... you wonder how you missed that before. You're seized by the crowd, and voices from all sides are calling for a public execution. You're to be burned at the stake. You... you don't want to die. You... you wonder would it have been better to hide the truth? You don't like the thought of that. You've always lived honestly, so why has this happened? Why are you being punished? You hear the dissenting voices of your family and neighbors, but they, like you, are powerless against the momentum. You can only watch as you burn, and you can only cry for them. 
You were so... So sorry. Executed Maiden! Yeah, cool! Public execution, alright! Good. We're down to nine. Only nine left. <laughs> There's only nine endings left. <laughs> what a bunch of fucking assholes. Everybody in this game sucks. Everybody in this game fucking sucks. Da, da, da. Do, do, do. Bum, bum, bum. Take a sip. Coffee, yeah. Mm. How many by character do we have left? Um, we got, there's two more hero, one more maiden. Nice. <laughs> nice. There's three more underling and there's uh, three more overlord. Good, good, good. Good, good, good. Can you murder the village as an underling but then be a cowardly hero? I'm not sure. Oh, hold on. What does this say at the bottom of the screen? <laughs> Everything you've done has only hurt them more. Okay, penis. <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> okay, fuck you. Uh. Hmm. I don't know if you can do that, though. Because if... I think if we... Like, if we go and murder the village as an underling... Yeah, no, the, the hero... That's like the weird one. That's like the weird ending that doesn't fit anywhere else for some reason. Like, I don't... That one just kind of happens. You can't... You can't, like... Make the hero not do that if you're not playing as him. And if you are playing as him, he just doesn't do it. It's really weird. We we tried that earlier in the stream. It just it just like didn't work. Um, hold on. Dutiful, resolute, hungry, plays a tyrant. Yeah, you want that? Hold on. So you want you want dutiful, resolute, hungry. Well, I mean, resolute's not gonna mean anything if underling is hungry because underling goes eat the maiden. And then you want to play as the Overlord? Wait, the Tyrant Overlord. Well, who are we playing as then? <laughs> Hungry, diplomatic, but not be disloyal? Oh, capture still turned on. Oops. Well, if we're hungry, we eat the Maiden. And if he's diplomatic, he doesn't fight people or whatever, but then, like, we're just gonna burn to death, aren't we? Like, won't we just- won't the Overlord just burn to death? Cause like the under yeah the underling will get or no wait yeah what if we don't go along with the assassination plan we haven't actually like not have we yeah have, have we we haven't done that yet have we just like we we just we, we to like tell to not agree with the plan to assassinate them we haven't tried that right we need more underling endings we do should we try that sure here let's fucking uh let's uh. Let, 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 let's go do the thing where we assassinate the fucking uh, overlord, but then we like. Hmm. Yeah, let, let, let's just like not go along with it. Yeah, let's do that. So she yells at us. Yeah, let's not overthrow her. Yeah. <laughs> let, let's let. How about we don't overthrow her? Yeah. Let, let's not do that. Yeah, you weren't serious about the whole thing. Yada yada. You read this already. Yeah. We go outside and have some fun. We see the maiden. She seems very frightened and screams for a hero to come save her. You consider her options. I mean, this doesn't really affect anything right now, right? Should we should we eat her again? <laughs> should, we, should we fucking eat her again for no reason? Uh, cause this won't affect anything, right? Cause we're just trying to do the... Or will it? Fuck, what, what do we choose? Hmm. Let's just tell her to stop for a moment. When the maiden realizes you aren't gonna hurt her, she regains her composure. Now she started talking to you, blah blah blah, we're gonna write all this shit, yeah yeah yeah, take it back. The Overlord screams at you, she ap you apologize, blah blah blah, you go to bed. Here we go, okay now this part, yeah. This one. Yeah, so at this part we just say we don't want any part of this, right? Yeah, you question the loyalty to the cause. Yeah, so, so we don't go, we don't be disloyal. We, we say she's not so bad, right? Yeah, we're doing that. <laughs> we're doing that, yeah? She's not so bad, you guys! Your friends seem pretty disappointed. They apologize to you, but before you can ask what they're sorry about, one of them suddenly seizes you. Someone who's still disloyal, sorry, someone who's still loyal to the Overlord really has no place in our castle. You understand that, right? Their claw tightens around your neck. You don't bother to struggle. You're outnumbered. You already know how things like this end. This is a pretty messed up thing to do to a friend, you tell them. They slit your throat in response. Oh. <laughs> okay, Jesus. Good. Faithful underling ending. Turbo dead. Turbo dead. Ba, ba, ba. Do, do, do. Well, 
well now what chat <laughs> any, any more ideas chat for what we can do we're only missing a handful of endings now well hold on because the maidens we oh, know the mate yeah we need two for the underling three for the overlord one for the maiden and two for the hero <laughs> have i achieved the true ending where they kiss <laughs> no <laughs> there's no kissing <laughs> fucking god Blue option under what do you mean paragon? You want me to do a paragon fucking run with the underling? It's a fucking mass effect. Hmm. <laughs> you want the sex dungeon ending? <laughs> we already we already we already have the dungeon ending. There's, how do we turn the dungeon ending into the sex dungeon ending? How does that work? Hmm. You want to play as the overlord? Yeah. What do we do as the overlord though? What do we do as Overlord in this situation? Ba, 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 ba. Have we gotten the hero when the underling's true endings? We haven't yet. No, do you want to do that? Do you want to get the hero when the underling's true endings really fast? We could. We've only ever gotten the Overlord and the Maidens. My controller has once again stopped working. Why does it keep happening? <laughs> like, it keeps doing this every now and then. It'll just like suddenly like stop working and it's like all my inputs are happening in the background. Cause like I'm moving the control stick and now when it unfreezes or whatever, it's gonna like do all my input simultaneously. I don't know why this keeps happening. I should probably just unplug my controller, yeah. I might try that. Hold on. Let me try that. After it like unfucking hinges itself, I'm going to uh just unplug the controller and try playing with the mouse for a moment. Cause this is getting really goddamn annoying. <laughs> this is really annoying. Let's get the Yowie ending. No. <laughs> no. For fuck's sake. Hello? Are you gonna work, game? What's, what's going on? H hello? It's taking a long time for this one to, like, work. C can we... <laughs> can we... Hello? It's really hung up for a while this time around, yeah? That's fine, I'll wait. You wanna play 20 questions while we... <laughs> while we wait for the fucking game? It's fine, it gives you time to think, yeah? You can think of what, what, what path you wanna take while my fucking game continues to work correctly. Ah... <sighs> Yeah, it is definitely a game problem, yeah. It's not my controller doing this or whatever. It's just a game issue. I don't know what's going on with it. Oh, the music stopped. Oh, oh did it crash? <laughs> did, did it crash? Here, I'll just relaunch the game really quick, yeah? It auto-saves, right? So it's, it's fine? God, I hope so. Fuck, God, I fucking hope it's auto-saving. Let me just, uh... Let me just go, boop, turn you off. Yeah, yeah, here, look at Hack Your Dance for a second. <laughs> we'll, like, relaunch the game here. And I'll unplug my controller, and we'll just play with the mouse and keyboard, because maybe there's some weird, like, wonky controller support going on with it that's, like, not working properly or something. Let me... Eh. Because I know my fucking... Uh, when I try to play Hat in Time with a, uh... What do you call it? When I try to play Hat in Time with a Switch Pro controller, it fucking... It's all, like, buggy and shitty like that, too. And whenever I try playing Bug Fables with my GameCube controller, it just crash... Not, not, not the GameCube, my Pro controller. If I try to play Bug Fables with my Pro Controller, it just crashes. <laughs> I don't know why. So, I mean, Steam has a... Steam has a bit of a history with me of just, like, not working properly with certain controllers on certain games, so... Da, da, da. Sex Dungeon ending as the Overlord. No. <laughs> Can you kiss it? Can it have... Oh, sorry, the 20 questions thing we're talking about? I, fuck it, I don't know. Uh, I, I, I suppose you could kiss it. Y you could kiss it if you wanted to. Come on here, load. OBS, you having, you having a hard time, OBS? You can do- there you go, there you go, buddy. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Alright. You could kiss it if you wanted to. Enter. Can you see my- oh, you can see my mouse. Hello, hi. <laughs> There's my mouse, there it is. Yeah? Will we- Wait, what? Did it not save my game? Oh, if it didn't save my game, I'm gonna scream. I might do a little bit of screaming if it didn't save my game. Uh, hello? Uh-oh. I, I, hey, wait a minute now. Hey, 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 wait a minute, buddy. Hey. Hey, hey now. Hey, hey, no, no, no. Hey, hey now. Uh-huh. Shush. Shush. L let me in. Let me in. Shut up. <laughs> I don't want to play the fucking tutorial. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Uh-huh. Attack it. End the tutorial. Reset the stage. Oh, fuck, I didn't hit reset stage. Oh, stop it. Uh... 
Wait, menu? Is there a load button? No. Oh, wait, load. Oh, cool! <laughs> Chat, my game didn't... <laughs> Chat, the game didn't save. <laughs> auto save. Well, here's the auto saves, but they're... I... Okay, time to redo literally fucking everything. I... I, I fuck off. <laughs> fuck off. I'm done. <laughs> yes, I understand how to play the game. Fuck you. Oh, that's a, that's obnoxious, huh? That's like turbo obnoxious, huh? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Uh-huh. Fuck off. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. We're, we're doing this, chat. We're fucking doing this, because I have to now. Isn't that just horrendous? Oh. Cool fucking, cool, cool fucking game crashing bug with your controller. Failed hero ending. We already had that one. Good. I'm a maiden. Yeah, we got the worst ending. It's the one where you have to redo the entire game. Because that's how cool it is. I fucking... Hi, I want to introduce myself. Are you going to eat me? Yeah, you ate me. That was the first ending we got. That was the very first one we got. <laughs> yeah, this sure is a bad ending, huh? Oh my god, that's horrendously obnoxious. I wonder why it didn't save the entire time. I mean, I guess because I didn't do a hard save? I, I guess that's why I just never did a fucking hard save? I... I, I guess? I kind of figured the autosave would help me in that one, but never mind. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Well, now you want to play- you want to play 20 questions? <laughs> you, we, we, can play, we can play 20 questions while I wait! Oh, and you get to listen to me click my fucking mouse over and over for three hours. It's fine. It's fine, that was only two and a half hours of progress that we gotta redo now. Let's overthrow her. Fuck off. Is it a hard cock? No, it's not a hard cock. Is it red? It is not red. Does it have a cock? It does not have a cock. Boing, boing, boing. Can I just like press... Oh, I can press space. It's way better. <laughs> I can just press space. <laughs> when I can just skip through the text. Yeah, that's lovely. Uh, let's make you not hungry. Oh god, this is gonna be so annoying getting all these again, yeah? Fuck me. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me out. We're not gonna eat the maiden. Hear her out. Yada yada. Uh-huh. Is it alive? It is not alive. <laughs> we got like 30 of the endings, I know, right? Is it Wario? It is not Oreo. Or it's not Wario, it's not Wario, rather. Disloyal, gotta go kill the- gotta go kill her, yeah, gotta go stab her in the face. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. She looks so peaceful. Let's check it out. Like the bitch we are. And then we burn the death in a broom closet at the end. Is it made of silicon? No. Is it metal? It is not metal. I gotta pay attention to what fucking pass I'm picking now. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Any, any game devs happen to watch this? If, if, if you happen to watch this, can you figure out what the fuck happened with my controller and why I just made my entire game fuck off? Oh, that's obnoxious. Yeah, blah blah blah, blah blah blah. Let's let her stay. Oh, well, no, we gotta be antisocial. Yeah, here, go home. Fuck off. She screams at me, and she stays anyway. They have a, like, gay moment for a moment. Mm-hmm. Then the hero comes in and ruins the gay moment. Let's be possessive. Let's keep her here. Did we ever do this one? I guess we technically never did this as the... Yeah, I'm not gonna do it then. We never did this as her yet, so let's not do that, so that way we can, like, properly do it later when we can get back to it. <laughs> Good. Do I recommend using a water-based lube with it? No. Do you see one every day? Maybe you might see... It is an object you could see every day, yes. Is it wet? No. It is not typically wet. You can make it wet if you, like, fucking covered it in water. What was the one? All right, the true. How do we get the How do we get the Overlord's true ending again? Fuck, I had to like. Yeah, make him not do. Oh, just be the hero. Let's not kill people. Yeah, yeah. Killing is wrong. <laughs> I played Undertale. <laughs> I played Undertale before. Killing bad. Uh, let me in. Yada yada blah blah blah. Fucking. Yeah, what's going on? I say hey. What? No way. Do I own one? Not currently. I don't. But I have had them before. 
The smoke is thick. Blah, blah, blah. You run away. Huh. Is it Kabu? It is not Kabu. Okay, let's make you diplomatic. And you can be polite. And you're not hungry. Why is you? Just, just, just. Just, 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 just. Let's tell her not to go away. Here. Yeah, ha have a day off. Uh, you can stay and hang out. You enjoy that long chat with her. You let him go. And then you burn to death. Lovely. <laughs> we have seven. We have like, th how many did we have? Like 32 or some shit? By the end of it? Also, wait, how come... Is it edible? It is edible. Is it organic? It is organic. How did we get the true ending again? Oh, I had to tell them not to leave, right? Oh, wait, no. But I told them not to leave and they fucking... How do I get the true ending again? Is it a glizzy? It is not a glizzy. Say, I'll save my game, yeah, hold on. Well, see, I, I can't save on this menu for some stupid fucking reason. Like, it, it don't let you save on this menu. Which is why, look, I do it here. Oh, I can save here, fuck, I'm an asshole. <laughs> I can indeed save here, it turns out. All right, good, 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 good. Anyway, is it mustard? No, is it sweet? Yes, is it a tomato? No, is it a fruit? Yes. Underling has to be disloyal, gotcha. Skip. Get back to work, you fucking cock. Uh-huh. Uh, you can stay for a while, sure. Let him go. Then they come bursting in. We get the true ending now, yeah? Well, we have to do this twice, though. We have to do the ending where I kill the underlying, and I have to do the one where I don't kill the underlying. I hate that we're fucking... <laughs> I hate that I have to redo all this shit so much. I hate that I have to redo all this so fucking much. This is so annoying. Is it a pussy? It's not pussy. Is it an apple? No. Wait, is, is pussy a fruit, chat member? <laughs> is it a banana? It's not a banana. Is it a peach? It's not a peach. Oh, fuck. Pussy! Uh, same thing, but we just don't kill the underling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Goodbye. Forgive them, we're merciful. And then we get the true ending. Overlord's true ending. Oh, uh, bubba bubba. True end, you say to yourself. What's the point of all my effort if my game crashes? This is bad in theater. <laughs> Fuck off. Uh, is it a pineapple? No. We already said tomato. It's not a tomato. Is it corn? Is it a corn kernel? Is it pussy with pineapple? <laughs> no. <laughs> the hell is wrong with you people? <laughs> Fucking A. Okay, we'll look at the maiden's true ending now really quick, because we've already done... Introduce myself. Yeah, yeah. Let me go. Let me go. Yeah, yeah. I can't skip this, because this is technically new text according to the game. Is it a dog's nut? No. Do you, do, do you all know what a fruit is? The heroes entered the room. Hold on, did somebody say it already and I missed it? Let me scroll up. Well, nobody said it yet. Okay, I'm just, just make, I, I was wondering if somebody maybe already said it. Is it a blueberry? It's not a blueberry. Is it a banana being jammed into a peach? No, is it a raspberry? No. Is it a strawberry? Nope. Is it a watermelon? Nope. Is it an orange? Yes, kiss shot. It is indeed an orange. Congratulations, chat member. <laughs> Congratulations, it is indeed an orange. Congra you're a winner. It can't end like this! Boo! We gotta keep getting bad endings. Alright, cool, let me save again. Ay -ay -ay. Oh god, that's so fucking annoying, yeah. Overlord, tyrannical ruler of demons and the hero's ultimate target. Neat. Yes, characters, like, let me out of here. Yeah, you did it, chat. It was an orange. <laughs> is it a jackal? <laughs> no, it's not a jackal. Is it Jackie Chan? It's also not Jackie Chan. Alright, good. You got water? It was an orange. Welcome back. It, it was an orange. What do you win? You win a bad ending. <laughs> Congratulations. You win. <laughs> uh, okay, so we got their true endings. We didn't get the, these guys' true endings in the actual previous run through, so I'm not, I'm not gonna get theirs now. Um, Orange is tangy? Oranges are sweet! Are you really gonna sit there and tell me? I know they're tangy, but like, you're really gonna sit there and tell me that orange isn't sweet? 
Are you really gonna tell me that shit? If I would have said it's not sweet, you know damn well, y'all, y'all, every one of you would have like ruled out orange. If, if I would have said it wasn't sweet, every single one of you would have been like, oh, well, I guess it can't be an orange. I guess oranges are sweet. Make the overlord possessive and play as the maiden. Yeah, we do have to do that one, technically. <laughs> we do have to do that one. Uh, you've already seen this one, though. Yeah, objects to the hero's suggestion, yada, yada. You people are evil, leaving no choice. She murders them in front of us. We become the sex boobos. Oh, never mind, no sex boobos, because the little fella kills her. Yeah, yeah. And then we make him not disloyal and do the exact same thing. <laughs> Oranges are fucking sweet. What are you all talking about? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oranges are sweet. Captured maiden ending. All right, we're up to 12 now. We're, get, we're, we're we're like halfway back to where we were. Um, citrus is not sweet. I, I, I mean, what what else would you call it? Like, what, what, tangy? Like, I, 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 listen. If I would have said it wasn't sweet, y'all would have all ruled out like every fruit. Cause like, what I call the blueberries sweet? Not really. Like blueberries are kind of like bitter, like sourish a little bit. But like. Hold on, what am I doing? What do I have to do now? Hold on. God, we did so many endings earlier. Fucking me. Save? Yeah, well, hold on. I'll save. <laughs> save a game. Yada yada. We're still gonna get this entire game done tonight, by the way. We, we are still gonna do the entire game. Don't worry. Savory. What do you mean it's savory? Oranges are a citrus? I know oranges are a citrus. But like, they're sweet. Kabu? Kabu, Kabu what are your thoughts on this? Ka Kabu, are oranges sweet? Kabu doesn't want to appear. <laughs> my, my button's not working. Kabu. Kabu, what are your what are your thoughts on this? Oranges aren't sweet. Fuck you! They're not! What did you fuck off? <laughs> oh god. What have we not done with the fucking maiden? Antisocial? Yeah. We're possessive? No, no, no possessive. Yeah, here, let's go. Maiden. Yeah, the maiden's gotta do more stuff, yeah. Shout for a hero. Ah, grr! Rar, help me! Obey her and be a little obedient girl. Run away! Hero doesn't believe me. We get burned at the stake. Bah, 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 bah. She's a woman. She's obviously not telling the truth. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Play as a maiden, but then make all of them die. I don't know if you can do that. I don't know if you can have all of them die, but then have the maiden survive. <laughs> yeah, Kabu, stop eating the. <laughs> Kabu, stop eating the skin. Also, that is true. Oranges are called tangy berries in Bug Fables. That is true. But like, I would still call it. Oranges are sweet. Like, I don't know what to tell you. They're, they're, they're sweet and tangy. Like, they're, 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 it can be multiple fucking flavors. You understand this, yeah? Like the oranges I buy anyway, are they're, they're sweet. They taste good. I like them. They're tangy and sweet. Um, what am I missing out on? Hold on. I'm gonna like cheat really quick and <laughs> just like look up fucking... Uh... What is this one? Overlord's upset. Hero apologizes for what he did and then he dies? Hold on. Let me go back. Oh, it's gonna be so annoying trying to redo all this shit. Are they oranges and bug fables? Yeah, the tangy berries? They're, they're just oranges, yeah. They're just really, really tiny oranges. You hate oranges, do you? You don't like them? I like them. I enjoy me some vitamin C. How do I make her a martyr again? Hold on. If I want her to be a martyr, you gotta be like dutiful and heroic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you gotta be possessive. And then the maiden's gotta jump in front of the fucker, yeah? Right? The hero barge is uncovered and come. Protect. Oh no, I died! Ah! Good. Good, good, good. You like lemons and limes? Yeah, I, I enjoy lemons and limes. They're good. Y'all ever just eat an entire fucking lemon? Just the whole ass thing, skin and all? Dun, dun, dun. Same thing with oranges. <laughs> I do that with oranges sometimes. 
Also, again, that's coming for, hey, I'm calling oranges sweet, and I also eat the skin on the orange most of the time, and I'm still gonna call the fucking thing sweet. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Alright? Uh... I also eat the fucking rind on watermelon sometimes. I don't waste that shit. I just I just shovel it all down my gullet. Dun, 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 dun. Try clementine? What about clementines? Clementine from fucking game? From, from zombie game? What am I doing? Uh, She's a martyr now. She was a martyr boy. She said see you later boy. Uh huh. Skip all this shit. Uh... Attack these fuckers, fuck you. We go in here, we go to stab. We go to stab her, but then girl jumps in front of us. Ah! We saw this one last time, we kill her. We're covered in blood. We leave, like the shithead that we are. Good, good, good. Broom. Reset stage. You tried eating a lime by itself and it didn't go well, yeah? I very, very rarely have limes just on their own. I have kiwis. Like, do you, do you, any, any of y'all have kiwis? Like, do you, do you peel that shit? I also just eat the kiwi. I, I just eat the whole ass kiwi. You, you don't gotta fucking, like, peel that shit. You can just eat it. There's no reason to fucking... There ain't no reason to peel the kiwi. It's got real thin skin. Uh... What am I missing with him? Oh, the trusting one. Yeah, we have to trust her? So how do I make your... How do I make here? Please him be trusting. Hold on. Skip. Flee like a bitch. Let me in. Ask what's going on. And the house lights on fire. What did I do wrong? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> what did I do? Wait, what? How about? Obedient. Oh, no, wait, yeah, ob oh, I, oh, I didn't make her obedient. I see. Is that what I didn't do right? Yeah, okay, hold on. Try that again. Sorry, I'm an asshole. Skip. Run away. Let me in. What's going on? I. Why am I so bad at this? <laughs> what did I do wrong? The overlord has to be antisocial? Fuck, you're right. God, fucking A. Uh huh. Oh, here we go. Yeah, she comes by. She goes, blah, 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 blah. I. Yeah, I believe her. I trust her. Etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Yes, yes, yes. We did this shit. Blah, 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 blah. She runs off. Blah, blah, blah. They're shouting at me. I gotta go after her. Oh, no. Blah. Good, good, good. All right. Now we do that, but as a maiden, so we can get her whatever you call it thing, her other ability. And then we're like almost caught back up with where we were, <laughs> kind of. We still got a bit more to go, sadly. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, well, note to self: if, if anybody in chat plays this game, I don't know why you would, on account of you're watching me play it. But then again, I've already seen this game get played before, and I'm sitting here fucking streaming it. So, but like, if you're, if you're gonna play this game, just don't use the controller. Just, just, just don't use a controller. Just use a mouse and keyboard. I have to be resolute. Let me be resolute. Shut up. Stop talking. <laughs> How long is this? Resolute. Here we go. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Choke, choke, coof, coof, I die. Wah, so sad. Mm -mm -mm. Reset stage. All right, good. Now, she's resolute again. Lovely. Um... Now I have to do the exact same thing, but I have to, like, have her fucking burn to death the stake, right? Yes, yes, yes. Obey. Go home. Burn at the stake. Wait, fuck, I already did that, didn't I? Fuck, I already did that one. I have to, I have, to have the hero see that happen. <laughs> fuck. Uh-huh. Go away. Yada yada. Uh, she can't be trusted. Fuck that bitch. And now that bitch is on fire. Lovely. Good, good, good. How many do I have now? 17. Fuck my ass. <laughs> All right. What's the one? Oh, the captor one, yeah? Captor? Captor. How do I get captor again? He has to be disloyal, so he's outside, right? Like, pl plot to kill the lady? How many endings were we at? Like, 32, I think? Like, 31 to 32? Is what we were at before the game shit itself? I mean, I could have just waited longer. Well, no, that wouldn't have worked, right? I tried waiting, and the game crashed. Cause I, I was like, I was trying to wait for the controller to like give me control back again, but like it just fucking crashed after I was like hanging for too long, so. Um, the dungeon, how do I get the dungeon one again? She has to leave without the, yeah, she has to leave. He has to trust her, but then she has to leave without him, right? Yeah. 
And then the underling has to capture her. Yeah, yeah. So we'll throw that bitch. Yada yada. Let her go. I almost ate her on accident. <laughs> I almost clicked on eater. Wait, why are we here? Uh, sure, we'll go kill the overlord really quick, I guess. Why are we here? What the hell did I- Oh no, we're not here now. Yeah, here we go. Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah. Talking about this, the maiden shows up, and then we and then we grab her ass and throw her in the sex dungeon. There we go. He shows up, we wait for them, we kill them, etc. etc. We become king of shit mountain. The end. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> what the hell did the overlord do? I don't know. All all of her demons just hate her for some fucking reason. I really couldn't tell you why. Ah, itchy, itchy, itchy. Sorry, I'm itchy. Alright, um... Now we do the same thing, but from the hero's perspective... Believe her. Believe it! They've been captured! Bah! Kill them all! Die! Are we up to 20 yet? Almost to 20. Okay, we're getting there. So what am I missing now? <laughs> what have we not done yet, chat? <laughs> fuck. <laughs> fuck, fuck, fucking fuck. We did possess it, but like we didn't do it from the Overlord's perspective. Did we do possess it with anybody else besides the besides the Maiden's perspective? Or did we do? No. Oh yeah, she gets killed by the Underling, right? Yeah. We have to do the one where she's possessive and gets killed by the Underling. Correct? Oh, let her stay. Possessive. She came here to be captured by you, didn't she? You'll grant her- Did we do this yet? Maybe we didn't do this. Oh god, did I fuck up? <laughs> did we not do this one yet? <laughs> no? Here, let, let me go back to the main menu really quick. Yeah, let's do that. Hold on. I will save, by the way. Thank you for reminding me. And we'll do a save. Boop. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Humans. Peace-loving people. Fuck off. My ass they are. Ruled by their fear of violent demons. Good, good, good. We didn't do that one? Okay. How did we... Oh, we threw the maiden one, but well, no, hold on. Yeah, we did. Did we see? Hold on, let me check. No, fuck off. I didn't mean to do that. Fuck, no, go back. <laughs> Shh, go back. Did we see both the maiden? Where she gets disloyal. She gets killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the one where the maiden gets fucking the possessive one? Oh, here. Okay, we, we did see both those already. Here. Okay, good. I couldn't remember. Uh, heroic? The not martyr one. Did we we saw that one. Yeah, we did. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. So we have to like not jump in front of the attack. Did we do that with the maiden, where we like don't jump in front of the sword? We did, didn't we? In the previous run, like we did the one where we don't block the sword, and the hero kills the fucking kills Miss ki kills Miss Overlord asshole. We did, right? Yeah. Let's try that. Hold on. Skip this. Hello, it's me. Hi. All right. <laughs> I don't know what just happened there. <laughs> Jesus. I had to make him heroic and do it. Oh, I, I didn't make him heroic. That's the reason why. I didn't make him heroic. Da, da, da. Do, do, do. We saw possessive in both the maiden ones, but not the overseers one. Gotcha. Okay. Also, we didn't see that. We didn't see- are you sure we didn't see the hero one where- Well, we saw the one with the hero- yeah, let's do that really quick. We saw the one where the hero fucking stabs her. Let's try that really quick. Hold on. Uh, let me in. Then we try to kill her, right? Yeah, we go to stab her. And then the, she, she jumps in front of it. Yeah, yeah, we feel like shit. And then we try to fight her. We kill her because we're- wait, did we just do this? We just did this, but it's new? Whatever. <laughs> there's, there's gonna be a celebration. Loyal hero, okay. <laughs> Good. We did already see- what the fuck did I do wrong? Hmm. Oh, I threw the one where she doesn't jump- god, I'm so fucking bad at this shit. I threw the one where she doesn't- or where she doesn't jump in front. Sure, I'm glad my game crashed. That was- that was awesome. And that the auto saves mean nothing. Uh... Let me in? Yeah, let me in. Kill that bitch. Yeah, you stab her. Uh-huh. She dies. You offer her a hand. You're so cool and awesome. Okay, we got that one last time. I remember this one. Yeah, we, we did see this one last time. 
You don't think we saw her not as a martyr? No, we did. We did the one that we just saw, we did see happen in the previous run through. We did indeed see that one last time around. Um. The fuck am I missing now? God, we're like missing like two fucking 12 of them. Uh. Cower, I guess we can get the chicken ending really quick with Buddy here. Yeah, right, hold on, we gotta be a chicken? Overthrow that bitch. Gobble that bitch up. I guess we haven't done this one yet here. Let's grab that really fast, yeah? Bolts were here. Mm -mm -mm. Wait, did I already have that one? Overthrow her. Yes. Gobble her up. Go back home. Yes, yes, yes. Shush, shush, shush. And then we... We get our throat slit really quick, get that one out of the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking God. <laughs> this is so annoying. This is so fucking annoying. Overthrow her. Wrong button, fuck. No, shit, how do we leave? Uh, return, here we go. Skip, 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 skip. Yeah, yeah, fucking, we'll be disloyal. Uh-huh, we're here again. She approaches the maiden. We kill her. Yeah, we did that, right? Maybe, did we do this one last time? I know we saw it happen. Oh no, we didn't see it from his perspective though. So let's leave really quick. We, yeah, we didn't see that from his perspective last time. Okay. Like we saw it happen from the maiden's perspective, but not his perspective. I remember. Mm -mm -mm. Did I get that one written down? I did. I, I did. I, I I know I just checked this. Yeah. Okay, we did do that one. Um. Okay, we have to go get killed by the underling really quick. Or he murders us. Yeah, and yeah, no captor. So how do I get murdered? <laughs> how do I... How do I get mur Trusting? Yeah, we have to have trusting, right? Diplomatic? Yeah, hold on. Hello, hi, it's me. I'm girl. Yes, yes, yes. The hero's here. Blah. I press the wrong button. <laughs> Fuck. Uh. <laughs> Fuck. Did we see this one last time? Did we see this from the perspective of the of the maiden where where the fuck where, where we don't jump? Or, I don't think we did. Did we fuck my ass? We have to make you not heroic. I'm a dipshit. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. I K. Okay, something happened. <laughs> I don't know what happened that I did wrong. Resolute. Resolute, man. Obedient. No. What am I doing wrong? I want to get killed by the fucking. No, I, no, I don't want to be resolute because then I can't. Yeah, if I'm resolute, then I'll bring the hero with me. And I don't want that. I, I want to get murdered, so I have to have captor turned off. Oh, possessive was turned on. That's fucking why. Antisocial has to be on. There we go. Mm-hmm. Uh, fucking obey. Yada yada. Leave on my own. There we go. Now we go and get murdered by the underling. Boop. Goodbye. Now we do the same thing when we get caught. The exact same thing when we get caught. Boop. Leave on my own. Blah, 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 blah. We've been thrown in a pit. Bah! And then she wants in prison in the end. Do you want to play 20 questions again? Yeah, sure, go for it. <laughs> do you want to play 20 questions? Shoot. Uh. Yeah, how do I get... Yeah, 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 get found in the Alps. That's how you get murdered. Yeah, f f find me in the Alps. Fuck me in the ass. Okay, we got 23. Let me save really quick before I forget. You'll have a good Saturday night. I mean, it's not really a rush, I suppose. This game's not that turbo long. <laughs> so we're not really in that much of a rush, but I'm just annoyed that we're redoing all this shit again. Does it save my game? The thing I'm thinking of? No. It sure does not. The thing I'm thinking of does not save my game. Does it have good dance moves? No. Is it purple? No. I mean, it could be purple, I guess, if you really wanted it to be, but it's typically not purple. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, what do I need? Oh, God. I think I have all the maiden endings now, yeah? Hold on. What is this one? Okay, yeah, so we're, we're caught back up with the maiden now. Maiden's back to normal. So maiden, we don't have to touch the maiden anymore. She's done. She's done. Is it alive? No. 
Um. Hero? Did we do the one where he apologizes after he murdered everybody? Yeah, then we get that one scene where we have a chance to stab her in the back, right? But we don't? Yeah. We gotta apologize and then... Not stab her in the back? Let's get rid of that one. Here, hold on. Overlord was 6 out of 9. It was not. Because the Overlord has like... 11 endings, <laughs> or like 10 endings or something like that. 11? I think she has 11. Is it small? Uh, typically not small, no. Can it draw the maiden getting a college degree? No, unless you're really, really skilled with it. No, <laughs> you could not draw with it. <laughs> What's going on? She came in on her own. You don't know how to respond. I have a chance to kill her from behind, right? But then we don't. It's just a big misunderstanding. Yeah, we got this one last time, and she murders us. Okay, good. So we got that one last time. How good of an idea is it to down two shots of wine? I mean, that depends. Like, what do you mean? It should be fine. Like, I'm not going to encourage you to drink, but... Demons, unabashedly selfish creatures who value their power above all else. Is it in my house? I wish it was. A is it a sword? It is a sword. <laughs> Enigma 720. It is indeed a sword. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, you guessed that one real quick. Was that less than 20 questions? Did we do it? Did you guys finally do it 20 questions in less than fucking 20 questions? Did you do it? I wasn't counting. Na, na, na. Two shots of wine. Oh, you're just doing wine tasting? Yeah, that's fine. No. Like, I mean, unless you're like turbo, like intolerant or like a like super lightweight alcohol, I don't think that's gonna fuck you up too bad at all. Um. I don't have a sword in my house. I don't. Right? Isn't that sad? I wish I had it. I wish I had fucking. What do you call? It? I wish I had a fucking sword in my house. Um... <laughs> it's been sitting in the fridge for a few months now, and you're like, well, someone's gotta drink it. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> fucking, I don't get- go, go for it. Uh... Pardon me, like, quick on- I gotta click on something here, give me a second. Grab this- I, I fucking downed a bottle of wine during last stream. I don't know if you knew that. <laughs> during the last Skyrim stream, I downed a bottle of wine. Uh... Seven eleven, nine eleven, four ten. What are we not doing with the underling yet? Hold on. Yeah, we, we didn't do that one last time around. What? Behavior resolute. Merciful. What? Hmm. Under, yeah, the underling was at 6-9 last time, yeah. But then we got up to like 7-9, I think? What is this? We have to kill the hero, right? Yeah, we have to get revenge on the hero? Yeah, we haven't done that one yet. We have to like kill the hero with the underling. We did that last time. How the fuck do I do that? Make him heroic? And then we just... We eat the... Hold on, here. Let, let me go in here to the... Skip this. Overthrow her ass, yada yada. Gobble her ass up. Change your mind and go home. The hero's out here murdering everybody. Let me save myself real quick. Yeah, we'll get that one out of the way. And then we'll do the exact same thing, but now we'll kill his ass. Okay. We're getting caught back up. It's taking a minute, but <laughs> we're getting there. Yeah, yeah. Avenge my fallen comrades. Blah, 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 blah. Who the fuck is this asshole? Nah. Grr. Okay, we did that one already. Reset. Is it taking your sword out literally called drawing your sword? Yeah, that's why I said you could draw if you wanted to. I said if you're really skilled with a sword, you could you like you could draw with it, but they literally you, you, like either by drawing your sword like in the you know normal way, or like literally using your sword as an instrument to draw something with. 
It was a mistake downing the wine. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of bitter, like, wine either. I don't like dry wine? Fucking ugh. This is apple wine that I get that's really good. It's like it's, it's a bit more on the sweet side. It's not like super sweet though. I hate like super sweet shit too. It just doesn't taste like ass. Like it, it's, a, it's a good taste. Like it's not turbo bitter and it's not like mega sweet. And it tastes like apples and I fucking love apples. So... Chicken? Did I do the chicken out thing yet? Did I, do, did I do the chicken out thing yet with the- nice. With the underling? Becomes a new ruler. Fails to assassinate and burns- okay, we did do that one already. Okay, good. Uh, we have to get murdered by the- Yeah, we have to get murdered by the- Overlord, right? Did we do that one? Do you have a favorite ending? Or is it still too early to decide? My favorite ending was the one where uh, my game crashed. And I lost all my progress. Uh, did we do the one in the previous session where the where we got murdered by the overlord in the burning room? As the, we did, right? Didn't we? Yeah. Do I have to do that one again? How do I do that? Fucking a. No hungry. You gotta be resolute, not leave. You can't kill anybody. You gotta be trusting and diplomatic. Yada yada whatever. You gotta like not try to make her leave. And then we gotta get killed by you. Okay, yeah, hold on, we gotta get killed by her. At the very end. Uh, we did the get- uh, yeah, we got the throat slit one already. Yeah, we're doing this one now. We did this last time. Blah blah blah, the humans are liars, fuck them. We burn in flames. And then we get murdered. There we go. Okay, we got that one last time. <laughs> there, we got that one last time. <laughs> good, good, good. Da, da, da. Okay, good, good, good. Let me save. Boop. Cool, cool. Character cell? Yeah. Hmm. Your aunt enjoys... Sorry, your aunt buys super bittery dry stuff? Yeah, I, I don't like dry fucking alcohol. Like, whenever... It, it's, it, like, it's, it's gross. I, I don't like it, my, like, personally, myself. I don't like it when the liquid... I don't like it when the liquid that I'm drinking tastes like I'm drinking sand. Like, I like when my liquid's wet. I say, taking a gulp of my water. Um... So I think we're... Good on these? Yeah, I didn't do that one yet. We didn't do that in the previous one. I did. Okay, so Underling is caught up now. Underling and Maiden are caught up. So what am I- Oh, shit. What am I missing with the Overlord now? Mm -mm -mm. Hmm. <laughs> you should look at the art book for this game. What, is it full of gay stuff? <laughs> is it full of kissing? Beautiful. What is this? We have to try to kill the... Wait, what is this? Martyr one. Yeah, we didn't do that last time. Heroic. We have to be killed by the... Now, what are we missing that we didn't do last time? True and... Egg bog. Have I done all the check marks yet? What you mean? What check marks? Oh, what you mean just turning on everything? Like just just just, just like, clicking every single one of these? I don't know if that'll give you like a different ending. It'll probably just like I mean she's gonna be eaten immediately if I have the hung hungry one equipped or whatever. So, uh, there's a little bit of gay in the art books. Yeah, I figured. Just just a tad bit of gay. Just a, just a dash of gay here in this June. We had more than four, fucking no, god damn it. We had more than four under or overlord endings last time, didn't we? Like I thought for sure we had more than four of those. Cause I know the maiden and the underling are caught up now, but what the fuck am I missing with the hero? We reached the oh yeah, we reached a room. The overlord's fine. And then she's possessive. Did we kill? She's possessive, did we kill her? Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, oh yeah, we get conked on the head, yeah. 
We did. Oh yeah, we yeah we did the one where he gets conked on the head and dies, but then we also we do the one where he doesn't get conked on the head. Yeah. Okay. Cool. 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 Yeah. 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 Oh fucking a! So how do I make him not get conked on? You have to not be disloyal. You have to be a coward. Yeah. And you did uh. We just have to go in there and kill. Right? Yeah. Do, now do I just go in there and try to kill her? Hold on. Uh. Wait, did I make her possessive? Fuck. <laughs> Wait, I had to make her fucking possessive, didn't I? Let me in. Destroy the Overlord, yeah? Is this the one? Oh no, we have, to do, we, have to, we have to do this one first, right? No. Fuck my ass. What the hell did I do wrong? Waking up- Oh yeah, waking up to being murdered. Yeah, we haven't done that one yet. You're right. We have to wake up to being murdered. As ye old, uh... As ye old fucking... Buddy here. So if I do, I just make him disloyal. And that's all I have to do to be murdered and wake up to being killed. Hold on. Get back to work, penis. Uh, go home, asshole. Let him go. That was not it. Fuck. <laughs> uh, well, we we did these last time though. Yeah, we killed them. Hold on. Yeah, let's kill you. Go away. Shit. We already did that though. Yeah, that didn't help us. How the fuck do I get killed in the middle of the night? How do I wake up the dying? What did I do wrong here? Hold on. What did I do wrong that makes me not just get killed? Go back to work. Uh, you go home, we let him go, am I just gonna die again? What the fuck? What am I doing wrong here? Forgive him, yada yada, blah blah blah. Shush, we already saw this last time, yeah, you, you, will I give into despair? Suck my cock. <laughs> How do I wake up to dying, yeah? <laughs> How do? How do I w Google? How do I wake up and die? Obedient? Is it obedient? Oh, right, because, yeah, fuck, I'm a dumbass. I wasn't making her leave. Sorry, I, I didn't realize that. Here, yeah, get the fuck out of here. Go, shoot. Get your ass out. Yeah, shoot, go away. There, now I wake up to getting my throat slashed. Lovely, that's what I wanted. <laughs> and now we do the same thing, but as the underling. We gotta go in there and kill her. Did I already do this one? Whatever, let's just go in there and kill her. I can't remember if I did this one or not. We did it last time, I know. Uh, yeah, go kill her. Time to die! Grr! I become king of shit mountain! Okay, cool, cool. Um... Now what the fuck am I missing? Underling and Maiden are done. Overlord. Uh, over, overlord. Overlord. Overlord wakes up to the underling tearing her throat out, yeah? Um... What is this one? What is this one? Am I missing a bunch of hero ones? No, it's hard to fucking tell. We're almost caught back up. We're only missing like three or four more. And then I'm gonna click on that fuck. Shush, out of here. Hero. Like, are we sure we didn't fucking... <laughs> My final words are going to be, I was reading chat. Yeah, is that what's gonna happen? Uh... Do you have a favorite end? Oh, we didn't do this one yet. Hold on. Yeah, we, we didn't do the fucking everybody. I forgot we did the thing where the, she kills the fucking underling. Yeah, everybody burned to death in the room, but she killed- I forgot about that, yeah? Hold on. So, will this work? Here. Skip everything. We, we just have to, like, have everything work out, but then we don't, uh... We all burn to death in here, right? But the underling dies? No, fuck, what the f- Huh? Hubba. How do we get locked in the room? <laughs> How do we all get locked in the room and die again? 
She wasn't obedient, so she stayed. He has to be disloyal? Is that what I fucked up with? Did I not make him disloyal? Hold on. Uh huh. Uh, what's going on? Okay, here we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Now we go back and we do this. The fucking little grumbling fucker dies. There we go. There we go. Bada bing. Resigned hero. Uh huh. And did I already get that one with the maiden? With a. No, I did not get the one. Okay, so I did it with all these characters. I guess I wasn't done with the main like I thought I was. Shit. Hello, friend. She stabs him. Yar. Okay, good. Nice. Cool, cool, cool. Now I do the same thing. With the underling? Did we? Did the underling die in the pre- Well, we're at 30 now. We did the one with the overlord already. We killed him, right? Yeah, we killed him. Okay, we, we killed them. So am I caught up now? I'm pretty sure we were past 30 last time, but... Yeah, we certainly- yeah, we were. I'm almost positive we were past 30 last time around, but how would we just, like, play the fucking game now? <laughs> just like- oh, shit, wrong button. <laughs> how would we just play the fucking game now? We try to just figure some shit out, shall we? Good? Good, alright. What are we doing now, chat? What are we doing now, chat? Chat. Hmm. I'm walking down the street. I don't look bo both ways before crossing the road. Gets hit by a speeding car. I was looking at chat. Yeah, is that what happens? <laughs> is that how I die? <laughs> I was looking at chat. <laughs> the last you remembered, I had two, two, one, and three left to find. Oh, really? So, like, two, two... Well, no, the maiden... Is at 11, so we're missing one with her. The sex dungeon ending from the Overlord's perspective, yeah? She just burns up though, doesn't she? Isn't that like all that happens? Um. I'll try that really quick, hold on. Uh, fucking, yeah, go have fun out there, buddy. Uh, fucking, go, go home? Right? Or wait, <laughs> go, go home? I can't remember, fuck, go home. Uh, let him go. Yes. I go to bed, and then I choke. Fuck. We were missing one maiden one last time? Yeah, okay, good, nice. So, yeah, we're caught up with the maiden now, for sure. I think we're also caught up with the underling now, for sure. So who am I missing one with the Overlord? Yeah, the Overlord sex dungeon one. How does that work? I guess we just saw the sex dungeon one. Because, she, again, she hasn't seen it that shit happen. Because she's taking an apple that's going on. Okay, so what should we do now, chat? What, what should we do? Let's just pretend that we're caught back up, even though we're, even though we're not. <laughs> Let's just pretend that we're caught back up. What should we do next? <laughs> what are some combinations we haven't done yet? Mm. Ah, take a sippy. Cause now we are gonna do new stuff, yeah? Wanna see some new shit? Even if we haven't seen it yet, just, just throw your answers out and see what we can try to come up with here. Wait, you keep her there, but you're not just loyal? You wanna do that one? Sure, well, fuck it, we'll do that one, yeah? So you wanna do possessive? From the... From... Oh, from the overlord... Okay, gotcha. We'll do possessive from the overlord's fucking situation? Sure, why not? Why not? Boop! Yaha, uh -huh, you're the overlord. Wow! There was one with a hero being trusting, was there? I can't remember. You're fucking- you, you get back to work, jackass. Shush, go away. Go back to work. Uh-huh. We did this already. Uh, you can stay for a bit. Sure, why not? You can stay for a bit. Yeah, uh-huh. We read this already. Now we get to the possessive section and we try to keep her. <laughs> Is what we do, right? We gotta be possessive? Yeah. Yeah. You don't want the maiden to be taken away from you. So let's keep her here. <laughs> let's keep her here. The maiden came here to be captured by you, didn't she? You'll grant her wish. You tell the hero you won't let him take her home. The maiden assures you she'll be back, but you don't budge. The hero is cautious now. 
If you won't let her go, maybe you demons are all evil after all. And if you are, I'll be forced to vanquish you. You have no choice. You destroy the hero before he can steal your maiden away. She's frightened. You don't understand why. Didn't she say she prefers this place to her village? Now she doesn't have to leave. You take a step toward the maiden. She looks to have backed herself into a corner. You don't understand. She wanted to stay here with you. The hero was trying to get in the way of that. You had to kill him. You'll be sure to keep this maiden very safe from now on. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Selfish overlord. There's a new one. Oh, God. Cool. And now we do the same thing, but we get murdered by underling? Yeah, right? We just make him disloyal, and that's the only difference, right? Because an underling comes in there and saves the day, right? Skip all this shit. Yeah, get back to work, you cockbag. You can save her a bit, sure, why not? Keep her here. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. We killed the hero. Yeah, she backed herself into a corner. You don't understand. <gasps> Something sharp pierces your back. The, the hero? No, he's already... It's one of your underlings. The maiden screams. Your servant tackles you, tearing you apart with their claws. You struggle to retaliate. They've done too much damage. You can barely move now. Your blood is everywhere. You can't believe this is happening. Why has this happened to you? You've been slain by your own underling. Good. That one's kind of new, but also not. <laughs> it's just a different version of one that we already saw. All right, let's do that. But from the, did we do the maiden one where she gets captured? The possessive one? Hold on. Wait, what? What is this one? Oh, wrong one. Heroic. Stops the hero. We're only missing one thing with the maiden. Save my game? What if I don't save my game though? Wouldn't it be funny if I just didn't save? <laughs> wouldn't, it be, wouldn't it be like a funny haha -ha bit though if I just didn't save my game again? That'd be pretty cool. Uh, I mean, should we get the Maiden's last fucking thing done? I guess we could do that, yeah? The Maiden's only missing one thing. I don't know, what do you, what do you, you want to do, chat? What do, you, what, what do you think we should do? <gasps> uh, let me adjust my chair, pardon me. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. <gasps> boom, boom. It's only been three and a half hours, too. Even with the debacle that just happened a moment ago, we, we only wasted it. What, what, what did we lose, like 30 minutes of time because of that fucking debacle? Get the Maiden's last ending? You want that one? Okay. Well, how do we get it then, though, chat? I know we just looked at that thing, but do you remember? <laughs> do you remember what route it was? How do you think we get the Maiden's last ending out of all the things we've chosen? How the fuck do we get it? Kiss the Overlord's belly button. No, you're grounded. Coffee's almost gone. Uh, hello, you bubba. Uh, a dirty yawn, excuse me. Uh -uh. How do we get the maiden's last ending? What do we have to make her? And what are we missing for her? Because we did the one where she gets captured. We did the one where she gets killed by Buddy. We did the one where she gets eaten by Buddy. We did the one where she gets burned to the stake. We did the one where she goes into the mansion and dies. Or the castle and dies, rather, from the fire. We did the one where she gets possessively captured by Overlord. Have her live her best life. Thanks. <laughs> how, do I, how do I make her do that? How do I make the maiden live her best life, chat member? <clears throat> hmm. Again, I can look at the route. You want, me to, you want me to bring up the route and see what we're missing? Or do you want to try to figure it out on your own? Because it will just show us what we have to pick to get it. If I look at the route thing. Like, what are we missing? Because if we have him trust us, we take him with us and we die. Or no, we don't die. Because, yeah, if we have him trust us, it just takes us back to the fucking true ending bullshit. Is it just the ending where we see... Yeah, where we just don't jump in front of the sword? Is that all it is? Is that all it is? We just, we just do the one where the hero goes to... Yeah. The hero goes to kill Tyrant? Or whatever the fuck? Did I get her dungeon ending? I did, yeah. 
We got that one. Is it just the one where the hero goes to kill the overlord and we don't jump in front of it? Is that all it is? Let's try that. Hold on. Hello, it's me. Hi. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, hold on. Yeah. Well, this is new. Whatever the hell this is. What, what is this? Yeah, can I go back? What is this? Yeah, you explain the situation. Reassuring him that you were never in any danger. Uh-huh. The Overlord has walked past the hero and out onto the hall. She's wailing. You can only guess what kind of horrible scene is left for her. The Overlord tears the hero apart in retaliation. He watched silently, unable to scream. The Overlord, who you had just been getting along with so well, has killed another human being right in front of you. It's clear now that you had never, you should never have been deceived by, deceived by her sweet words. Demons are ruthless monsters, after all. You somehow managed to slip past the Overlord and make it out of the blood-soaked castle. You never look back. Well, that was a new one. <laughs> Escaped Maiden Ending A. Okay, good. Is that the last one? That's a no, we're still missing one with Maiden, apparently. Okay. So, it's just the one where... How do I make the stabby thing happen? Oh, I didn't have Heroic equipped. I'm a dipshit. <laughs> that that's why it didn't work. Heroic wasn't equipped. <laughs> Fuck it, A. That was at least something new, though. Here we go. Okay, yeah, now, now, now we do nothing? Yeah, we just don't protect her. Yeah, we didn't do this one yet. So let's, let's just do nothing, yeah? Hold on. The hero suddenly dashes forward toward the overlord. Sword drawn. Uh-huh. And then we do nothing. The hero's blade pierces the overlord, and she lets out a horrible scream. You flinch. The overlord is slain. The hero smiles and holds out his hand to you, saying it's time to go home. His glove is drenched in blood. Hesitantly, you take his hand. The hero guides you through the castle past the corpses of his enemies. You try to keep your eyes at your feet. There's blood everywhere. You shut your eyes, but even then, you can't escape the smell. All of this was because of you, wasn't it? You exit the castle, and the hero leads you back to the village. Everyone celebrates the hero's great triumph over the demons. You feel sick. But you take part in the festivities regardless. There you go. The complacent maiden. There. The complacent maiden ending. Oh! A letter flutters down from beyond the curtain. Yeah? You found lost letter number two! Cool! We got a lost letter. It's right there. We're gonna ignore it for now. <laughs> we're, go we're going to ignore this lost letter for the time being. Any any guess as to why we got that? Any, any fucking guesses as to why we just got a lost letter, everybody? Hmm? Alright, now what do we do? So the main's all done. What should we do next? What should we do next, chat? We got three more hero ones, two more underlings, and three more under overlords. Hmm. Dun, 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 dun. So what have we not tried yet? I mean, there's still the hero true ending and the uh, underling true ending, yeah? Kabu? Kabu, thank you for redeeming Kabu. Yeah, we technically haven't done like the true ending with the- We only did it with the Maiden and the uh, Overlord. We haven't done the true ending with uh, the hero and the gr little Grumman fucker. The letter was Kabu? Oh, was that what was in the letter? Kabu? <laughs> did, did Kabu come out? <laughs> Good. <sighs> yeah, it's an RNG event. Yeah, the, the letter came down because of an RNG event. Uh-huh. Because it's June, yep. We haven't stabbed the Overlord while her back was turned. You want to do that? We can do that. Let's go do that. Let's go murder the Overlord <laughs> while her back is turned. <laughs> like the piece of shit we are. Come in. Hi, can I come in? I'm covered in blood, but can I come in? You gotta fight him. Yada yada. Uh-huh. You make it to the chamber. Hi. Uh-huh. Uh, what's going on? She explains she came around her own. Yeah. You don't know how to respond. The Overlord moves past you, out the door, to see her army in lifeless piles. She's wailing. It's... It's horrible. Megalovania's not happening. <laughs> Sorry, I'll refund your points. I'm not doing that tonight. <laughs> this is your chance, hero! Yeah? Leo, stab her in the back while we can, yeah? Sure. Yeah! You lunge forward, driving your blade through the evil Overlord. She screams. And then falls silent. The Overlord has been slain. You smile, offering the maid in your hand. She takes it after slight hesitation. She must be surprised at how strong you are. Yeah, this is the same end we got last time. This is the same end we got last time, just a different way to get it. Triumphant hero. Good. Well, that was a bust. What do we do now? 
What do we do, chat? I'm trying to think of what we can do even right now, off the top of my head. Cause like... Fuck, I don't know. It, it doesn't help that we had to redo like all of them too, so now my brain's even more fucked up about what we have and haven't done yet. <laughs> I mean, we can always look at the route. I know people don't want to look at the route. Cause it's like, you know, it's cheating. It's not really cheating, you know what I mean? Do a happy ending, motherfucker. <laughs> How? How? It's called Bad End Theater. I mean, we can always go do the thing where, uh. I mean, do you want it? You, you, I mean, we can always go do the one ending where, you know, where the thing popped up and it said it can't end like this. Do, do you want to go for it? <laughs> do you, you want to do it? Do you want to go do the thing? And instead of clicking on let's go find more bad endings, we we, we, we do the one where we click on fucking, uh, it can't end like this? You want to do that one instead? Could do that one. You don't want to do that one? You sure? Okay. You want to save that for last? Like after we get the rest of the, uh, rest of the bad endings, you want to go try that one out? What the fuck do we do then? <laughs> the underling becoming the king is a happy ending. Motherfucker, <laughs> the overlord dies. Uh, you feel like we probably need the letters for that anyway? Maybe. I'm not gonna check out the letters till we have all four of them. Is that perma GG if we do that? It is not. J j just to like be a minor, just word of warning. It, it does not like end the game if you do that other one. If you if you choose the uh, I can't end like this option, it doesn't just straight up end the fucking game or whatever. Um. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> you like the sex dungeon ending? <laughs> no. Huh. <sighs> <laughs> Let's cheat. <laughs> you want to cheat? <laughs> Hold on. What am I missing with these guys? I'm missing. Yeah, two underling ending. What if we not done with the underling? Um, oh, we haven't done the fucking, where we sneak up on the overlord and kill her, right? Like when the overlord's being possessive? We haven't done that as the underling yet, yeah? Hold on, let's try that. Make her possessive. Get rid of these. And then we just, yeah, we, we walk in on her being a possessive weirdo, right? Or wait, is that how that works? And then we kill her while she's doing the, how do I do that? Yeah, you have to be diplomatic and trusting and shit, so you don't fucking... And you gotta be... Not be obedient, because you don't want her to leave. She can't be antisocial, she has to be possessive. Yeah? So, this should end with us killing the overlord then in her room, right? Like, not in, the, not in her sleep? Uh, yeah, let's overthrow her. Uh-huh, let's, let's, let's hear her out. Uh-huh. Let's go kill the overlord. <laughs> uh-huh. Oh god, no go back, Jesus. Jesus Christ, okay, there we go. She approaches the maiden you brought to her earlier. Yeah? With the overload distracted, you figure this is as good as chance as any. You launch a sneak attack, getting her right in the back. She flinches, giving you enough advantage to take her down. You rip the overload apart until she stops moving. That was messier than you would have liked. The maiden muttered something from the corner. Th thank you for saving me. Well, it wasn't your intention, but it sounds like you did something heroic. <laughs> you tell the maiden to go home. This place is dangerous. She follows your advice and leaves the castle. Your castle. You're the new overlord. There we go. Heroic underling ending. Neat, there's a new one. Okay, cool. Now we're only missing one with the overlord. We're missing a singular overlord. Or sorry, underling ending. But what is it, though? Oh, the true one. The, the underling's true ending, yeah? Should we get that really quick? That's the only one we're missing with the underling. The one where we burn up in the room but, and then we don't get murdered. 
So sure. <laughs> That's not a happy ending. <laughs> stop, stop calling those happy endings. The, the fucking overlord died. Uh. Okay, so we don't want her to leave. So this should be fine, right? Yeah? <laughs> and nothing of importance was lost? How dare you? <laughs> How dare you say such a thing? Let's not overthrow her. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't want to kill her. It sounds rude. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, let's hear her out. Skip ahead. Yeah, sure, let's go kill the overlord, haha. -ha. And then we'll check it out halfway through. Yeah. We head outside and talk, but then we get interrupted, right? And it goes into, like, true ending mode? Wait, this is different. What is this one? What is this ending? What is this one? You sneak up to the Overlord's room, but there's a couple of humans in there. You watch the scene unfold. You aren't sure why, but the Overlord suddenly cuts down the hero. She approaches- the Oh, wait, is this one again? What the fuck? Oh, because I made her possessive. <laughs> oh. Because <laughs> I made her possessive. Oop, my bad. <laughs> Oops. There we go. And I have to make her merciful, too. I forgot. Otherwise, she'll kill us. And we don't want to be killed. I completely forgot about that. My bad. Yeah, it's not overthrow her. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, let's go overthrow her, even though I just said we're not going to. There- Oh god, it fucking- Jesus Christ, this part goes by so quick, yeah? Okay, we get locked in here, yeah, we're trying to break down the door. The Overlord grabs you by the throat. You cry for mercy. You were forced into this mess. Y you're sure now that they would've killed you if you would've signed it with her? To your surprise, the Overlord spares you. Now maybe she'd rather see you suffer instead. Looking around, you've just gone from one dead end to another. The maiden's crying, the hero's silent. You're all gonna burn together. There. That's the last ending for him. For, for I keep saying him, sorry. <laughs> for them. There. Oh! A letter flutters down from beyond the curtain. Letter number three! Good! There, the underling is done now. Maiden's done, we got two letters. Now we just have hero and overlord. So what are we missing with them? What are we missing? We got three hero, three overlord. Hmm. <clears throat> well, I mean, the hero's true ending is one that we're missing, right? We haven't got the hero's true ending yet? Could, we could just do the same thing but as the hero? Right? Yeah, let's do that really quick, sure. Get that one out of the way. Uh, let's skip all this bullshit. Yeah, skip this. Run like a bitch. Ask him to let me in. Ask what's going on. God, it goes by so quick. Fucking Jesus Christ. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> the next moment, the Overlord has taken hold of the Underling. It's crying for mercy. Is she going to kill it as retribution? It continues to cry and make excuses, but the Overlord does nothing. To your surprise, she lets it go. Are demons capable of mercy? You guess it doesn't matter now. You'll all burn together. <laughs> Good. <laughs> there, now we have everybody's true ending, yeah? We've unlocked every character's true ending. Are you happy? They all die, the end. Nah, nah, nah. Okay, so now what are we missing though? We're missing, still missing two more with the hero. What combos have we not done yet? Of shit. Hmm. You must be really enjoying my tragedies. Yeah, I was having a great time with it until my game crashed. Now I'm just having an okay time with it. game is nice, so I like it a lot. <laughs> like, I probably won't be playing any other, like, visual novel type games like this on my channel, I'm gonna be real with you. This one, I, I like this one. It, it, it's, like, unique and it stands out, which is making me want to play it and stream it. Like, I'm probably not gonna play, like, fucking, like, Doki Doki Literature Club or some shit like that, like, other, like, visual novel games on the channel. Mm. I do like this one. It's nice. Save my game? Thank you. You are very smart and I am dumb. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, good. Um... What has the hero not done yet? Do we do the captured maiden version in this one? We have to trust her, right? But then we have to- she has to not be resolute? Did we do that one yet? <laughs> what about Princess Maker 5? Oh, the Phoenix Wright games. Yeah, I'd probably play those. I'd probably stream some Ace Attorney games. Those are like visual novel-esque ones. Yeah, you know, they have like some gameplay to them. Like, for, just for like, I'm not gonna stream any visual novel games that are pretty much like literally just reading text and doing nothing else. <laughs> like, there needs to be some kind of gameplay in there. 
Hmm. Chat, what did I just say a second ago? <laughs> I'm having a grandpa moment. What the hell did I just say? There was some ending that I thought we hadn't seen. Oh, the capture one, yeah. Yeah, did we, did we try and capture but with the hero there? Yeah, that just leads to the true ending. I believe. But like, hold on, let me do capture and then... She has to tell her to go away and she has to be obedient. And then it should result in... Yeah, not resolute, and it should result in her being captured and us getting there? Hold on. You have to run away. Uh... Yeah, believe her... Hello? Hello? Oh, what, what? What the fuck just happened? What? Skip. What the hell was that? We were a believer. Yeah, uh huh, uh huh. Skip all this and. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, we already saw that one, whatever that was. Hmm. You want me to do a book stream? Yeah, we just fucking read a book to everybody? Yeah, welcome to my, welcome to my like, audio book channel where I read creepypastas. Oh yeah, is that what I said? I'm gonna start Psychonauts 2 and Mass Effect 3 tonight? Yeah, is that what I said? <laughs> I'm gonna start both of those games tonight? So wait, how do you... What happened in the... I wanted the... Captor thing to happen. He needs to be disloyal for the, pl the plotting to happen, for them to be outside to see her. Do we have to not trust her? No, if we trust her, yeah, we have to trust her and go back to the village with her. And then back her up, and then while we're backing her up, she runs off by herself. And then she- and then she gets captured by the underling. And then we- what the hell did I do wrong? To like, not have the capture ending happen. It's not possessive. Antisocial is the one that I want to make her leave, yeah? Does that tell her to get the fuck out of here? The hero not trusting is what gets her captured, is it? Okay, let me try that really quick. Is that what happens? I thought you had to trust her. She can't be trusted. Listen to this broad! Because if you don't trust her, she just gets burned to the stake. Yeah, no, that's not the one. Because you have to trust her, otherwise she gets murdered by the town. So then how do I... Yeah, and then if I make her not resolute, she'll leave without me. What the fuck did I do wrong? Flee like a coward. Believe her story. Uh-huh. Now what happens here? We head back, she runs off by herself, right? Yeah. She runs off by herself. Hero goes after her. The demons say they captured her. We murder bitches and come in. Why the fuck are you killing my soldiers? <laughs> oh. Oh, I forgot to get rid of Buddy. That's why I got conked on the back of the head. You have to be not disloyal. God damn it. Well, no, but, but if he's not disloyal, or I keep fucking it. If they're not disloyal, then the capture thing won't happen. Because they won't be outside? Oh, no, wait, no, because they can, they, can, they can pretend to be disloyal. And then once they're out there, they... Yeah, okay, hold on. Fuck. <laughs> fuck. Uh-huh. Believer story. What the fuck happened now? I, I'm so confused. We've already done that one, too, apparently. I guess the hero going there when the... I'm doing that again. <laughs> I'm doing that again. I'm going to go slow. I'm not going to hit skip. We're going to believe her? Uh-huh. Yaha, yaha, yaha. She runs off by herself. Yeah, now we go after her. And the building's just on fire. What the fuck? What is going on? How come they're not outside? I have to make them disloyal then for them to be outside, right? Am I going insane? If they aren't disloyal, the demons kill them. Yeah. But then, if they're disloyal... How come they're not waiting outside? What's... 
Oh, I have to make up a coward. But yeah, I, I do have to make up a coward. You're right. Sorry, I'm a dipshit. Oh, wait, no, because the coward's a se oh, Let's try that. The coward's a separate thing, isn't it? Believe her story. Uh huh. And then she goes there. And she goes there again. Maha, maha, maha. Yeah? Yeah, we're at the gates. She's being held in a dungeon. Why'd they lock her up? Don't know, Bob. We cut our way in here. We fight. And then we get knocked out again. What the fuck? I guess that just always happens? <laughs> I guess you just can't win there? Okay, so that's not, a, that's not an ending then. You can't win that fight. You always get conked on the back of the head. Hmm. I want to click on this so bad. <laughs> I want to click on this route thing so bad to see what the fuck we're missing. Hmm. Hmm. Da, da, da. What happens if we kill everything? Oh wait, how's that work? Let me try that. Skip this. I'm gonna kill these fuckers. Oh god, there we go. Hold on, go back. There we go. Hold on, wait, go back. Yeah? So we, we just killed the first group of monsters. On your way to the Overlord's castle, you spot a maiden heading back toward the village. She couldn't come from the Overlord's castle, could she? This may seem this may be the exact maiden you're currently seeking to rescue. You approach her with curiosity. And she runs from you for some reason. <laughs> you wonder what that's all about. But then you remember that you're covered in demon blood. Not wanting to look like you're a crazy person chasing after her or anything, you nonchalantly walk back toward town. <laughs> As you walk past the town square, you notice the whole village is crowded around. Is that the maiden you saw earlier? Wait, how did she get back here? Didn't she just what, what, what the? Didn't she just run back to the castle? Why is she here now? I'm so confused. Didn't she just run back to the castle? Whatever. <laughs> that wasn't a new ending. Hmm. Hmm. Murder the demons and then get killed by the overlord. I don't know if he can. Maybe. <laughs> she flash stepped. <laughs> Is that what happened? Here. Let's make her not obedient. That way she won't listen. Let's try that one. Here. Yeah, skip this. Kill these fuckers. Kill these fuckers. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. We make our way inside. We get here. We already tried this though, right? We ask what's going on, then she just kills us? She just tries to murder us, doesn't she? You don't know how to respond. She moves past you. Yeah. And then we say it's a big mistake. Yeah, we already, we already did this one, and she kills us. We did that one already. Fuck, my. Chat, my brain hurts. My brain's hurting. I'm thinking, and it's not working. Boop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What are two things that we haven't done as a hero yet? Hmm. Oh. Uh, what if we don't have the? I guess, Yeah. What if we just don't have the? Uh, what do you call it? We don't have the underling capture the maiden, and instead the underling kills the maiden. When we get there, will I do anything different? You yeah, run away. Uh, la, la, fucking... Wait, shit, what did I do? Oh, wait, fuck, I messed up. <laughs> wait, hold on, go back? Shit. <laughs> go back, yeah, let me go back really quick. Because you need to be obedient. Like, go back, there we go. We have to meet her on the way back, yeah? We meet her. We do, she can't be tr- yeah, we have to trust her, otherwise she goes back and dies immediately, yeah. Uh-huh. Then we head back to the village, she runs off by herself, and then she gets killed this time instead of captured. Does this change the ending at all? Probably not, I'm assuming. Oh. Wait. Oh shit, fuck, no, uh, to return, shit, what did that just say? <laughs> you valiantly dash after the maiden toward the Overlord's castle. But you were too late. Through the unguarded gates, you spot a group of demons surrounding a body 
The maiden? She was a fool to have rushed the demons after all. Your hero blood is boiling. You will avenge her death. You do the thing you just did earlier, blah! And then you die. <laughs> okay, well that was just another way to get that ending. Hmm. Also, yeah, what, what overlord stuff are we missing too? That's a good point. What, what kind of overlord shit are we missing? Na, na, na. Three of these. Any thoughts, chat? Any thoughts on combos we could be doing? To be figuring this jank shit out? I shouldn't say jank shit, but you know what I mean? I drank all my coffee. All my coffee juice. Wait, no, I didn't. So I'm in here. <laughs> I lied. I still have some coffee. Hold on. Can you skip the first demon fight and then kill the second one and then try to fight the overlord? You'll be too weak, maybe? We could try that. Uh, we have to make her not obedient then, that way she won't leave. So sure, we'll sneak past these ones. And then we kill these ones, you're saying? Yeah, cut through them? Kill them. Eat shit! Uh-huh. Now we're at the chambers, yeah. And now what, though? Can't say anything sinister happening. Do I try to kill her now? Like, I'm pretty sure I'm still just gonna kill her. <laughs> to, to, to destroy her? <laughs> you lunge forward and you kill her instantly. No. That was nothing new. Hmm. Hmm. The martyr one? Have we- have we seen her? Yeah, have we stabbed the maiden with the hero before and done the martyr thing? Did we do that one? Did we? Let's try that really quick, hold on. I don't fucking remember. Da ba da bum. Run past you. I'm gonna run past you. And then I try to kill her ass. Yeah, You lunge forward! Maiden gets in front of you, yeah? We already did this, yeah? Take a moment to recover from the shock. Why did you do that? Yeah, we did this already. Yeah, even with no- we snuck past everything, too. Even, so even sneaking past all the enemies... Like, yeah, sneaking past them and then, like, walking past the gate guards, you still kill her during this. Like, what the fuck? Yeah? <laughs> you still kill her? Okay. <laughs> Weird. Hmm. Da, da, da. Well, hold on, can we do that exact same thing, but with the, uh, Overlord, and then... We've already seen that happen, though, haven't we? Because then the hero just gets... Oh, wait. Do I have a nice day off? Go away. You can stay for a while, yeah? Stay for a bit. Oh god, here we go, here's something, wait. <laughs> yeah? You're interrupted by another human in your doorway. This time, it's a hero. Before we even know how to react, he makes his move, and the maiden makes hers. She's used her own body to shield you from the hero's blade, but... but why? But why has this happened? The maiden falls to the floor lifeless as a pool of blood beneath her grows. So does your rage. The hero has taken something precious from this world. You lose control, and the hero is obliterated. But your hatred for humans has not yet been sated. You go on to destroy them all, and become ruler of the entire world. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Vengeful overlord ending, okay. <laughs> well, there's a new one. Jesus. Fucking Christ. Also, yeah, that does make sense, because apparently the overlords are- like, well, well, I mean, I don't know. Hmm. Alright, well, that's the, that's the fucking overlord ruler of the entire world ending. Well, what if we do that now, though, and we don't have her be a martyr? Boop. Yeah, yeah, have a nice day. Uh, let's stay in chat for a minute. Let's go back. The hero strikes at you, yeah? Yeah? The hero suddenly strikes, cutting through you with his blade. He didn't even hesitate. Ah. You've gone soft. How... How could you have let your guard down like that? <laughs> how unfair. After all you've done... To avoid this outcome, you can't outrun your destiny. The hero always slays the overlord. You should have never trusted a human. 
You watch as a hero escorts the maiden out of your castle. C captured by a demon. At least she got what she came for. You join your army in eternal slumber. Slain Overlord ending. Okay, well, that's a new one. Am I just missing one for the Overlord now? Is that it? I didn't mean to click on that. Fuck. Yes. Bad ending. Yeah, I'm missing one for the Overlord and two for the hero. So what the fuck are we gonna do? <laughs> what are we doing, chat? <laughs> what are we doing? What, what stupid combo of bullshit haven't we done yet? It's probably one that we've already seen and we just don't- we, like, have, we just haven't seen it from a certain perspective yet. Probably save my game, you got it. I will indeed save my game. Alright. I'm trying to think, what is- are there any perspectives that we haven't seen with certain characters yet? We got the everybody burns alive at the end ending, we got the everyone burns alive at the ending and then watches the fucking underling die ending with everybody. We just saw the martyr ending with everybody. Hmm. <laughs> we can peek at the route for a second, yeah, can we? <laughs> Are you sure we can peek at the route really quick? You wanna do a little bit of cheating? <laughs> with the overlord? You, you, want, you want to see what the overlord's last route is that we haven't done? Fuck, I keep clicking on her on accident. When I want to look at the character routes, I click on the characters on accident. You gotta, you gotta go up here. Yeah? You, you want to check out the route and see what the last one is? You, are you sure? You don't want to try to figure it out yourself? You sure? Going once? <laughs> you could go in twice? Yeah? No? <laughs> Speak now, forever hold your peace? Before I click on it? We vote to check route, you got it. Alright, cool. What are we missing? It's up here somewhere. What the fuck is this? Overlord allows the maiden to stay in chat. The hero was dutiful. Heroic. Mark. So it's... The hero has to be dutiful, but then... Oh, so we have to have the, uh... Wait. So we have to have the hero be dutiful and, like, kill everybody on the way up to it, but then do the misunderstanding thing and then we kill the hero? Is that what this one is? Okay, yeah, we just have to kill the hero. That's all we're missing. Okay, that's a fucking simple one. Yeah, we have to make him not heroic, but make him dutiful, and we just gotta kill his ass. <laughs> yeah, we we earned a little bit of cheating, just just a little cheating for for you know for having the bullshit we had to go through. Yeah, stay a while. There we go. All right. You can't tell if she's into you or not. You notice the sounds of battle have started ringing throughout your castle halls. The maid is getting nervous, but you reassure her it's only one of your underlings' round roughhousing. No big deal. We got this one last time, by the way. I told you it was one that we already got. <laughs> I told you we were missing one that we already got in the last time. We just we just never re-got it. Okay, good. You know it's probably a hero, but you, you don't want to upset the maiden by telling her that. Your army will take care of it. It isn't long before the hero bursts into your room. But he, he should have made it here. What? Why didn't they stop him? The hero just stands there, unsure of himself. He's covered in demon blood. As the maiden speaks to him, trying to explain the situation, you move past the hero and out the door. You're not thinking clearly. Seeing your servants' bodies and pieces all strewn about your castle is really taking it out of you. The hero did this? There's so much blood. Why? Why did he come for the maiden? Did, did he think she needed rescuing? There was no one for here to save. There was never any harm meant to anybody. You were just talking to her. Why has it turned out like this? The hero starts babbling insincere apologies and excuses, realizing his wrongdoing, but... You're beyond hearing any of that bullshit. You've had it with these humans always murdering your servants for no reason. You can no longer hold yourself back. You lash out to the hero. When you regain control, there's nothing left of the hero, and the maiden has fled in terror. You're alone? Yeah, we got that one last time. <laughs> yeah, we got that one last time, and we just forgot to re-get it. Okay, cool, cool, nice. Cool, cool. Well, now all we're missing is two hero endings, yeah? Do we cheat again? <laughs> Do you want to cheat and look at the fucking routes again? To figure out what the two hero things we're missing are or not? Because is the hero ending one of the- is it just the one we just saw from the hero's perspective or no? Maybe? No, no, yeah, we did that one. Yeah, the, we did the big misunderstanding one already. So yeah, it's not that one. What are we missing? What ending are we fucking missing for the hero? There's two of them. Mm -mm. <laughs> okay, everyone's saying cheat. Okay, yeah, sure, fine. Everybody's saying cheat. It's not cheating. I mean, I wouldn't really call it cheating either. Because it's like right there for you, but like... 
It takes away the thinking part. Whatever, let's, let's figure it out. Hero, what are we missing? All right, so we have to go with the fleet from the demons. We have to be diplomatic and come inside. The underling needs to be hungry so the maiden doesn't exist. Okay, so, oh, we already got that one in the previous playthrough, I think. We just missed it? Yeah. So we just have to be diplomatic, but the underling ate the fucking... <laughs> but the underling ate the... Yeah. The underling eats the fucking thing. So run away. Yeah. Let me in. Yeah, we, we got this one last time. The Overlord is alone. You ask about the Maiden, but the Overlord does not seem to know what you're talking about. Was she really never here? You wonder what could have happened to her. The Overlord said that she wishes she could help you, but... You're the first human that's come here in forever. At least as far as she knows. You think of how you probably shouldn't trust her, seeing as she's a demon and all, but... You can't really prove if she's lying, either. You apologize for the intrusion and return home to your village. The Maiden was never found. Yeah, okay, we got that one last time. <laughs> Fuck. Just forgot to get here. We're missing one ending then, yeah? One singular ending is all we need. Is it one that we already got, do you think? So we have to go there. We have to be diplomatic. We have to get to the room where everything is fine. But then the Overlord has to be possessive. And then we kill the Overlord, I'm assuming? Yeah, the Overlord's possessive. One ending remains. Will it be good or bad? I don't know. I'm going to assume it's bad on account of... <laughs> We've already <laughs> probably seen it. Uh, okay, so you need to be possessive. Is that the only difference? You're just possessive? Oh, you can't be hungry. And then we just kill the... And you can't be a martyr, so then we just kill the... Yeah, hold on. Skip this. Uh, flew like a coward. Let me in. Yeah, ask what's going on in here. The maiden explains that they're just having a chat. And there's a little bit of gay stuff going on. But then the, but then the fucking overlord is like, Well, hold on, you can't leave. The maiden seems nervous. As a hero, it's your job to me mediate situations like these. You tell the overlord that if she doesn't let the two of you go, you'll have to assume that she's evil, and you'll vanquish her. You leave me no choice. The overlord pauses before suddenly jumping you. You're helpless as she disembowels you with her claws. How horrible. You came all this way only to be met with this cruel fate. You should have destroyed those evil creatures while you had a chance. Your dying wish is for the maiden to somehow make it out of this alive. Naive hero ending. There you go, it's all of them, hey! A letter flutters down from the curtain. You found lost letter number one. Neat! Cool, there we got all the we got all the endings. <laughs> Good. There, you wanna read the letters now, chat? You wanna read the letters? We'll do that. We'll check out the letters and read those. So, number one, you get it from the hero. Yeah? Congratulations, you've explored every path I had to offer. Thank you for playing. We didn't, though. There's still one more path, though, remember? <laughs> remember the... Remember the it can't end like this path? Well, hold on, here, let's read these letters first, yeah? Before we before we go do the it, it can't end like this pathway? Sure. We'll read them in order. Lost letter number one. My love, it just isn't fair at all, is it? For them to force us apart like this, it's unreasonable, cruel. I had to find an outlet for this grief somehow, so I decided to write, and I will keep writing until the day you find me once more, and then maybe we could write a story together. I'm waiting for that day. Forever yours. Tragedy. Who the fuck is tragedy? <laughs> Who the fuck is tragedy, yeah? Letter number two. My love, I've finally fulfilled the childhood dream of mine. Yes, that's right. I opened up my very own theater. You would be so proud. If, if, if you could only see it, I know how much it would have meant to you to be on my side on opening night. I'm sorry for going ahead without you, but I... I, I thought if my theater could just become world famous, then maybe you might just hear of it. Whatever you are, forever yours. Tragedy. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Number three. My love, I've been feeling a little depressed lately. Many patrons have come to my theater, but none so far have stayed to experience every single tale in this entirety. The critics haven't exactly been kind, but I understand. My stories aren't exactly crowd-pleasers. Despite that, you've always listened to the very end. I'm grateful for that. I hope to see you again soon. Forever yours. Tragedy. 
Uh huh. Yeah. No, 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 yeah. No one sticks around to watch all these, apparently. Number four. Here's the final one. Uh huh. Do you remember when we first met? I had just finished one of my scripts. What I was quite proud of, in fact. As I read it aloud, you happened to pass by. What a terrible ending! You said. Why would these poor fools have to die? You were so rude. You wouldn't accept any of my justifications, and, and yet... You managed to convince me. It really would be better if everyone could live in harmony. However unrealistic that that felt. I look back fondly on that day, even now. I wonder if... Somewhere... You're thinking of it, too. Forever yours. Tragedy. Yeah? Okay, well, we read the letters. You know what else, by the way, chat? It's 420. <laughs> it's 420 on the stream time, everybody. Make a wish. It's that time of night. We've been The stream's gone on for four hours and 20 minutes. Make a wish, everyone. Cool. Okay, well, we got one last thing we gotta do then. Yeah, we have to do the maiden's true ending. And then we have to do, and then we have to do the it can't end like this, right? So how do we do that? You have to be disloyal. Um, you have to be merciful. Anything else? Hold on, you have to be not dutiful, not a heroic. You wonder who the other person is? Yeah, what well, that, that that tragedy is sending the letters to? I don't know. Yeah, don't kill any demons. Don't kill the overlord. That's not gonna be applicable to this, but sure. Be diplomatic. Doesn't matter what she does, because we're gonna be playing as her. Underling has to just not murder. I mean, trusting won't actually affect this, but you will make them trusting, sure. Okay. There's the underling, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the underling just has to be disloyal, right? That way the, they end up in the final room, right? Yeah, because if they're not disloyal, they get killed. Right? Tyrant? I guess we can make a tyrant, sure. Yeah, it gets involved with the plot to kill the overlord, but they don't actually kill them, right? Is that what I have to do? Just make them disloyal? And that is that all I need for the underling, right? I believe? I think? Sure. We'll, we'll, we'll try that. Sure, let's, let's, let's get in here, yeah? Let's get in here. Enable femdom for the lord. No. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Introduce myself. Uh-huh. Oh, oh, now we're... Jesus. <laughs> it, it, just, it just rocketed straight to the end. <laughs> and now we only have one choice. We, we can't actually get off this menu. It can't end like this. It can't end, it can't end with everybody burning up in a fucking building. Yeah, it, it, it can't end that way. Right? What a lame ending, right? None of them are good? Not a single one of them are good endings? Nah. No, fuck that, though. F -f fuck that shit, yeah? Yeah, fuck that shit. You want to answer the maiden's prayers? You've, you've decided to find a way to save everybody. Oh, have I? By retracing... Sorry, but retracing the past you've seen so far, there doesn't seem to be any room to avoid a bad ending. Is there really nothing you can do to keep them all from getting killed in the end? I mean, is there? I mean, <laughs> hold on. Let me make a save really quick. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, fuck! I hate... I hate everything. Wait, load was the load button. Come back here. No, you come here. There we go. Yes, load my save. There we go. <laughs> uh-huh. If there's nothing you can do by acting from within their story, maybe there's time to take things into your own hands. Sorry, it's time to take things back into your own hands. Yeah? Yeah? Oh. All right. So, <laughs> the hero, the maiden... The underling and the overlord are all currently on fire. <laughs> Who's this? Who's this fella? Who's this? You are? Question mark? Who's this? Yeah? Yeah? Who's that? Let me take a sippy. Let me take a sippy of my water. Mmm. You have this spooky ass music? Alright, who the fuck is this? Boop. Oh no. <laughs> you boldly insert yourself into the story and use your incredible power to warp everybody to safety. You didn't know you could do that, but what's going on here? You take a moment to get a good look at yourself. You are... You, but why are you pitch black? You, you feel like this body doesn't accurately represent you. But you move past it. The hero, maiden, underling, and the overlord have been staring at you too. They look like they don't really know what you're supposed to be doing right now. You guess it's because you're usually the one that's guiding them. What will you say to them? 
Hi. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hey, chat, what do we do? What, do we just say hi? Or are we here to save them? What, what, what are we doing right now, chat? Do we just, do we just say hi? You want to say hi? This is you, chat. This is you right now. They got dropped into your chat. You're in the game, chat. What do you say to them? What, <laughs> what do you say? Close the game? No. You say hi. Let's say hi, guys. You smile awkwardly. Introduce yourself. The maiden is the first to respond. My prayers have been answered. You, you must be... Her god? No. You're merely the player. If there was any god here, they'd be the final boss. That's just how these role-playing games go. Now you realize what a real true ending must be. Hello? <laughs> Hello? Now, now, now. Enough of this. I admit, I've been encouraging you all along, but a self-insort sto story? How passe. You watch helplessly as tragedy descends from the heavens. You didn't honestly believe you were the only one who could force your way out of the stage, did you? <laughs> I'm the narrator, storyteller, god of this world. Call me tragedy if you would like. Darkness envelops your party. You didn't... Y you don't mind if I send them back to relive one of their many bad endings, right? You were alone in the darkness with me. Tragedy. I sincerely hope you've been enjoying your time in my theater. Though I can't abide you stealing the show without permission, it is quite disrespectful. Yeah? <laughs> what, what, that, what, what are we doing now, chat? <laughs> what are we doing now, chat? Are you sick of all the bad? You want to see something? What do you want? I mean, y'all were bitching about there being no good endings. Yeah? Or do you want to see something new? You want to see something new? We, we've seen all the other shit in the game. Is there something new we can see? Show me something. What do you got for me, Tragedy? Yeah, you got any cool shit for me? You got any cool shit? What are we doing, chat? No bad endings. Yeah, you don't want any more bad endings? Wanna click on that one? <laughs> You're sick of all of them? Are you sick of all the fucking bad endings? You don't like bad? Yeah, we don't like bad around here. Then, frankly, you should never have come to a place called a Bad End Theater. Haven't we already been over this? H haven't we? <laughs> you think defeating me might just be the only way to get a better ending. It's all there's left for you, isn't it? Hmm? Well, this does sound like it could be entertaining. Show me what you've got. It's, it's, time, it's time to fight God. It's time to fight God. Yeah? Bum, 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 bum. The stage is set for your final battle against me, the god of this world. What will you do? How will you fight against tragedy itself? I would love to see it. I mean, what do we? <laughs> are we gonna, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna, we gonna punch them? <laughs> are we gonna defend? <laughs> do we, do we punch them or defend, chat? <laughs> Make your decision. What do we do? I, I, I can't, I can't figure it out. I'm too indecisive, chat. What do we do? What do we do? <laughs> <laughs> you have two options. <laughs> uh, choose wisely. Choose very wisely, chat. Defend. You want to defend? Yeah. I've only seen defense, so we're we're, defend, we're fine, 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 we're fucking defending. Fight? Oh, hold on, we got fight and defend. <laughs> we, we are, we are, okay, fight? fight atta okay, now we have more attacks showing up now. We're, we're attacking. You try your best to tear me down, but you can't seem to do any damage. You don't truly exist in this world, after all. <laughs> oh, is that all? They'll never defeat me like that. Alright. <laughs> hold on, though. <laughs> I mean... What if we try it again, though? What if we try it again, though, chat? Or what, what, do we give in to despair? Do we say no? Do, do we go like, you know what, you're right, we can't win. Or do we try that shit again? What, what do we do? Do we try hitting him again? It didn't work the first time. Is it gonna work the second time, though? Hmm? Let me take a sippy. Mm. I'm gonna try again? Yeah? Oh, yeah, 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 everyone's saying try again, try again, then. Oh, wait. Oh, hold on, wait, we can, oh, we can... I, when it said try again, I thought it meant like attack again. No, we can actually pick. Do you want to try defense this time then, or do attack again? Do you want to try attack again, or do defense? Take a second turn, yeah? You can't just ask for a second turn. Defend? D defend? Yeah, we're, we're defending then, yeah? We're gonna do- uh, we're blocking? Okay, everyone's saying defending. <laughs> okay, good. 
You try closing off your heart to protect yourself, but it doesn't make you feel any better. Perhaps you don't understand just how outclassed you are here. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi, you okay? Behold, my beautifully tragic tales. Doesn't seeing all of them again make your heart ache? You witnessed all 41 of my painstakingly crafted endings. You must be some... Wait, what? You must be as much of a masochist as I am. Not only did I see all 41 of them, narrator asshole, I had to redo about 30 of them. <laughs> so yeah, fuck you. I commend your thoroughness. Surely these characters have a special place in your heart. They're still suffering backstage, you know. It's a shame they couldn't make it here. To the end of the world. That's right. You came here to save them. You can't do this alone. Yeah, oh. We have 41 HP, chat. <laughs> we got 41 HP. <laughs> On account of the 41 endings that we got. Tragedy here has infinite HP, though, yeah? How do we fight? D should we should we summon? Who, who we summon first? Should we summon the hero? The maiden? The, the fucking underling? Or the over over who we summoning first? Who we summoning, chat? Who we summoning? Call your friend. Bom, 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 bom. Bom, bom. <laughs> Big Undertale vibes, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> it's a bit undertale -y going on, yeah? You find the big old bad boss, you gotta get your friends to come. Overlord? Overlord? Overlord. Underlang. <laughs> Most people said Overlord. <laughs> We're doing Overlord first. All of them. Wow, thanks, chat member. You enter the Overlord's room, relieved to see that the fire contained... Wait, sorry, the fire is contained to the torches on the walls. When you close the door behind you, the Overlord rises from her slumber. Who are you? Have you come to reside in my castle and serve me? You explain that no, you're not here to serve her. It's more like you've come to do her a favor? You ask why she spends all day sleeping instead of commanding her demon army. She laughs and responds. <laughs> Many of my underlings certainly think I should be more aggressive with the humans, like my father before me. His quest for revenge was endless and self-perpetuating. There's a reason I had to destroy him. You can't help but think it's a little late in the game to, getting, <laughs> to be getting some new backstory. <laughs> uh-huh. I have no interest in waging war on the humans. I merely wish to be left alone, to live a peaceful, indulgent life in my castle. You realize that she actually may be very lonely, only surrounded by soldiers instead of friends. No wonder she gets so attached to the maiden. The true end for the Overlord suddenly becomes clear. You offer to change her fate. My own attempts at peace have never have been rather imperfect. If you offer a solution, then very well, I'll follow you. The Overlord will now fight alongside you. Neat! Cool. <laughs> and there she is. Good. I see, so this is tragedy. Ah, you brought the Overlord. I don't stand a chance now. You prevented me from attaining peace for long enough. Prepare to die. <laughs> oh, I hope you're prepared to face your deaths as well. Tragedy attached with a terrible fate. Sha sha sha! Yeah? <laughs> oh. Well, we took some damage. Well, now what do we do? Now what do we- Oh, we have, we have options now. Do, do we keep summoning people? Or should we do some attacks? We have brutality and ambition. <laughs> what do you think we need to do here, chat? Should we summon somebody? Should we summon somebody or do fucking brutality or ambition with the overlord? Because we can keep summoning if we want to. Or we can do an attack, yeah? What you want to do? Yeah, you want to summon some more? Who are we summoning then? Who are we going to summon? Also, hi, by the way. Hello, clown. Thank you for the raid. You you just raided me at the literal end of the game, so if you don't want to have this game spoiled for you, I'd probably recommend averting your eyeballs. <laughs> I'm literally at the very end of this video game right now. <laughs> Thanks for the raid, though. I appreciate it. Oh, God. Oh, you want to summon someone? Who are we summoning then, yeah? Summon the underling? Underling. Underling. We're, we're, we're doing... We're gonna do underling, yeah? We'll summon the underling next. You approach the gates of the Overlord's castle. The underling is on guard duty, as you'd expect. Uh-huh. They call out to you. The other demon guard is sound asleep. Heh, <laughs> hey, you're a pretty weird looking intruder. What do you want? You explain that, no, you're not an intruder, although you're definitely intruding into their story right now. You tell the underling you've come to save them from tragedy. Oh, okay, yeah. Try saving me from boredom first. I hate this job. The underling snickers. You ask what kind of job they'd rather have. Eh, you know, it'd be best if I didn't have to work at all. I just want to live a carefree life. Never been bossed around. Not, not, you know, never getting bossed around and picked on. 
You think of the underlings' friends, who had bullied them into, assassination, into an assassination plot only to betray them in the end. If they kept better company, maybe they wouldn't feel so restless. A true ending for the underlings suddenly becomes clear. You offer to change their fate. So there's a way to wait that work that can be fun? Sounds fake, but I'll take along with you in just in case. The underling will now fight alongside you. Cool. Cool. <laughs> wait, what the fuck? You didn't say nothing about a boss battle. <laughs> uh huh. The underling, hmm? You must be desperate to call such an unreliable ally. Ha! <laughs> if I beat this guy up, all my problems will be over. Oh, but it won't be that easy. Tragedy attached with a terrible fate. Again. We take it some damage. <laughs> uh-huh. We still got like 34 HP left, it's fine. You wanna keep summoning now, or do you wanna like do a move? <laughs> chat, what are, we, what are we doing, chat? We, we have multiple moves at our disposal now. Work is the poop. Work is indeed the poop. If you don't like it, just leave. We can summon. We have the hero and the maiden. We can still summon, or we can do an attack of some sort. So some ability. Summon ma maiden. Ma okay, some maiden. <laughs> Y'all want to summon the maiden? Okay, fine. <laughs> we'll summon the fucking maiden. <laughs> you happen to find a maiden as she exits the church. Her heart is set on meeting a demon. Perfect timing. She approaches you, having already taken notice of your odd form. <gasps> Excuse me, are you a traveler? I've never seen anyone like you before. You explain that no, you were not a traveler. Well, maybe you are in a sense. You have come all this way. The maiden regards you with excited curiosity. Then perhaps you might be a demon? I was hoping to be one today. You think of all the terrible fates that hope would bring about. She is the catalyst for the story, after all. My role as a maiden is to be captured by an overlord, but you see, I've grown so tired of waiting. You remember this part. She wanted to understand her role better, and so... You ask what it is she's really hoping to gain from all this. The maiden is confused by your question. Perhaps it was as simple as wanting to reach the place she felt like she belonged. The true end for this maiden suddenly becomes clear. You offer to change her fate. Is there something I can do to find fulfillment? Please guide me! The maiden will now fight alongside you. Yeah? Uh-huh. <laughs> what is this terrible creature? You wound me! Dear maiden, is tragedy really such a terrible thing to behold? I remember now. I remember all the awful things you put us through. Then this should be familiar to you as well. Tragedy attacked with a terrible fate. Yeah? Who's getting murdered now? Yeah? <laughs> okay, good. We're taking like- we're not really taking that much damage. Cool. And now, I mean, do I even have to bother asking, chat? What if we just don't summon the hero? <laughs> what if we just don't summon the hero? <laughs> that would be really funny. That would be really fucking funny. Oh, God. Now don't summon the hero yet. <laughs> just, let's just not summon the hero. <laughs> oh, God. Solve it. Okay, fine. We'll fucking... Oh, now we'll... oh you want to run? You want to escape? You... I mean, I can escape. You want me to leave? I can just click on this button and leave. Oh, <laughs> Oh, Tragedy, the narrator, storyteller, and god of this world. Neat. Okay, fine, we'll summon the fucking hero. You find the hero in his home, hunched over a sewing table. Your sudden intrusion scares the hell out of the poor guy. Oh, 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 are you some kind of demon? Can you explain that? No, you're not a demon. You're... How can you explain it in a way that a hero will understand? <laughs> Instead, you ask what he's sewing. Oh, this? I craft all my own gear. You sense his pride in his hobby. You wonder if the costumes are what attracted him to the role of hero. Would you like some clothes? You don't seem to be wearing any. You remember the state of your body and decide that yes, some clothes from the hero would be nice. He is overjoyed by your answer. Apparently his outfits are too gaudy for the other townsfolk. Nobody wants them. The true end for the hero suddenly becomes clear. We offer. Sorry, you offer to change his fate. I can make a living as a tailor rather than a hero? P please tell me what I can do to reach that dream! The hero will now fight alongside you. There they are. I agree to follow you, but I did not expect to face something like this. The hero has arrived! We really couldn't have a final boss battle without him! You're the one who's been killing us, murderer! I can't truly call myself a hero until I see you defeated! We'll see about that. Tragedy attacked with a terrible fate. Good. Yeah, yeah, I'm streaming naked right now, chat. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing. I have no clothes on. <laughs> Good. <laughs> now that the whole party's here, can you solve my final puzzle? Which combination of behaviors will open the path to your true ending? Show me! 
All right. Yeah, we got, we got a puzzle now, chat. What do we do? <laughs> what, what combination of abilities is going to get us to win this fight? What do we got to do, chat? What have you learned? What, what have we learned throughout this stupid playthrough? What do we do? What do you think the hero has to do? Do you think willpower or justice will help us get through this? Huh? What, 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 what do we got to do, chat? <laughs> Brutality, yeah. <laughs> we we, we want to just beat the fuck out of the fucking tragedy? <laughs> well, here, let's start with the hero. Let's start. What, what, do you, what do you think we need from the hero? We can't pick both of them. We have to pick one. Do you think we should do willpower? Or justice? Willpower? Justice. Willpower? Justice. Willpower? Justice. Willpower? 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 There's no kiss option. Stop it. We can't kiss them. Okay, willpower. Everybody's saying willpower. Boop. Your reign of terror ends here, tragedy. I refuse to give in. The hero uses willpower to overcome the tragedy. Bonk. Tragedy is reeling. Good. Well, that worked. Now, what's the maiden got to do? Does the maiden have to hope? <laughs> must the maiden hope? Or must the maiden use kindness to win? What, what, do, we, <laughs> what do we do? What does, the, what does the maiden have to do, chat? Kiss? There's no kiss option. Stop. There's no smooch option either. Hmm. You thinking we got a hope, yeah? You think we got a hope? Kindness? Uh-oh. Oh, hold on, we're getting split. <laughs> do, do, we, do we gotta hope or... Do we, do, what do we have to do, chat? What do we gotta do? It's it's like 50-50 fucking split between hope and kindness. Yeah? <laughs> oh? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, now hope is winning, yeah? But you wanna do hope? You you wanna do hope? Kindness? <laughs> Fuck, it's, it's just 50-50 split. You gotta pick one. Do I gotta fucking flip a coin again? Do, do, I, do I have to grab the fucking Lugia coin again and flip it? I'll pick one. Ask Lugia. Okay, I'm gonna ask Lugia. Now, here's the problem. Where did I put my Lugia coin? <laughs> where, did, where did I put the... Fuck. Where did I put my Lugia coin? Here, if you come to a decision before I get my Lugia coin, I'll pick that one instead. I don't know why the hell you would know this, but where'd it go? Did I not put it back in the cup? Shit. Lugia? Lugia, where'd you go? Lugia? Chad, I can't find my Lugia coin. Hope? Pope. People are just shouting. <laughs> People are just shouting hope and kindness in chat. Oh, here it is. I put it over here. I put it over there. I found it. I found it. Alright. I'm gonna flip a coin. Y'all fuckers can't choose anything, apparently, so I'm gonna flip a coin. We're gonna let fate decide, yeah? We're, we're gonna let fucking- we're, we're gonna let fate and fucking all this other bullshit, yeah? Here we go! Oh, shit, I dropped it. <laughs> oh, I dropped it? Boing! What do you got? Alright, chat, if it's heads, we're doing kindness. If it's hope, we're doing tails. Alright? What do we get? We got tails again. <laughs> we, we, we have once again flipped tails, chat. So that means we're going with hope. We're doing hope, everybody. Uh-oh. Let's click on the old hope button. Oh, God. Let's see. Let's do a little bit of hoping. Our true endings do exist. They, they simply must. The maiden hopes with all of her heart to overcome tragedy. Bonk. Tragedy is reeling. Well, it worked, apparently. <laughs> apparently hope worked, everyone. Yeah? It worked? It fucking worked? Good. Now what do we do with the underlying? Do we do mischief or tenacity? Hmm? Hmm? What do we do? What's, what's this little fucker gotta do? Do, or do, we, do, we, do, we, do we do a little bit of mischief? Do a little bit of tenacity? Tenacity. Tenacity? Everyone's saying tenacity? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody's saying tenacity. <laughs> yeah, that one's kind of fucking obvious, isn't it? Tenacity. Knock me down, I'll just come back stronger! The underling uses their tenacity to overcome tragedy. Boink. Tragedy is once again reeling. Good. And now, the overlord. Do we do we, do we use ambition or brutality? <laughs> this one's... Yeah. Gee, I wonder. Gee, I fucking wonder, hmm? Don't say fart. There, there's no fart option. The overlord just fucking rips ass and destroys tragedy. The end. The fucking end. Ambition. <laughs> ambition, yeah. <laughs> ambition? Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll do ambition. Boop! I'll reach my true ending with my own power. 
the Overlord uses her ambitious nature to overcome tragedy. This is it. With everyone's hearts united, you take aim towards the best possible future. Yeah, cool! You want to unleash one final attack to destroy tragedy once and for all. You did it, chat. You did it, chat. <laughs> you, you've done it! You've, you've managed to defeat me! A tragic ending for tragedy itself! Oh, I love it! I must thank you all for fulfilling your roles perfectly. <laughs> Good. Thank you, hero! The hero. Yeah, as himself, starring the hero. Starring the maiden as herself. Thank you, maiden! Starring the underling as themselves. Thank you, underling! Starring the overlord as herself. Thank you, overlord! Enough of this nonsense! We defeated you, so die already! Uh, don't worry, I'll be making my exit shortly. And finally, <laughs> directed by you. That's you, chat. <laughs> There's you! Finally, thank you most of all. We couldn't have made it here without you. Yes, my bad end theater did contain a truly good ending after all. I apologize for antagonizing you for so long. I wanted to deliver a satisfying story. Was I able to do it? I wonder. Are we satisfied, chat? Are, are we satisfied? <laughs> are we, I mean... I, I mean, I, I'm, pre I, I, I'm pretty satisfied. Not really. <laughs> no, you're not really satisfied. Fuck. <laughs> no? No, uh-oh. Chat saying no. Uh-oh. Fuck. You wish you looked like the Overlord. You want to look You want to look like the Overlord? Good. No, every <laughs> you're never satisfied. Okay, I, sorry. I, re I regret to inform you. <laughs> I regret to inform you. Tragedy. D d Chad is not satisfied. Ellipses. Save? You, you, no, you, you all motherfucker. I already clicked on it. You, you can't tell me to save. Okay, fine. I'll go back. <laughs> fine. <laughs> fine, I'll save. God. Oh, fuck it. Oh, but I can't save. Oh. Oh, I, no, no. We're, we're stuck with this. We can't save. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, you guys pick no. So guess what we're doing? You fuckers pick no. Uh-oh. Well, I... I did my best. <laughs> Happy ending shouldn't always come easily. Reality is... Not so kind. But you've earned this one. Here's your true ending. There. There you go, everybody. And that's bad end theater. <laughs> it was good. Yeah? Good? Look at this cute little art we get here now. Yeah, look. It's fucking the, the, the hero becomes a tailor. It's good. It's really good, though. This is a, it was a fun little quick short game. It took like an extra like 40 minutes. Oh. Look at them up there. They became a fashion model. Look at them. Look, guys, the gay stuff happened, I told you. But yeah, good. <laughs> this is good. And we got the true ending, by the way. We, we did all this shit and we got the true ending. It was good. We did everything. Where's the kiss thing? Don't worry about it. Good. And there's your true end, chat. <laughs> there you go. There you go, we did it. We did it, we beat the game. We, we got the true ending and everything. Well, hold on, though. <laughs> did, did we truly do everything, though? <laughs> did we... Did we... Did we truly do everything, though? Something's missing, right? Like, there's something, there's something weird about this, right? 
What, what what about all the what about those fucking letters that we found? What was up with that? What was up with all the stupid fucking letters that we found that had no goddamn resolution to them? So, something weird about that one, right? The, yeah, ho, ho, hold on a minute, penis. No, ho, hold on a minute. Something, something's missing. Yeah, where's the kiss at? Oh, I, ellipses. Hello, I can't save. Uh oh, <laughs> something's missing. We're not gonna do the sex dungeon ending. Stop! It's, it's, it's not happening. Ellipses. Oh, you're still here? The curtains close for the final time. I'm shutting down my theater. There are no more tragedies left for me to tell, after all. Yeah, I mean, there's one more. What, what about you? <laughs> What's up with you? Why? What, what's your story? What do we do, chat? What do we do? Yeah. Uh, do, do, should we ask him about their story? You, you want to know about them? Y y yeah? Hmm? The broom closet ending. Yeah, we're, we're going to end up in the broom closet. Yeah, what's your story? <laughs> yeah, what's, what's your story, bestie? <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's a good way to ask it. Me? You'd like to know why I started this theater? <laughs> Be because I'm obsessed with bad endings, of course. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah? Let us remove the mask, shall we? You gently raise your fingers to the cracks of my mask. Piece by piece, it falls apart into your hands. Revealing... <gasps> oh, blah, 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 blah. Who's that? <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> blah, 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 blah. I should have warned you, this... It might affect what you think of my stories. I can't help but compare my face to the Maiden's. I'm not her, but it's not like she isn't me, necessarily. That's how it is with fiction. Would you like to hear... Not another ending, but... Th the truth? Yeah, sure. Sure, tell me the truth. Why are you the Maiden? <laughs> oh, Bubba? Why, why are you the Maiden? Alright, one last story. You may already know this, but it doesn't have a happy ending. First, I'll, I'll set the stage. In this world, is kill the beat. No. <laughs> In this world, there's no such things as demons or even heroes, really. There was a girl eager to set out to fulfill some sort of destiny, but uh, that, that 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 part's true. She met someone, another girl. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a running theme, isn't it? Yeah, like like, like the Maiden and, and the Overlord. The two were inseparable, and for a time, everything was just wonderful. But their families, their communities they came from, neither would approve of their relationship. That's just the reality for many. This pair was no different. Despite their best efforts, the world was intent on pulling them apart. She... No... We... We used to like those types of stories, where love conquers all. Where the strength of your love will pull you through any hardship and all that bullshit. Like, like everything's okay in the end. I, I lost her. And then I started this theater. Y yeah but this story... <laughs> does have a happy ending. Yeah, does it? Does the story have a happy ending, chat? D does, does it have a happy ending? Are you, sh are, are you sure? <laughs> Do you think it does? Is it gonna have a happy ending, everybody? Should, 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 yeah? <laughs> that does it? Does it actually? Sure, why not? Are you sure? Are, are, are you sure we should give this fucker a happy ending? You know, we're sure. It, do it does have a happy ending. Boop. Huh? Oh, uh, 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 I was hoping to find you. It, it's it's you. It's been so long. I thought I'd never see you again. You always think of the worst endings. I wasn't about to give up just because things got difficult. Why didn't you reveal yourself sooner? I feel like such a fool. I could say the same to you. You knew I could never resist giving your stories a happy ending. So of course... I would be drawn to a place like this. Y y yes, but but I, I didn't think it would actually work. <laughs> I 
S sometimes everything does turn out okay in the end. Thank you for reminding me of that. I love you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love you too. Good. Now, truly, everyone can live happily ever after. And there's Tragedy's End, everybody. <laughs> that was the one last ending we were missing. It was Tragedy's End. You know, the fucker in charge of the whole goddamn place? There you go. Good. Good, good, good. Why is that an e why is that an emote on Twitch? You're right. It's just a, it's a fall guy being trapped behind bars. <laughs> Sorry to ruin the fucking moment, but there's the <laughs> cool, cool fucking Twitch emote. Twitch. It's a fall guy being trapped behind bars. Anyway, that's tragedy's end. Happy Pride, everybody. Oh, and that's it. By the way, that that's the entire game. Yeah. Now we're actually done. That that that's bad end theater. It's closed. Look at that. It's closed. It ain't open no more. We're, we're, we're winner. We complete game. We 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 completed game. Ah, oh, <laughs> you were looking for lesbian love and you found it. Yeah, <laughs> good. Yeah, happy birthday, gay people. <laughs> happy birthday, gay people. Uh, cool. Well, it says it's closed though. What if I go in there anyway though? There's nothing more to see, my love, but if you would like to reset... If you really want to experience everything all over again, I mean, I'm happy to oblige. Shall we begin the resetting process? Yeah, cool! No, I'm good. I don't want to reset. We, no, we, we just beat the whole game. We're done. I, I'm good. <laughs> okay, you're so fickle. Just let me know if you change your mind. Good. And that's it. That's bad end theater, everybody. Yeah, good? Good, I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> yeah, I, I told you we'd get the whole game done in one stream. It's not a it's not a very incredibly long one. I'm not gonna reset the game, don't worry. <laughs> God. Good. Uh I liked it though, it was good, yeah. Did you enjoy it? I hope you all enjoyed it. I, th I thought it was a real cute game. I don't typically stream games like this on the channel, but I, I I watched some people play this like a couple of weeks ago, and I liked it a lot. And I was like, fuck it. I think it'll make for a good, fun, quick stream that we can do on the weekend one of these days. I liked it. It was good. The, re the real treasure was the gaze we made along the way, yeah? <laughs> good. Oh, dear fucking god. It's good, though. Also, apparently this developer's, like, making more games. I don't know what the hell... They're working on something new. I, I saw on their YouTube channel they're making some other game, apparently, already. And I'm looking forward to it. I'll try it. <laughs> we already reset the game once. You know what we did? You're right. <laughs> we did reset the game once on accident. Yeah, because my fucking controller messed up. And then my game crashed. What are we saying wait for? Na, 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 na. Yeah, what, what are you saying wait for, chat member? You, what, what do you want me to do? What? <laughs> what do you want me before to exit the game? What do you want me to do, chat member? about the first coin flip because I knew about the ending? I didn't know <laughs> that that first coin flip actually did land on Tails. I, I was going to let you fuckers do that. I was going to let you go into the finale without... So, about that. If you go into the finale part, like the true ending, without having seen all the other endings, it, go, it, it goes the same way, but you don't have enough HP, and you'll you'll die. Unless you do have enough HP. Because you, you, we only took, like, what, like 10 damage from that fight? If, if, if even that... So, like, as long as you have enough endings to, like, survive the fight, you can still win. But you don't get the actual, that whole little final segment there where, the, where, where Tragedy takes off their mask and you see who they are. That, that whole part doesn't happen. You have, to get all the, you have to get all the endings and read all the letters. And then you have to beat the game. And then you unlock the final true bullshit ending thing. So we could have done that, but we, we flipped tails. <laughs> you flipped tails. Are you glad that you flipped tails? Otherwise, that would have been, like, kind of... I wouldn't really say spoiled for you, but... But yeah, it was good. That'll be it, though. Th that'll be it for fucking Vigi game. Na, 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 na. Goodbye. Goodbye. That was a good game, though. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. I did. It was fun. It was a quick little one-stream game. Um, what do you call it, though? Um, if you missed some other streams, though, like any other streams of mine, or if you're looking for something else to watch, period, you can check out the YouTube channel. It's the same as the Twitch name. It's just Ojaxer. I use the same username pretty much everywhere. Uh, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Discord, etc., etc. All those places on the internet. 
Ojex or hi, that's me. If you're watching on YouTube right now, there are links to the Twitch. If you're watching on Twitch right now, there are links to the YouTube. And if you're watching on either of them currently, there are links to the Discord. You can join that. You can get notified whenever I go live. You can send me suggestions for games you want to see me play or mods of games you want to see me play. Cool? All right. So, yeah, t today was Bad Dan Theater. We got that all done in one sitting. Um, tomorrow, on Sunday, we're probably going to do another Skyrim stream, maybe? I'm not sure. I'm probably going to do Skyrim tomorrow, but maybe we'll do something else. And then, uh, what do you call it? And then on Monday, yeah, we somebody in chat just asked if we started Mass Effect 3. We are, yeah. We're, we're going to be starting Mass Effect 3 on Monday. That'll be good. We'll be getting into that. And then for and then for a while, we're just going to be doing Mass Effect 3 and Skyrim. And then whenever Mass Effect 3 is done, we'll start Pikmin 3. And we'll probably still be streaming Skyrim. Because <laughs> that game never fucking ends. Uh, but yeah, but that's why I've been trying to stream a bunch of like shorter games lately. Because it's fun. I, I like doing the one-off streams. They're good. That'll be it, though. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. And as always, have a good day. Have a good night. Have a good whatever time of day it might be for you when you're watching this. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.
the game was really cute. 